Mina-san! Welcome one and all, fine art connoisseurs. They've arrived. They're among us. Hello. How do I super chat in the first? We'll get there. We'll get there. Hi, everybody. Hello, hello, hello. Good morning, one and all. I was playing... I was playing Mario Kart all morning. <laughs> all morning. Yup, I finished all the tracks. Um, and I've been watching a lot of videos on how to on how to get good. Um, so yeah, it's it's going good. I did see Bay and Iris duke it out. I'm not gonna lie, Deadbeats. I want in on that action. I want a little piece. I'm not gonna lie, I, I want a piece of that action. Um, but you know, good things come to those who wait, I guess, so we'll we'll see how it goes, but for now for now. Oh, <laughs> what's that? Is that Mario Kart back? Just don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Um, don't worry about it. It's, <laughs> no, if, maybe we can play some, was I able to sleep better? Yes. The night previous, I got four hours of sleep. Last night, I got six hours of sleep. So we're getting there. We're getting closer uh, to the goal. Um, I want to play more Mario Kart. Yeah, Mario Kart. Mario Kart, you mean. Um, we, we could actually, theoretically, we could play some a little bit later in the same stream because there are no other games involved. And Super Chat reading, I think I also want to include this here. I'm just going to stream for a long time today. I hope you guys are excited for that. Long time of streaming. That, that feeling when four hours of sleep is normal? Maybe for Kyla. I'm sure that she can relate to you, but... Anyway, um, this is my first time doing this kind of thing, so we're really kind of just testing the waters, so to speak, you know? Um, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I don't know if I'll do a ton today. I'll try to do as many as I can. And when I say about five minutes per drawing, um, we all know that that's actually going to be, it's going to be more like ten. <laughs> um, but that's okay. That's okay. We saw it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Um, I don't know why I'm quiet these days. The Go XLR is just really... It's not the meta anymore. Um, uh, uh, uh. Yeah, but I'm gonna have to turn up the gate a little bit. Check. One, two. Okay, it says it's too loud now. Alright, one second. Um, no, it should be fine. It should be fine. In fact, if anything, I'm gonna turn the gate down. <laughs> Go XLR hate! Hate. Yeah. It's not the meta anymore. You know, when I started when I started this, everybody was using the Go XLR. Oh, this is the best thing ever. It's it's the way. This is the audio way for being a streamer. Now I'm kinda like, uh, maybe it's time to move on to greener pastures. I don't know. Um I don't think it's a driver problem. I, I don't think I don't think they're even updating it anymore, to be fair. But anyway, <laughs> Xbox Live headset could be the new meta. Who could say? Eh, the times are changing a bit. Um, so anyway, let me see. In the back, I just want to put a little bit of like a background here because the chat's there right now. It probably won't matter much, but just so it can be read a little bit easier. Today, you guys, we're doing drawings for deadbeats, as in, um, I suppose I should do a little bit of explaining for those that haven't been around the past couple of days uh, to hear the explanation, but basically, um, I'm, I'm getting like a really amazing, incredible, insane, animated thing. It's, it's an MV, it's an MV. And it, it's gonna cost a lot of money. And because of that, I've decided, well, why not go back to the old ways of opening commissions? Um, and so, yeah, because it's expensive, I've decided to take fate into my own hands, and I'm going to be doing commissions again, kind of like back in the day when I used to draw commissions for a living. It's like I'm returning to my grassroots. So, <laughs> the good old days. So, the Grim Reaper is now not just going to be a live streamer, but also an artist that you can commission. But um, if you read the description, you'll see the rates are kind of high. 
Um, the reason being, well, the rates of animation are also high. So I gotta do what I gotta do. Um, there are some rules to keep in mind though, and they're really important, so please read the description because the last thing that I want um, is you making a request and me being unable to draw it. So, please recreate the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel in full detail but holo themed. I will donate zero dollars for this. Big Boss, I think it's gonna be a little bit difficult. It's a tough request uh, to follow. <laughs> and it's gonna need a lot of reference. Let me get my reference area open as well. Because we're gonna need references. References galore. <laughs> Go make Outer Haven. <laughs> what are you doing here, Big Boss? Um, anyway, so that's what's up. I'll pitch in for that, yay. <laughs> to the zero dollars, how much will you be investing? You know, the artwork could be worth a lot in the future, but let's quickly go over the rules while people file in and, um, and get ready. Um, so, let's see. Why not use a different site for commission payments so you don't lose 65% of the money? I'm not allowed to. <laughs> so, let's just, let's just work. Let's just work with it. Let's just work with what we have. It says in the description that you will only draw holo members with people they collabed with. Does this apply to you, or it's completely at your discretion regardless of the collabs? So this seems, so this is a little bit of like a tricky rule. Um, I just want to have respect for, for all of my whole, my, uh, ba -ba 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 my fellow holo members, um, because, you know, maybe, maybe people don't know each other, and it's like, maybe they don't, they don't give me, they haven't given me permission to draw them with everyone. So, because of that, I need to, I need to be careful what I draw because it would take a long time if I sat here and I was in Discord messaging everybody, hey, can I draw you with this person? Can I draw you with this person? It would take too much time. Um, I know that I would want people to respect that for me. And when it comes to me, um, I don't really care. That will also be up to my discretion. Even if I haven't collabed with them, I'm, I'm pretty open um, to, to different, like, suggestions and whatnot. Just make everyone yeah. <laughs> Yeah, go. That's a good request. Or that one in there. Yeah. Mm -hmm -hmm. So, are past members who aren't here anymore allowed or not? I would say if you go, if you go to the whole live production site and you click on the talent button and you look at the talent that are listed there, I can say with certainty I am allowed to draw them. Um, if it says like alum, etc. That's fine. Um, just to be, just to be extra careful. So they have to be like alum or something like that. Mm. So keep that in mind, please. Uh, additionally, so um, but yeah, at the end of the day, all requests are pretty much up to my discretion, and um, I may not give a reason why I say, oh, can I get like a different request? There may be various reasons, but I, I probably I may not give one. So just keep that in mind. Um, I know that that restricts it a lot, but you know, there are restrictions, especially here in Holo, but what we do is we make the most with what we can do, right? That's a really important thing, I think, <laughs> for, for being in Holo. We make the most with what we, what we are able to make, even with restrictions in place. Um, so yeah, but we'll figure it out though, I, I'm sure. Um, so let me quickly read the rules so we're all on the same page. Mm for people that maybe uh, don't know how to read or don't know where the description is. Yeah, all right. So, please read. Rules for commissioning. One red super chat is equal to one quick doodle. It's about five minutes, but we know that that's, it's gonna, it's gonna be longer than that. Um, but I'm going to try to get them within that time. Um, and uh, please include like the name that you want signed on there because I'll write your name and then I will also sign it as well because you know artists got to leave their artist signature. So include your name and the request in the super chat, okay? Um, as a little aside, having like two options for me to draw would also be very nice. It would help me out a lot. Um, next, the request must be either holo related or not include copyrighted content and characters. Um, if you want me to draw, for example, Steamboat Willie, I, I can, um, but 
you know, just try and we'll try and figure it out together. Oh, can I draw this or not, etc. Um, <laughs> Steamboat Cali. <laughs> yeah, um, that version of Mickey is not copyrighted. Um, it's public domain. But I'm gonna I'm gonna need a minute to collect my references and look things up, I guess. Uh, so that that won't cut into the time period of me drawing it. It's just gonna. It's going to contribute to it, I suppose. Um, are you sure? I'm sure. I will look it up. Don't worry. All right. Um, let's see. <laughs> I lost my place. Just use your better judgment. We may be testing the boundaries, but always know that I will err on the side of caution. I have to. Death's gotta be careful. Erring on the side of caution is the best. Hmm. Let's see. Um, requests will be drawn in the order they are received, and I will close the super chats when there are too many. Um, I'm nervous. I'll leave them open in, in bursts, you guys. So I'll open them. People can send in the requests, and then I'll close them. 20-ish seconds in, just because I, I know that, that some countries need verification, so it's it's a little tough. Ordinarily, I'd do 10. Um, we'll see. Now, um, if requesting Hololive members, keep in mind I will only draw them with people they've collaborated with or interacted with in the past, as a general rule, and it will be up to my discretion. Um, at the end of the day, I will kind of make the choice, oh, um, maybe we can draw something else instead of this, etc. Um, so just keep that in mind. At the end of the day, I, I may just kind of not want to draw it, it's cool, though, because surely we can find something that you'll want me to draw. Um, absolutely no yabai <laughs> allowed. I keep it PG if it's other holo members, and then for me, PG-13 is fine. Um, I have the right to refuse to draw your request and not refund the super chat if it's inflammatory or in poor taste. Um, we aren't dummies, and I'm, I may be dumb, but I'm not stupid. Um, and so I will be <laughs> using my discretion. If it's very clearly in poor taste, I'm just going to ignore it and not even read it. Um, and you will not get a refund on that. <laughs> Furry Cali no-go. I mean, it doesn't seem to violate the rules. But, um... Uh, you're going to have to define the difference between PG and PG-13 for those of us with a different rating system. Um... I probably will. It'll be case by case. Um, if you've given something of a, a PG-13-esque request because you think it's PG, I will probably provide a way to, to kind of get the rating down, if that makes any sense. Um, now let's see. Uh, if it seems that you aren't trying to be rude or mean, um, but I'm not comfortable drawing it, I will ask for a second option. Uh, including multiple options for me to draw in the initial message is recommended. Um, and then finally, please let others have a chance and don't ask for two in one stream. Okay? Um, please, one per person per stream so that, that people can have a chance. Okay? Yeah. Mm. Artist is the judge, jury, and executioner here in this art gallery. You're gonna have to put your faith in me, okay? Um, additionally, Super Chats are gonna open during the stream on my mark and I will count it down, okay? Um, I'll probably open them and close them a few times in bursts, unless we just get so many the first time that maybe we can only do it one more time again later. Um, we'll see, we'll see. This is the first time doing this, so we're testing the waters together. Yeah, see, for example, here's a really good example. Callie and Gura's outfit or something like that, you know? Like, I think that that's, that's kind of within the realm of, of what I'm hoping we can go for. You know? Um, to give, like, an example. Or, like, um, I don't know, Bibu and Mori having tea together. You know, cute little things like that. Um, if we get too crazy, I'll probably choose the safer option. You know, let's keep it, like, light and fun and, and positive. Though Mori with a gun kind of sounds cool. I don't know. <laughs> a very specific gun that I'll have to look up a picture of. Um, 
like that's fine. But if it involves other people, please try to keep it more within the realm of so-and-so wearing so-and-so's outfit, these two going on vacation together, these two um, hanging out and playing ping pong together, um, so-and-so in a swimsuit, you know. But also keep in mind that it's a short doodle. So if it's, the more complicated the request is, the simpler the figure is going to be, okay? <laughs> oh yeah, and football. That's kind of cool. Hand-holding prohibited. Yeah, that's kind of... We're getting kind of in R-rated territory there. I don't know. Um, scythe gun sounds cool. Might take a second to design, but... Anyway. Hmm. <laughs> I'll try to have that. Me in an AC. <laughs> That'll be interesting. That would be an interesting one. Again, just use your better judgment, but I will do my best. Adapt, improvise, overcome. I'm going to adapt. Um, and then lastly, please remember this. When I open the Super Chats, Super Chats as a whole are not going to be read from this stream, regardless of the amount. I mean, of course, the requests that come in, I'll be drawing those and like reading those. But for example, if you sent like a blue one or a green one or even an orange one, uh, they will not be read on this stream. Please keep that in mind because we already, we're going to be taking quite a bit of time to draw in the first place. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Do I have a rule about VPN air so that people's super chats aren't banned but verified? Um,. I never really kind of thought about that, to be honest. Never thought about that. Hmm. I wonder if that would be... It's not that easy, don't worry about it. ARS is like... <laughs> uh... Okay, I kind of... <laughs> ARS reds are worth like 10 USD. Ah, uh, that's a really rough one. People can abuse it. Yeah. Mm, case by case. Because if people do use VPN to do the, mm, I don't know. Mm, I have to think about that. Huh. People abuse it all the time. Please don't. <laughs> um, but then I feel bad for for Argent Argentina beats, right? I don't want to I don't want to single you guys out or anything like that. That's not right either. So can I just ask please if you don't live in Argentina, please don't don't do that on purpose. I'm assuming that if you're if you're sending a, a red super for this stream, you want to kind of help out with the MV. That's my hope. Um fingers crossed. Yeah, I wish that I could kind of like verify where where you are, but anyway, um, please just use your country's currency. I'm asking very nicely. I'd like to have some faith in humanity this year. Um, don't abuse the system. Callie as Barbie. <laughs> that might be kind of fun. Um, I'm going to very quickly grab some water and be right back. Prepare your ideas in the meantime, please, and when I come back, we'll begin. Okay? Okay? <laughs> your wallets will survive. And, and at the same time, that, that brings me back to, if you, if you can't afford to request this time, don't feel like it's all or nothing. We'll do multiple of these if they're successful, um, and if they're, they're fun, a good time, and people behave, uh, we'll do more of them. So, please don't spend money that you don't have either, but you guys, you guys are in charge of your own wallets, and I'm not your mom, I'm your dad, but just spend wisely. Don't feel like it's all or nothing. There will always be a next time. For now. Alright, be right back, hold on. BRB! And get your Super Chats ideas ready. Ideas ready. I can speak. <laughs> I spelled success wrong on the New Year's tweet. A P English B R B. You're back.
I'm back. Whoa! Um, did you guys see Bay's announcement? Out of curiosity. Did you guys see? You haven't? Nope, what is it? Full E-N cover. Full E-N cover song. That's what she spent the, the million yen on. Isn't that so cool? It was so fun to, to do and be a part of and make. All 15 girls are in it. Isn't that crazy? You guys are gonna love it. At least I think. <laughs> I think you guys are gonna love it. But, yeah. Um. <laughs> Say what? That was her project. Yup. Yes, it was. No way. That's so cool. Have you heard it yet? Yes, I have. Mm -hmm. It's so awesome. You guys will love it. <laughs> yeah, so check it out. Um, when it comes out, which is very soon. Base the goat. Um, so, are you guys ready for me to open commissions? Oh man, it's been so long. I'm a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a bit nervous. <laughs> but... <sighs> Alright. Now remember, remember the rules, because the rules are important, okay? And I'll count down when they open. Okay. Whew. I'll do my best. Let me just take a swig of apple juice. <laughs> Clear my throat. I have, I got more fancy apple juice. Ah, dingo! Yum. It says, Torokeru Yamagata Ringo. Yum yum. Oishi. Okay. Good apple juice is heaven. Here we go, everybody. I'm gonna count down. It's gonna be three, two, one, open. And when I say open, try to send your super. Okay? All right. Ah, here we go. What makes it fancy? I bought it from a fancy place. <laughs> On vacation. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Commissions are open. All right, looking at the clock. Looking at the clock. Let's see what happens. Storm the gates, open the gates. Remember the rules. Please remember your rules. <laughs> oh. Oh. You gotta refresh, you gotta refresh. I think you have to refresh. They're open. It says not open. Ah, uh, there we go. Ah! Oh my God! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> the gates, they're being stormed. Oh Lord. Quick, turn them off, Maury, turn them off. <laughs> Quick, Maury, turn them off! Turn them off, Maury! <laughs> Jesus! God, that's so freaking funny. <laughs> no, let it flow. It's okay, we'll open them up again. We'll open them up again. Whew. Gah. I turned them off now, but they still seem to be trickling in. That's okay. I'll draw them, I'll draw them. All right, so let's go ahead and get a little head count. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was scary, but kind of awesome. Darn it, not fair. Don't worry. Don't oh, 50 no <laughs> 
59. Jesus! That's kind of wild. All right, hold on. Not 69, shame. Yeah, if only I'd kept him open for two more seconds. All right, let's take a look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So 59, it's about, it's about, we'll need to do about five of these. That's okay. We can definitely do that. We can definitely do that. We're gonna be here a while, but that's okay. That's okay. That's fine. That's fine. All right. If you kept it open for two more seconds, I might have been able to submit in time. Sorry about that. But you know what? The good news is, the good news is, there will be multiple chances. So, I'd say that's a fulfilled quota. <laughs> That's something, all right. Well, okay. All right. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got, because if I do them quick enough, maybe we can open them again. So I have a layer here. This will be my sketch layer. Right here. And then above that, I'll put... This is going to be the sign layer, which will have my signature and your name. Okay. Let's see, may, have not set, may or may not have sent one an empty red by mistake. Okay, I'll ask you at that time if I don't see anything in there for your, for your request. All right, that was cool to see. <laughs> that was like a, a crazy red wave of blood, a blood ocean. All righty. Oh, by the way, how do you guys like the, uh, the new badges? Did you see, we finally got them. Brand new golden skulls. And it will flow like a flood of cash. Anyway, um, pretty cool, right? You're golden. Bling bling skeletons. Yeah, someone should make like a piece of ice that looks like that. You know, like a chain with a golden skull on it. And after four years, you may have seen there's a crystal skull. But we aren't there yet. Even Mori doesn't have a crystal skull yet. So, um, let's see. Since I draw most comfortably in the middle, I'll just go ahead and start drawing them in the middle and move them around. So, we're going to begin. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get this off the screen now that we're not in request mode. Okay. <clears throat> you copied your request so you can submit it faster? That's good, that's what I recommend everybody do. So we've got here from Tony Bones. Tony Bones. I'd like to request my two favorite <laughs> Holo Live members, Calliope Mori and Gargara, committing a crime together. Can you please draw them hot wiring a car or sneaking into an R-rated movie for Tony Bones? Okay, that's a good idea. Let me see what, I'm, what I want to do for that. I like the idea of sneaking into an R-rated movie. Um. <laughs> Let's see. I, okay. Gura, can it be a PG-13? <laughs> we can get into a PG-13 movie though. <laughs> Hold on. I have a plan for this. Hold on. It always starts with me drawing a circle like five billion times. So this, we have me. We have just a normal, regular Mori who can easily get into an animated movie. And then Gura is gonna be in a trench coat. We don't know who's in there. We don't know, because I would have it be me in the trench coat, like with Gura on my shoulders, but then you wouldn't be able to tell that it's it's me, you know? And I've got the tickets here. And I'm like, here, sir, here are the two tickets. Um, I'm gonna be wearing my jacket, because it makes me look like an adult. There would be a bulge. <laughs> ah, I see. In this particular area. You're not wrong. Okay. 
Oh, I don't have bangs like that. I always forget, my bangs are just in the front of my face. All right, I'm just gonna get the basic shape here, and then gotta look up a Gura reference, which is crazy, because it should be easy. But, oh, I can just look at her like this. On the front page, okay, that's fine. There she is. There's Guar Glumbus. Yeah, this will definitely be more than five minutes. It'll be more like, more like 10. That's okay. Gura trench coat. Look at how tall she is. But you can kind of see that there's someone in there. <laughs> Who's in there? Is it Ameh? It must be Ameh. On stilts. Don't you think that'd be a bit of a red flag, Deadbeat? She's also got hands in her pocket. And then I'm saying here, look, two tickets to go see Morbius. Yeah. Two tickets for Morbius, please. This is silly because, yeah, the ultimate silly part about this is that we both can we both can see in our movie. <laughs> Why are we sneaking? <laughs> no Gojira. And then this is the the movie worker who doesn't believe us. They've just got like a visor on. And they're sweating bullets because they don't want to let us in, but. But they have to. Because Guru. <laughs> we can. <laughs> Two tickets for your R rated movie. <laughs> Here's the doodle part. Now we're really doodling. Looks like you're on a date with her. Maybe we are. I don't know. Who could say? Who could say? It's nice because you don't even really need a certificate of authenticity here. The proof that it's from Mori for you is on the screen. You know? Hair looks more ruffled than usual. It's kind of cute, though. Trench coat. Trench coat Gura. Gura in a trench coat. Screen cap this morning. <laughs> I know you're talking about deadbeat. Also, sorry if I'm a little quiet. Gotta focus on the speedy draw, you know? Hands in the pockets makes it nice and easy. Dun, dun, dun. You got this. Yeah. I'm sure that I'll probably get faster as time goes on though. It's always like the first one that kind of takes a little bit longer, I feel. For any doodle, really. But that's okay. Now who's really crazy though is Ina. <laughs> Cause she can just, and I feel like maybe she's more used to it. She can just easily chat it up <laughs> with everyone. But I'm a, I need a little more 
a little more time and focus. Alright, if you're holding tickets, it's always the hands. It's the freaking hands. Okay. The thumb is here. Get ready for some Arthur level detail. <laughs> Two tickets for your R rated movie, sir. You know, human beings have five uh, fingers, actually. Hold on. If you're holding tickets. Oh, okay. It would be, kind of be like a fist. Sorry, I had to try it out with my own hand. Yeah. We don't do perfect hands here. <laughs> they take a little too much time. Hands. hands are hard, aren't they? I know we have some other artists in the chat as well who feel my pain there. And then Gur's got like a scarf on. Yeah, you know, a scarf and trench coat look like. There's nothing suspicious here. No one's suspicious in that trench coat. All right. Deadpan, straight face. We go see R-rated movies all the time. What a nice, uh, definitely can see R-rated movies look for Gura. <laughs> she looks like she's done done this before seeing an R-rated movie. Didn't we watch? Well, The Matrix isn't R-rated, is is it? Is The Matrix R-rated? Maybe this scene already happened. It is. It is. The first one is. Two tickets for your R rated movies. <laughs> Bubbles a little too big. <laughs> Oh, whoopsies. Eight crazy nights. <laughs> yeah, those were, specifically it's those two that we're going to see. Naturally. And the sign um, is actually gonna change to like white with a out, with um, what is it? Like a, an outline. You'll see, but for now it's gonna be this color. I'll go change it on Photoshop a little bit later on, when I'm arranging all of them. Two. Tony. Hold on. Comenio. <laughs> what was that weird letter that I was making? Let me make sure. How do you want it to be exactly? Except for Tony Bones. It's like an ancient Y. All right. First of many done. Kind of. I also want to just add some details here. There we go. Yeah. Looking cool, Joker. Put them up there. I'm getting kind of particular now. Okay. <laughs> the first doodle of many. Thank you very much, Tony. Thank you, Tony. Yeah. Nothing shifty about that. 
58 mori to go. Thank you very much, Tony Bones, for the request. Um, all of these will be uploaded as a community post, I think, in a gigafile a little bit later. Yeah, I think that that's what Kiara does for the Polaroid thing that she does. Let's let's start shipping away. Um, next up, we've got Donger Bread with this request. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Legally nondescript eye patch fish monster wearing Maury's outfit, whichever's fine, or Deputy Tutu arresting outlaw ghost cat, or the cat's mauling seaman. <laughs> that is really funny. I mean, all of those are good. Hmm. All pretty blurst ideas. Hmm, hmm, hmm. That's a tough one. I do like the first one. I might need to be kind of careful, though, and choose a different one. I think the cat's mauling seaman could be pretty good. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. That's good. Um. <laughs> he hates it. He hates it. Let's hope he doesn't come into the stream and get angry. That's fine. I'm sure that this has happened before. You know, they try to protect my home from this guy. But there's only so much they can do. Oh, the sea man. Listened to the sea man at work today. Hopefully no one else was listening. <laughs> I mean, but if so, hey, maybe he got some new fans, you know, who could say? Maybe he got some brand new fans, some new followers on SoundCloud. The hardest part, though, is drawing cats. We'll have a cat here. <laughs> There's a cat. <laughs> Looks kind of like a human. <laughs> A human-like cat. <laughs> no, please, don't laugh at me. <laughs> and we'll have a big bite on the chest. Big bite on the chest. It's kind of more like a cute pounce than like a, a savage mauling, but... You know, PG-13. PG-13. Seaman mauling. It's about the intent. It's all about intent. Parental, parental unit strongly cautioned. Oh, do do da da. It's hot. Air conditioning off. Please. There we go. Whew. It's supposed to be winter. would be on the inside. Let's see, and then... His hands are here, they're doing something. But anyway, that's the basic sketch. 
Yeah. He cry. You know, cause cat cat bite it hurts. Every single day, every single morning when I wake up to Tutu nibbling my toes. Ah, pretty rough. Chutamate. <clears throat> yeah. Have this be ghost cat. He looks like a ghost. Lucky Tutu should have been me. Oi, 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 oi. You don't watch yourselves there, dead deeds. Oi. Oi there. It's not like tasty or anything. It tastes like feet. I mean, but I guess if that's what you if that's what you like. He he bite. Trounce. Look at the little trounce. It would be cute if it weren't so deadly. Get in that right little buddy. Little buddy. Glomps you. <laughs> he. No glomps. No glomping allowed in my chat. Out! <laughs> doo -doo -da -da. Maybe doo, -doo -da -da is here. And she's got her butt like right next to his face. She's like a skunk! She's a little skunk. I'll need to make a new pose for her. <laughs> Typical cat behavior. Classic doo doo da da. <laughs> Need to make her fur a bit fluffier. Cause she's pretty fluffy. She's got these fluffy cheeks. There she goes. No! Little girl. My little girl. <laughs> She's saying, yeah. <laughs> it looks more like they're playing, but still cute. <laughs> Maybe if we add some blood on the floor? <laughs> yeah. Just so you know that it it was indeed a bloodbath. It was a firefight. No blood. Remember PG thirteen. This P doesn't wait. PG thirteen doesn't have blood in it. Maybe it's been a really long time since I've seen a PG-13 movie, I don't know. Uh-oh. Isn't it just no swears? And no sexual stuff? Tomato sauce. That's some blood, just a little bit though. He's also got, yeah, skull on his shirt. What day is it? Oh, it's it's cleaner day. Okay, I heard a sound. 
and my heart jumped. You're cleaning the house today. Ooh. Well, for you guys, it's Wednesday. Well, for some of you, for some of you, it is. There we go. Yeah. Ah, uh, he hates it. Yeah, he's not having fun, that's for sure. <laughs> he hates it. The ghost cat should look a little more ghostly. There we go. There's a good ghost kitty. There's a good ghost kitty. Nice. All right, and then hand, whoops. Again, gonna be very Arthur-like. Just some sausages. Yeah, there we go. Missing some movies. <laughs> All right, nice. That'll work. All right, I sign. Yay! <laughs> For Donga Bread. Just like that. Just like that. Yay. Two so far. On to the third. Thank you very much for the request. Nice commission. Next up, we've got something for yellow rice. Let me read this. I am worried. Can you draw yourself and Calvin scrapping outside of a nondescript convenience store? Definitely not one that you can buy. Um, fat chicken at <laughs> it really didn't sound like what i meant it <laughs> to sound like sorry or mori doing the kagurabachi pose thanks dad they're both nice ideas i might go for the one that involves less characters but let me look up a good reference let me look up a <laughs> that's pretty cool That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, of course, a fat chicken. Um, let's see. Kagura bach pose. I feel like I can do that a lot quicker and more effectively too, so I'll do that. I'll do that one. Very cool, very badass. I have a solid reference. Yeah. If I can, you know, do perspective correctly, I guess. I was thinking scythe might be cool, but you know, sword is good. I can use swords. Katana specifically, I can use those. <laughs> Just gotta put Calvin in a headlock. I wanna give him a swirly. You know, old school swirly, like what bullies do to people that they're bullying. What do you call a person who's being bullied? A victim? Not a bully -y, that's for sure. I guess they, they don't really have like an official name. It's not really a, <laughs> a thing you want to name. Victim, the bullied, Jen. All right. All right, I've about had enough of that from you. Eh. Enough with the slander.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can draw a decent hand if I have a reference. <laughs> oh, it's just been a long time, I suppose. I'm gonna put some diamonds in there later. Not real diamonds, but I mean, I mean, real diamonds could be cool. I don't know. I need my head to be lower. Maybe a bit smaller too. There we go. And I kind of need to have that, that look, you know, like that look. You know, the look is an important part. If only Armori had hands. Yeah, you usually don't see them, huh? Unless they're on like a Mario Kart steering wheel, I suppose. Yeah, and then my shoulders, they kind of need to be up here to really fit with the posing. And then maybe my, my cape. But I kind of, I don't know, I kind of want to be capeless for this. So let's do that instead. Yeah. No, capeless, or rather cloakless, Mori is a thing that can that can exist in this reality. I've seen it done before, but then I, I can't do it on stream. Sadly. I wish I could. It can? Yeah, I've seen it. Like on, on my, well, on my body. I, I can take it off. Let me move these up. Oh, whoa, we do not need to zoom in that far. Excuse you. This up. They aren't that big. They really aren't. I'm probably like fourth in the end at this point. But at one point, the boy was number one. Um, for a for an <laughs> an excruciating year. I don't know, man. Kind of painful, you know. It hurts your back after a while, but then. They don't want to hear that, you know? People are like, yeah, sure, Mori, sure. It hurts. It's painful to have that big. That's why I am of the firm belief that medium is premium. I've always felt that way. But not everybody feels the same way. I don't think the deadbeats also feel that way either. Everybody's got their taste. Everybody's got their taste. Hmm, kind of looks a little wonky. Here, let me redo this part. So if we go from the, the hilt downward, it's more like here. And then we got to keep perspective in mind. So it's more like right about here. Yeah, that looks better. Okay, and then... Mm. You are perfect just the way you are, Callie. Girl, you're amazing. Just the way you are. Wow, what a kind sentiment. I'm just a girl doing my best. All right, this is a hand. The details haven't quite been worked out yet, but it's a hand. I promise. Just trust me on this one, guys, trust me. Yeah, not for the wearer of the, the chest. Can be a little much sometimes, All right? Let me move this. I think the problem is this bit here. It's too big, like the boobs. Yeah, that feels better. And maybe I'll move this a little bit. And the fingers. 
I said this was the simpler one, but it's taking longer. Ah oh well, that happens. I thought we'd go with Underworldian uniform for this. It's been a while since I've worn it. And maybe not that long, but... No, I was... I was having tea with the... My favorite dogs. That was the last time that... I wore it. Maybe belt is lower. Can't rush art, so true. Art connoisseur. You guys are all connoisseurs for dropping by today to see art in the making. Alright, I have to fix some things here. Um, it just looks weird if I'm too hunched over, so even though it's not exact for the pose... There we go. That has more balance, I think. Alright. Nice, and we'll have some of the hair, like, going over. Like this. That's cool. And we can make my eyes, like, super dark. And, like, mysterious. Ooh. Maybe I should stretch it. I bet if I stretch it, it'll... No, that's not what I meant to do. I just wanted to grab... Oh, I drew... I literally drew a line. <laughs> okay. Cool. Nice, nice. Yeah, and then can't forget the crown. It's more of a tiara, though. Yeah, and then veil. Which is also important. And a part of me. And a part of you guys, too, the veil. Um, but I feel like, yeah, the wind would have it go more this way. I don't know. We'll figure it out. It's there. Just, just trust me. <laughs> trust me, Deadbeat. It's there. Okay. And then, we should have it be kind of reminiscent of the original. And then, time to cheat. Just doing what I gotta do. It's the sketch. So it should be fine. Something like that. Yeah, it's an implied veil. like that. Okay. Nobody just can draw. It takes practice. Mm. Very, very true. A lot of practice. More than one would assume. And, and there's always stuff that you can learn to get better, you know? Let's see, pay attention to this part up here. It starts angling a little bit further up. Uh, let's see, maybe here. Something like that. <laughs> the basic idea is there. Dun, dun, 
dun 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 dun. Okay. Alexa, play DMC. <laughs> DMC5 soundtrack. Would be kind of fitting, not gonna lie. That's definitely the energy that I'm getting from this. I wish I could draw faster. That would be a nice skill to have. Really speedy drawing, but... I think that also takes a certain level of skill to be able to draw fast and good. It's one thing to just be able to draw good, but it's another thing to be able to draw like fast and good, you know? Because a lot of these things, like I would be taking more time to like refine and like double check, you know? But yeah, they are just doodles. But. Then again, you guys, I'm the same person that's like, I have to practice three days for karaoke. And the songs I sing have to be as good as I can make them. <laughs> it's just me. It's just a me thing. <laughs> it takes me two days for just basic shapes, you say? I mean, everybody's, everybody's drawing skill is different. You know? I've been drawing for a while, it's just I got out of it for a long time. You know? Okay, maybe, so like the side part... Have some hair that goes this way. Yeah, kinda goes off to the side. Like these. Yeah. Kinda like that. I'm out of practice, but I miss it a lot, you know? I stopped drawing as a profession and it kind of became like a hobby and it's a lot more fun to me now, but my skill level has dropped. Which I guess happens when you get out of practice from anything for a long time. Watercolor is an awesome medium, yeah. Watercolor is fun, but I feel like I struggle with that one a lot in particular. Acrylics are a bit easier for me than watercolor. I feel like watercolor, you kind of have to really be okay with being super free. You know, and like really accepts the little, I don't want to say mistakes, but deviations from your vision. You know? There's probably some hair right there as well. I think I have my gold armor right here. You're a top tier finger painter, but only turkeys? Hey, that's something. That's something that you can that you can draw. Must be wonderful Thanksgiving. <laughs> you can make masterpieces. For all those important to you. I am also accepting Mori finger paint art. I love to see all kinds of art of anyone, really. Me and my friends. Love to see it. Love to see everyone's creations. But I don't always have time to drop, you know, likes or retweets on everything, so... I try to like as many as I can, though. <laughs> Watercolor is difficult and stressful, but it's so pretty. Yeah. Oh, people throw salt on it to make it snowy? I didn't know that. That's a great technique, though. I bet there are tons of tips and tricks that you can just look up, but that's the internet. You know? I found a bunch of tips and tricks for Mario Kart. I need to stop thinking about Mario Kart. I have to stop thinking about it. Let it go, Mori, let it go! You can practice later.
Ooh, very cool. Maybe a little eyelash. This one I won't copy paste. Now that I kind of know the placement. Yeah. Nice. Just got racing on the brain, you know? I think we got this, for the most part. I'm gonna make it kind of a different katana. There we go. Nice. <laughs> I said, yeah, this will be the easier one, and then it was the one that took the longest. <laughs> but still, hey, let's go. I'm glad that, I'm glad we did it. It looks cool. It's a really cool looking one. It's the death glare, yeah. I don't often give it to you guys. Because, you know, I don't need you guys to see that side of me. The Reaper side. You know. Alright, uh, let's see. How shall I address thee? First, a little sign from me. To you. Yeah. I included the skeleton. Yeah, I did. Okay, nice. And this one is for yellow rice. Dice. I'm gonna sign it to rice. Two. Da. E. I can do this. S. Yeah. I did it. <laughs> nice. Okay, we did it. We've got three done. Next up, we've got Prinny's Rock. Let's go. Hi, Mori. Could you draw yourself in Raiden's bullseye or dead-on pose like an MGR? Bonus for glowing eyes like Raiden. If not, Nezumori wearing the red dress outfit would be great, too. Please make it out to Prinny's Rock. Thanks. Wow. Dead-on bullseye. Let me take a look. Let me see if I can find a good reference. Let's see. Dead-on. Cool. That would be kind of- I think I can do that. I like to challenge myself. It might be kind of quick. <laughs> I say that about all of these. Kind of cartoony. It's fine. We'll make it work. Right in. You, you have to take a do doom. Don't tell me what I have to do. It's not what he meant. What? I don't have to go. Did you say nerd? Did you say nerd? I don't really quite have the same thighs as Raiden, to be honest, not gonna lie. I mean, they're okay legs, don't get me wrong, it's just not, they're not Raiden thighs, you know? Da, 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 da. Literal thunder th right? Seriously. Da, 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 da. Nezumori in a red dress does sound nice, though, I will say. That's also a good request. A little tough in a skirt, so we're gonna do the shorts version, <laughs> which is a version that I made up myself that can exist if I just tear my skirt off, which I did in Nezumi scheme, so I, I deem it possible. <laughs>
Maybe we are wearing the cloak here. Yeah. That's why you can't see my shoulder. Because I'm wearing my cloak. Because I feel like having it like billow out behind me would be really cool, you know? Like a kind of thing. You know? Let's see. And we're holding the scythe, of course. Head on. Cool, we'll do that. Hold on, where's the thumb? The thumb's on the inside. Okay, got it. <laughs> no, I, I got it. I got it. Don't worry about it. It's... it's back there. It's... Trust. But you can't really see the blade. It's like, it's here. It's, it's just, it's, you can't see it. It's... It's a little hard to see. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. All good. We'll have like, yeah, it's kind of like this. The knee is probably like right here because it's or is it going backwards? Hold on, how is he? No, it's it's kind of going forward a little bit, actually. Perspective, perspective. That looks much better. Okay, nice. And then... Look down and be cool. Like Raiden. Yeah. Glowing red eyes, too. That should be easy to do. My hair also looks cool. We'll have it be kind of like one shape. Yeah. And then crown. Yeah. I like that. Okay, I can work with this. Cool. Like ride it. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? No ride and slander. No ride and slander. <laughs> Enough. I'll have none of that. Not in my chat. Raiden is cool. Hey. Be nice. To a fictional character. Be nice. Alright, make the arm kind of thinner. Okay. Um, and then I'm gonna have the hair cover my eyes. So I kind of have a similar vibe to, to Raiden in here. Yeah. Okay, cool. Now we doodle around it. Yeah. I feel like I'm starting to get into the swing of it. I'm still not as fast as I'd like to be, but I have to put a certain level of detail into it or else I'll feel bad, you know? Anyway, that's just a me thing. It's always just a me thing. MGS2 is a fantastic game. Even if the Ray fight is obnoxious. Yeah. With all those different guys. It's rough. But still very cool. Very cool fight. There we go. Shorts version. Mori shorts version. Speaking of shorts, did you guys like the new short? It was pretty cool. It's definitely how cool I am every day in my life. A hundred percent. How I really am, you know? You guys may see me as like, you know, kind of a dork on stream and whatnot, but... But I'm cool. You know? I'm cool. So yeah, check out the short if you haven't. Because I, I can be... Pretty cool, cool dork. Alright. You know what? I can live with that. I can live with that. 
how about something like this? And then, let's see. We'll have the hair kind of go back. best to be cool like I said it's the it's the year of the Shinigami you know it's I'm gonna really prove my coolness you'll be like whoa no way I didn't even know that Mori was 80% cool and only 20% dork mm -mm. yeah I'm just very bullyable. Oh well, probably did it to myself. 20% cooler, only 20%, only 20%. I'm telling ya. I'm telling ya. See, that's pretty neat. A cape like that. Then we're gonna have to differentiate between the, the pants. I can do that. Maybe with a white line. I bet that'd work. Yeah. Something like that. We'll do it afterward. Okay. Gotta remember, I left a lot of places open. is here. Whoa. All good. Dun, dun, dun. Yes, right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. The sound of my quick pen movements. Liberties taken on my, my outfit, but that's okay. We're all about taking those liberties. Okay. Then we'll have to do another white line here. Get the side these things. Very important. I 
and shadow. Kind of like that. Yeah, and then I'm like dead on. I don't know if we can do a glowing effect. We can do something kind of similar. Hold on. How about. Let's go. Nice. I feel pretty good about that. Donezo. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, another doodle done. And this is for Prinny's Rock. that I'm spelling everything correct. Yeah! Nice. Pretty cool. That was fast. Oh, you know what? I forgot. Those bikes. I gotcha. I mean, there are a couple things I forgot. Oh, one second. I have to answer the door because I think they want to ask me a question. Hold on. They weren't there. It's probably fine. A anyway, another one done. Another one and done. Yatta. Okay, um, what are we drawing next, I wonder? Thank you very much for the request. Let's see what else we got here. Which layer is this? I don't know what layer this is. Is it this? Oh, there it is. Okay, got it. All right. <clears throat> Yatta. Aw, that's cute. Can I please have a doodle of Callie giving a deadbeat a side hug with her right arm around the deadbeat's head for T-Z-K-K. -K. My right, hold on. <clears throat> right arm. So that would mean, okay. Sure. That's cute. That's a cute idea. Okay. Hey, deadbeat. Almost like I'm bullying you. It's kind of a... It's not, it's not bullying, it's just <laughs> specifically around the head. That's cute. There's the deadbeat's heads right here. Specifically around your head. A bullying hug? No bully. prefer if you were bullying me than anyone bullying you. That's a really nice sentiment. Thanks. It's okay. I'm pretty used to the bully. Don't worry about it. It's all good. Just keep taking life with a smile, you know? Best you can. At the end of the day, I'm a lucky person, you know? I can deal with a little bullying. Especially from you guys. <laughs> Plus, you know, I was in middle school once upon a time. 
That was rough. I'm just glad we're not there anymore. That's the best thing. Not being in middle school anymore. Every day that I'm not in middle school is a happy day for me. The worst years, am I right, Deadbeats? This Deadbeat is probably like, why my head? <laughs> school it was mid definitely feel that this deadbeat's like why around my head and I'm like mm, another deadbeat said so that's why come a little closer deadbeat don't be afraid. It's fine. Just don't make it weird. <laughs> as long as you don't make it weird, hey, we're fine. Don't even worry about it. very long so I am gonna need to pull this arm even closer there that seems better deadbeats heads very big it needs to be smaller this deadbeats a little short Human. Sorry if you end up being able to hear it. You will move the belt a little bit further down. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna have to come up with a very cartoony way of drawing myself to just have it be nice and easy. Cartoon Mori. Because, you know, I've got a lot of details on me. I'm sure you guys have noticed, but... Got a lot of details, and so... Have to find a way to simplify things a bit. I'm a detailed person. Yeah, I kind of like that. Okay. And the eye's probably right here. Oh. <laughs> what happens if they're taller than you? Then I just reach my arm up. Simple. Pretty easy adjustment, to be honest. Okay, 
And then... The deadbeat's almost done. He's nice and simple and easy to draw. The deadbeat is blushing. Yeah, he might be. Or it could be a girl deadbeat, I don't know. I wonder how the deadbeat design really came to be. Just over time, I guess. I don't know. I do wonder sometimes, though. But I feel like I've forgotten. I don't even know how we came up with it. You do like delinquents. I think they're pretty cool. Most of the time. In fiction. <laughs> In fiction. <laughs> Gotta clarify, you know? Wasn't it from Q? Maybe. I thought that we had it figured out before then, though. I don't know. Maybe it just came to be. I think it was kind of made official in Q, but I don't know. It was more visible there, yeah. In that particular one. Oh boy, they're making a lot of noise out there. Oh lordy. I don't know if it's them or the kitty cats. The cats have been fighting a lot recently, to be honest. I don't know what's going on. They used to be such good buddies, I don't know. But recently, I don't know, Tutu hisses a lot at Ghost Cat. And he always wants to play. I think he's kind of too dumb to, like, read the room. You know? He's just a bit of a dummy. He's not the smartest. He's so cute though because he meows a lot and tries to talk to me all the time. What is he trying to tell me? What is he trying to tell me? Asserting dominance. Yeah. Just asserting the dominance. But I, I don't think, I genuinely think he just wants to play, you know? It's always the vibe that I've gotten from Ghosty. He just exists to play. <laughs> no other reason. Doesn't need any other reason to be. It's always playtime. Nyanya. <sighs> yeah. He's so cute though. <laughs> He's saying, I'm bored. I play with him every day. A lot. Ghosty. We've already played for a long time today. When I'm not streaming, I'm usually playing with my cats. Or practicing Mario Kart these days, I'm not gonna lie. It has been taking up quite a bit of my time. This part of the outfit really simple. Nice. 
I've been having a hard time getting Tutu into her harness, to be honest. I might need a friend to come help me put it on or something, because she does not like it. And I cannot put it on her alone. Sadly. There's a veil. Yeah. <laughs> Deadbeat says, why my head? <laughs> okay. Are you able to walk Ghost Cat? Uh, Ghost Cat has no interest in the outside world. Yeah. Even if I open the door, Ghost Cat sees me open the door and is like, nope, I'm staying right here. Tutu, on the other hand, she will do everything she can to get outside. Okay, let's see, this one is for T-Z-K-K. -K. I'm gonna sign this first. <laughs> so yeah, I haven't been able to really walk her because of the harness issue, and I'm not, I'm not wanting to take her out without a harness. So, two, we got four, E, C, K, K. There you go, done. Here's what we've done so far. Pretty good amount here so far. Would like to pick up the pace a bit, but I'm not gonna force it. You're welcome. Thank you, you're welcome. About 70-ish minutes, yay. Because we did spend a long intro. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, Alex Agkawili, good luck on the doodles today. Let's see what, what we got here. Ooh. Gura in a salmon suit. A very menacing small Cali. A deadbeat, but with the lower jaw included on its skull, unlike how you usually draw it. Hope the MV ends up looking fantastic. Alex. Thank you so much, Alex. These are all really good ideas. Um, let's see. What would a salmon suit even look like, I wonder? Let me look it up. Salmon costume for adults. Okay, this is pretty funny. <laughs> this is pretty good. All right. Request has been heard. We have jaws, of course. How else would you talk? I mean, you talk in chat, but I can't really hear, like, your voices very well, so maybe that's why there's no jaw. Alright, let's draw... here's the salmon. This is what a salmon suit looks like. <laughs> the little fins. But I'll probably have her legs sticking out of it. And it's got a big fin up here. Oh. <laughs> Salmon colored suit? I don't know about that. I don't think so. I think I think that Alex meant a literal salmon. <laughs> yeah, Alex, you would say salmon color. Yeah, let's go see. I knew it. A salmon fish suit. I mean, nice observation, but See, I I know how I know how you're thinking. Because I, too, have envisioned the same thing in my dreams. The shark becomes the fish. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. There we go. SpongeBob. 
the SpongeBob reference. Oh! I must have missed that episode. There's a Squidward in a salmon suit costume. Squidward eats a pie bomb. <laughs> I see. I don't remember this one. We need to do a SpongeBob watch along. All right, here we go. Perfect reference. All right, redo, redo. Now I've got it. But that's. I don't. I don't know. Does, does a salmon really look like that? Dun, 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 dun. This is a good one. I remember the pie bomb episode. I guess I just, I didn't remember this particular moment very well. have like antenna these are like whiskers right she can finally communicate properly with bloop what are you drawing Gurrit in a salmon suit like squidward in a salmon suit i'm gonna put her hands on her hips to kind of make it a little different Teeny tiny bit different. Not just a copy paste. Probably confused about why <laughs> why she's being drawn like this. Not another hooded outfit. And then there's a hood inside the hood. Deception, yeah. And then we can't forget the shark tail, because Gura is a shark. Yeah. <laughs> this is how Gura hunts in rivers. <laughs> yeah. Thought she gets the other salmon to trust her. There we go. They tend they still don't suspect I'm a shark. <laughs> I know they might be hot on your tail, Gura. I don't think the suit's very convincing, to be honest. I didn't even think it looked like a salmon. <laughs> Because if you look up salmon costume, like, otherwise, you just get, like, a regular, like, it just looks like a fish, right?
But this? This looks like an alien. <laughs> it would be kind of cool if Gura got this as like a kind of a kind of like what um Koho Koho Kaicho had uh before she departed, right? What is it, the purple dragon? That was pretty good. That was pretty good. I want that same thing, um... This year. <laughs> I want that. Because it would make a cozy pajama, don't you think? There's something kind of suspicious about the salmon costume, you guys. Why is there a shark tail coming out of it? Hey guys, why is there a sh Hey, I don't know if we should swim too close to that salmon. There's a- there's a funky looking tail coming out of it. Do you believe it if you were a Salomon? Dun, dun, dun. Weird looking salmon upstream. That's no, totally normal. There we go. Legs a little closer together. Perfect, yes. And now we need the hoodie inside a hoodie. There we go. Looking salmon outside. It, it looks like Gura, the fucking thing. There we go. <laughs> smelly fish hoodie plus smellier fish hoodie. Just a little stinky. It is complete. Oh, I need the bottom part of the shoe. There we go. <laughs> A salmon. <laughs> this is smelliest fish around. All right. Now let's see how we address this one. It's for Alex. Thank you for the fantastic suggestion. This is exactly, exactly what I wanted to draw today. <laughs> nice. All of these have been good so far. Or Alex. Yay! Nice. We're doing work. Do and work. Let's see. Next, uh, next up, we've got V Faction. Thank you, V Faction, for your commission. Let me see. <laughs> what is this request? All right. Listen to this. <laughs> Draw me a picture that weaves the tale of the grasshopper and the octopus. All year long, the grasshopper kept burying acorns for winter, while the octopus mooched off his girlfriend and watched TV. 
But then the winter came and the grasshopper died and the octopus ate all his acorns. Also, he got a race car. It's kind of messed up. But you know, let me figure out how to draw a grasshopper first and then we can kind of, we can talk business. All right, uh, let's see. Grasshopper. Okay. I see. All right, let me, I can see. <laughs> can you? You've given me a challenge. I'll take a challenge. All right. This is a, a chair. I'm gonna edit your story and say that the octopus and the grasshopper, so the grasshopper was the octopus's girlfriend. It's my edit to your story. That's why they're in the same place. So here's the octopus and he's watching TV and whatever. Not doing anything. Yeah, what a twist. And here's the TV set. He's watching Mori. You know, like the hit TV show Mori, like you're not the you're not the father. But it's me. And then the grasshopper is over here, like burying acorns in its winter time. Here's the grasshopper. I think this is kind of what grasshoppers look like. Um, kind of. So they have like their body goes kind of up like this and then the legs are like, they go back and then they're in like this kind of shape. I'm burying some acorns. So I'm gonna have like an acorn here. Yeah, seems good so far. You know, just getting the basic shapes and story down. The race car bit's gonna be kind of tough, but I'll make it work. All right, so how many legs do they have? Looks like there's also a leg right here as well. And then he's got his body over here and then, yeah, this is a grasshopper. I'm burying Burying a little acorn, like right here. Six, like nine, six, too many. Too many. Okay, here's the couch, here's the octopus. Yeah, he's got a bunch of legs. <clears throat> and is just watching TV, watching Mori. There I am. My hit show. I don't know, wouldn't that be great if it was a real thing? A show for Mori? Here's like the house. They live in like a little shack. Um, and then, and then the grasshopper is, is dead. RIP grasshopper girlfriend. There's gonna be a race car. We draw the race car here that the octopus is in and is like eating acorns. See, I'm flexible. <laughs> I'm flexible. As long as it's not copyrighted characters or overly a buy, I'll make it work. One, two, three, four. It's four legs so far. There's probably some we can't see on the other side. Put one here, though. <laughs> Dang, mooching off his dead girlfriend. The octopus is a mooch. All right, now we're holding some acorns here. Okay. All acorns. All acorns all the time. And then this is the race car. As he drives away. And it's snowing because it's winter time. 
He's ready for Mario Kart. Yep. That's right. Gonna use, gotta use those acorns on the track, buddy boy. Let me stretch. Ah! All right. Nice, nice, nice. Great. <laughs> Don't drive race cars in the snow. That's nah, fine. He deserves the karma. This is gonna be a super simple race car. It's just enough that you can see it's a car. You know. Octopus. Arms. Gotta draw those tentacles. Okay. I mean, there is racing on the snow. That's a real thing? Yeah, I know it is. It's from Mario Kart. I've seen it done. All right. I'm gonna copy paste this. To separate the story. Go. Okay. <laughs> what a request. Definitely an interesting, <laughs> interesting request. But hey, you know what? I'm a reaper of my word and I'll make it work. my word. There's the acorn. Arms holding the acorn. It's definitely the best grasshopper I've ever drawn because it's the only grasshopper I've ever drawn. Well, there's a first time for everything, right guys? There's a first time for everything. start, I guess. Yeah, like I said, the starting requests have been pretty nice. So, my hand is definitely gonna get tired, so we are gonna need to take little breaks here and there. But we can just zatz it down. Zatz down. You watch Mori. the octopus even able to live up here with the grasshoppers question i guess it's an octopus that can still live in air yeah it's mori on the telly i did it mom i made it on television look i've got my own show and everything Bury that bad boy in the dirt, in the grass. There's some grass outside. The sun is shining. The birds are singing and the pants are dead and the sun is high in the sky. There we go. Nice. Um, and then... <laughs> a twist of fate. The pants? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I uh, misspoke. The lesson is that prudence is misplaced. <laughs> there is a deep lesson to be learned here, of course, as one would expect.
It's a tragic tale, but it's also a tale as old as time. <laughs> What's the lesson? Don't... Don't... Break your back for people that don't care about you. And just want to use you. Kind of real, to be honest. But that's the lesson of the octopus and the grasshopper. <laughs> Highly recommended to not do that. Even if you're a really nice person, don't let people take advantage of your kindness. Because they might just get a race car and eat all your acorns and drive away with your grave in the background. This is definitely what an octopus looks like. You want to talk about it? <laughs> Can confirm, I'm Squidward Tortellini. Mm, I don't know if I believe you on that one, Deadbeat. You don't seem like the real Squidward Tortellini. I remember that guy. He didn't look like you. Man, I miss SpongeBob. Now that we've we've mentioned SpongeBob a couple times, I'm like, man, kind of want to watch it again. Marathon all the old episodes. Ah, it's a Squidward, famous octopus. <laughs> yeah, my favorite octopus is also Squidward tentacles. <laughs> There we go. Is done. The prophecy is drawn. The end. End of the story. All right, let's see how we address this. I'm just gonna say V faction. Where shall we sign it? I wonder. Not really a lot of space to sign. I'll put it here. This is a Calliope Mori original story. Kind of. With the help of Deadbeats, specifically V Faction. Anyway. Nice. And one of these things is not like the other. Thank you for the commission. Next up, we've got an Akas buffer Hayden Sanders. Let's see what we got here for Hayden Sanders. Art for Hayden, here are some ideas. Ooh. Nice. Sheriff Mori tuning Ricky bass guitar with a smirk, eager to play again. Idea two. Rap slash casual Mori wearing headphones with a deadbeat. Heads pushed together and the top band stretched atop both heads. Oh, that's cute. That's a really cute idea. Cute and happy vibes. Hmm. We did one with the deadbeat recently, so I feel like maybe we should do the guitar one. I think that might be a good idea. Just for a little bit of variety, I suppose. Let's see. That beat one would be very cute. Up to you. Hmm, They both sound really cute. Hmm. Alright. Maybe we can do we can do this. Since we haven't done the casual outfit with a deadbeat. 
Look, Deadbeat, we're stuck together. We're stuck together. You're stuck with me, Deadbeat. We'll have the Deadbeat be this one this time. Cute. I like that idea. Need more happy vibes these days. You know? zoom out a little bit. Let's see. They are wearing headphones also with a deadbeat. So it's not necessarily the headband, it's the, the headphone, big headphones together. We're listening to music, what are we listening to? Because it's not, it's not me. <laughs> We're not listening to me. I want to listen to something else. What are we listening to? Maybe My Chemical Romance? I'm also gonna... Keep... This deadbeat band around my head too. So Issei. That sounds good. <laughs> Sneaky Neaky? Mmm, good be. Maybe some Green Day. I wanna be an American. Yeah. Happy vibe. Good beat. Me. Stuck together. You guys are stuck with me. Yeah. Nice and simple. No, Deadbeat. It might be a lot easier if we shared some earbuds. <laughs> might hurt a little less. Not gonna lie. It's okay, though. It's okay. Just this time. Yeah, but this is way cuter. Okay, well you got me there, Deadbeat. You got me there. It would be easier if we could just squish closer together. not to bully me when we're this close to each other, okay? I'll be sad. <laughs> the hairband is also shared between us. Hmm. 
<laughs> a little bullying, just a small amount. No, no bully. No bully. I'll be mad. I'm gonna have to bully you back. It will just be straight up black color. There we go. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. Easy Mecha Bully is just Bully Bully, isn't it? True. That is correct. That is the exact translation. <laughs> Easy Mecha means Bully. Showing me some music. Yeah. <laughs> Cute. Maybe a little jazz. All right. This one's for Hayden. Thank you for the commission. for this batch. We're almost at nine. And then we'll only have 50 left. That's not too many. We'll get them done. <laughs> That's your fave so far. Glad you like it. Now we've got Nick SDV. Let's see what Nick wants. Let's see. Reaper's choice on what my name brings to mind for a deadbeat doodle. Ooh, okay. Mostly curious to see what you come up with. If that's too vague, maybe a deadbeat with swirly eyes and a hoodie and whatever else you think about adding. Thanks, boss. Ooh, Nick S. Deadbeat. Okay. I'll try and kind of be... Hmm, creative with it. I do like the, the hoodie idea, though. I think that's pretty cool. It's a deadbeat portrait. You know, that's also a really good idea, Nick. You just gave me a really good idea. Um, at a certain point, I feel like drawing, um, drawing requests, right, might be like a lot and take a lot of time. So I think maybe at a certain point, after I do maybe one more openings of Super Chats, what if I did something like, like designing a deadbeat version of you, right? For every person that sends an Akka spa. Maybe I'll make it kind of Reaper-like. Yeah, deadbeat portraits. That's a really good idea. Maybe after one more round of requests. Yeah, deadbeat sonas. I like that idea. Thank you for inadvertently giving me that idea. Nick SDB. How would it work? Well... You'd give me your name and any stuff that you'd want me to include in there, and I'd draw a, de a deadbeat version of you. And you could also leave it up to me, I guess, if you want, but I'd prefer to have some details. Kind of like how Nick said, draw some swirly eyes. It'd be kind of like this, I guess. Yeah, I think that's a really good idea, actually. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Mine would be too hard, oh yeah? Try me. <laughs> Try me, deadbeats. That's actually what you were going to ask for, but you missed the beginning of the stream. Well, no worries, because I think we'll do that. Yeah, one more round of requests, and then we'll do deadbeat portraits. I think that might be that might be easier to do a bit quicker because I do worry about finishing all of these so I'll do my best though yeah I just always want to make sure that, that I can you know deliver properly the drawings that I promise we'll get there the new round open this stream or a new one mm, tough question i don't know how long i'm going to be streaming today probably very long an extremely long time more than usual if i end up streaming like 10 ish hours or so um i think that we could finish we could finish these in maybe 10 hours when i open it up a second time it will be for a shorter period of time um it may have to be the next stream but we'll try and do it soon yeah, it was just way, <laughs> way more than I thought there would be. I thought maybe there would be like 20, but again, also it's YouTube not loading the, the super chats because I think YouTube got really kind of surprised by the sheer amount of super chats that were being sent at one time. <laughs> I was like, huh, where are the supers? And I kind of left it open for a bit too long, I think. <laughs> 59 in less than 10 seconds. Yeah. You underestimate your popularity. I mean... Eh. <laughs> and then let me see if I can add a personal touch here. You know what I'm gonna give you? I'm gonna give you one of those, like, a necklace that has one of those, those cool S signs that people used to always draw in school. And you'd be like, wow, how'd you do that? It's really more like an infinity sign. <laughs> but that's the personal touch I'm gonna give it. Yeah. There we go. Right. <laughs> the old school S. Then I'll add like some texture here and there. I wonder if you guys will have bottom jaws. Kind of looks like beard. I feel like my deadbeats, they just look like this. You know? I mean, with distinct little touches for everybody, I suppose. And then, of course, you gotta have your resident deadbeat headband. I took away your jaws because I feel like you're strange. <laughs> Who needs a jaw? There we go. That's for you. The very first deadbeat Sona drawn by Mori. Maybe we'll make them kind of hollow. Yatta! <laughs> no jaw, no beard! <laughs> do skeletons have hair? I don't think so. I don't think they do. Yeah! Two. Let me 
draw the bone thing. Oh, bone man. Yeah. I remember how to write this kanji. Hold on. I think it's like that. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. No, that's not, that's not there. It's like this. Yeah, it's got the moon one down here. Yeah! You described your father as a bald Skrellington, which implies that there are Skrellingtons that aren't bald. You got me there, Deadbeat. You got me there. That's for Nick. Thank you very much, Nick. Yay. Did we get all of the ones that I didn't black out? Yeah. These are the ones we've got so far. We'll keep grinding away at crunching away at them. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I did draw an Afro beetle a long time ago, I think. Yeah. All right. We have one for Waluigi cubed as well. Let's see, something very simple. Me giving full moko head pats is a secondary option you could try yourself in Rene fishing if that's easier. Nice. Okay. Let me. I can do the first one. I'm gonna make it kind of like. quite cartoony. Let me make sure to be very careful not to touch the heads. Or not. I mean, no. To touch their heads and not their, their ears. They don't like that. For my favorite dogs. Yeah. Hands away from the ears. No touch. No touch. Okay. Cute. This will be a cute idea. And then there's Moe. Adorable. Thanks, Callie. You're welcome. I'll do my best. I'm kind of looking up so the crown will go up like this. And then, yeah, so something like that. And then here, and we've got kind of a simplified neck piece. Chest. There. jacket so they look especially fluffy and fuzzy <laughs> fluffy and fuzzy not just fuawa but mokoko as well <laughs> right, i gotta look up references of course Let's go get those references. Haha, <laughs> references. Get it? Rough. References. Alright, they get it. They get it. <laughs> they understand. But the headbands right here. I also want to try to maybe not mess up their headbands. I do not comprehend. Don't lie to me. You got the ru you got the reference, right? Rough. Get it? Like dog noise. You're just messing with me. I can tell that you're messing with me. The beat. Can't forget those doggy collars. Fluffy and fuzzy. 
cozy. I love walkies. Wawa hair, of course, much longer. But bangs, pretty similar, I think. Forget like the the little half twin tails popping off. Half twin. I want a hairstyle like that someday. Someday, someday. Yeah, head pats for not eating the cats. It's their reward. Thank you for not eating my cats. Much appreciated. Save check. Very scary. Save as commissions. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> we're fine. God, can you imagine if we lost all that progress? I mean, I could probably still, you know, just take screenshots, but it wouldn't be as good. I want to give you the full resolution versions, you know? Yeah. Maybe I'll take a little handbrake after this one. For just a moment. Two hours couldn't be me, but it could be Mori. <laughs> I believe that. I'm just, I'm a little pawn sometimes, guys. I'm careless. But I'm trying to fix it. Joining Holo has definitely made me less careless, that's for sure. Being less careless is a skill you gotta learn for some people. I'm one of those people. Yeah, because I get too hyper-focused on things sometimes. Cute. I love when the hair do that. big and they have a pretty big hitbox so be careful don't even get close <laughs> yeah the ahoge that's what it's called Cute. 
O que era a Fluffy em fazia? <laughs> the little tea! Those are also important. For chewing things and not for eating cats. Anything but that. Chewing things, not cats. Look, I have to protect my babies. That's all. I'm a protective mom. What can I say? That's all that it is. Why were those two even in prison again? Eh, maybe they'll tell you someday. I don't know. Weren't they just kind of a pain in the butt? That's what I heard, at least. I don't see it. They're just some cute dogs. They can be mischievous, though. Yeah. Oh, bow indeed. Extreme violence? Okay, that's also a possibility. I think we can't rule that out. That's an extremely cute picture. Thank you. It's not done quite yet. Just a doodle, Mori. Just a doodle. I don't have to get too in-depth on it, I guess. You guys know me. Can't forget that my hand is on their heads. But I don't have to get too detailed in that part. Why do they have band-aids on their heads that they hurt themselves? So they're clips, Mori. They're just clips. Don't think too hard about it. Oh, whoops. I saw that at the last second. and bead you almost caused an apocalypse. I also forgot about that. Ah, uh, but... But they're such good kids, you know? <laughs> I say kids, but they're... They're pretty old like me. I'm, I'm older than time itself. The crony will fight you on that. They didn't mean it. Arrested due to noise complaints? That also sounds like a possibility. Yeah, Floa also has very long hair. I forgot about that. Cute. 
really get a sense of two different personalities here. <laughs> I think they played many pranks. Many pranks? Yeah, I believe it. Many, many pranks. That'll happen if you prank too much. I kind of have a collar too. It's not really a collar, it's more like a neck piece. shaking. That always kind of shocks me a little bit. combination. Hot winds blowing everywhere. Okay, and then I have to draw hands. The head pat part is very important after all. Time to use perspective. And then the thumb's on the other side, I guess. Yeah, that works. That's a hand. And the thumb, the thumb is, yeah, on the inner side, I suppose. There, yeah, we're given head pats. Wow. Okie dokie, there we go. Did it. Looks great, that's cute, thank you. Thanks for the great request as well. Look at those dogs. Who let the dogs out? Who let him out? Roof, roof, roof. <laughs> Get rid of some of the sketchiness. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Maybe I can do two more and then we can take a break. I think that should be fine. Yeah, we'll do two more and take a break. Do two more and then a little hand break will be good. Alright, so that was for Waluigi Cubed. And let's see. 
You want me to draw your OC? I would need to see a picture of your original character. Wearing the... I don't know what... I'm not sure what that is. What does R-H-O-F-R stand for? You said you'd take a break two picks ago. I know, but there's only two more until we're done with this. Rapper hat only for rap... Oh! Oh my god. I'm such a dummy. Is it your icon by chance? I wonder. Yes, okay, I can do that. That I can do. Okay, if you don't mind it being a headshot, but I guess... <laughs> rapper hat only for rappers. All right, let me get a, a sense of what's going on here. Okay. Who cool hair? All right, I'll have to include those headphones. Okay. Wait a minute. Is your OC a rapper that- look! <laughs> look. A deadbeat makes a good point. However... However... I have no retort. Gotta look super cool. If you're gonna wear the- <laughs> The rapper hat that's only for rappers. You gotta look cool. The coolness factor is important. So maybe finger guns. factor as long as you're cool even though it's a, a hat made specifically for rappers only and only for rappers as long as you've got the coolness factor just say that you're a rapper and maybe it'll be fine Details. Okay. Let me take a little pick with my phone. Thank goodness for the zoom in on avatar. Zoom in on avatar thing. <laughs> feature. It's called a feature. Thank you, Archon X. I wrap Christmas presents. Yeah. I guess that counts. I mean, <laughs> I guess. Whatever works. You know, the year's okay. They kind of go up a little, like, like these, and then kind of like. Hold on. I'm spatially aware. I'm spatially aware. Trust me. Yeah, I used to draw all kinds of commissions back in the day. My roots. We're going back to my roots. Sorry if it's not very good, though. <laughs> cool hair. Like I said, cool hair. A oh, rapper hat! You gotta draw the rapper hat! How would they be going through the rapper hat, I wonder? The one that's only for rappers. Maybe there's like a special hole cut. Yeah. Wonder if it should be backwards. No, we gotta- we gotta have it be forward so you can see the insignia. 
We'll have the hair coming out the bottom. It's a really cool hairstyle. Visor. <laughs> yeah, we cut some special holes in there. It's a custom made. kind of coming out just a little bit we got to get the cool hairstyle in there it needs to be more fluffy There's some hair coming up the back too. Kind of like here. If it's only for reapers, I will get one. Are you saying that you're a reaper? Are you my competition? Watch it there, buddy. You watch yourself. Maybe we'll make it a hoodie, because that's what's provided in the reference. to do it while you're away. True. And the hiatus it continues as long as I'm as long as I'm here being a VTuber. The hiatus must go on. Okay, we've got detail here. Hold on a sec. Go in and then out. And two dots. Two dots. Got it. And then... Wait, that's the other side. This one's got three... Sorry, hold on. The details are important, okay? The details, they're important. One, two... And I think there's like a third one here. Sorry. No, it's okay. <laughs> you're, you're good. I'll do my best. I'll, I'll do my best to get as many correct as possible. As many correct details. Eyelid. gonna call it a night. Have a good one. See you later. Thanks for hanging out today. So there's there's fluff and there's like layers of fluff. Gotcha. There we go. And then we have the special insignia here. I kind of forget it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I forget it. forget my own insignia. No, 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 it's... It's not that I forget, I just need to <laughs> refresh my memory. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. It's the wrapper hat only for wrappers. We need to make sure that people know that it's the wrapper hat only for wrappers. Not a wrapper. <laughs> Must be rapper. Or I will find you. I'll have my special team that checks. But I'm not a rapper. 
Alright. Might be kind of sketchy, but here we go. We've been drawing a lot of fluffy today. And some scaly. One time I apparently got a skunk commission. I did. That was rough. Well, on multiple levels, that was rough. But you know, it's life experience like that that makes us who we are. Can you see? No. Stinks. Yeah. The only the only skunk that I want to think about ever is Tutu. And that's it. Cause she really kinda is. Summer coat? Yeah. Do -do -da -da. She's so cute. Have you considered changing her food? Well, you know, when I stopped giving her like the kitten stuff, it calmed down quite a bit. She really doesn't smell that bad. I'm just exaggerating because when she was a kitten, right? She smelled very bad, but sometimes it's those first impressions that kind of stick and become your identity. So, it's kind of what happened with Doo Doo Dada. Hmm. What about the cat breath? I mean, it's not great, but it's not rancid either. You know, because cats, they can't brush their own teeth. The best I can do is give them little treats to kind of like... that are kind of like a... teeth brushing treat kind of thing deal? Deal thing? And it does help. <laughs> Mori, my cat's breath smells like cat food. No way! Uh, that could be a problem. Yeah. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Anyway, sorry we randomly started talking about cats, the breath of cats. Oh my lord. I don't want to think about bad smelling things right now. Except for maybe... Maybe Gura in the salmon costume, but that's about it. Speaking of which, you know what I realized, you guys? I realized that, um... There's like a pretty big difference between a clean freak and a neat freak. I didn't really think about it until I kind of just realized recently. I have some clutter here and there in my home. But it's not, like, dirty. You know? And I was like, I always thought that I was a neat freak. And I was like, wait, no, I'm a clean freak, not a neat freak. You know? I need things to be fresh and smell good as much as possible and not be dirty. The trash has always got to be thrown out. You know, even the litter box I clean like twice a day to really make sure that it's... There's really just nothing in there ever because it, it gets to me. But when it comes to like owning a bunch of things and how to organize them, sometimes things get cluttery you know, books lying around and and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah, fresh and no germs and clutter all over the place. It's kind of like that. 
for me, which is why weirdly enough, a lot of times when people come to my home, they're like, wow, Mori, everything is like, it's so clean. And I'm like, what are you talking about? No, I could be doing better. But then I realized like, oh, it really is clean, actually, even if it's cluttery. There's a big difference, I realize. Anyway, just kind of thought about that. No dust ever? I mean, I'm constantly vacuuming, trying to dust bust the whole place. That's just how I am. I can't help it. Eh, shogunai. Now let me figure out what is this insignia. Uh, I forget, but I'm gonna find out. That's really cool. I didn't realize it was that cool. Okay. Nice. Callie's back. Here it is. Rapper cap only for rappers. Too, can own one if you ordered one. If you didn't, well, that's okay. Maybe there'll be another cap that comes out, like a special cap for Reapers only, but then you might have to commit to being a murderer, and I don't know if I can really sign off on that, so maybe not. Cool. Yeah. It's the rapper hat only for rappers. There we go. There we go. Done. Four. Mini. And here's my sign. Oh wait, I ought to put it on the uh, sign layer. Yeah, there we go. Put a fork in it, it's done. Four. Thank you. Ah, just wait. Gotta give some nostrils. Otherwise, how can you smell? Okay, there we go. Sorry, just some details. Details, details. Yay. Thank you for your commission. I'm gonna turn around in a second. Sorry. Just... I will turn around and... Give me a sec. Hang on. Oh, I think I put it on the wrong layer. No, not the wrong layer! Got it. No problem. Okay. There we... There we go. It's on the right layer now. I'm gonna turn around. Turn around. I don't know. How do we talk without a jaw? Dead beats fall apart. Okay, 
Now the last one before break. Let's go. Draw whichever sounds more fun. This is for Frugan. Let's see. Oh, that's cute. Bubba proudly rocking his deadbeat merch. T-shirt, pen light, hat, whatever. Normal or cursed Bubba works. Or Shuba Duck and Takodachi full rap attire in front of a mic. <laughs> that's cute. Rap battle. Please sign the Jake. That's cute. Nice, cute ideas. Hmm. <laughs> Let me see. What do I have more readily available? Um, whichever one sounds more fun, though. Both sound fun. I think I'm gonna go with the Bubba one. I now have also B Bubba reference in front of me. So let's do Bubba. Nice idea. Dogs can stand on two feet if they really want to. You just gotta believe. <laughs> I've seen them stand on two feet when they came to do a tea collab at my house. Small dogs can. Don't know about big woofer. <laughs> yeah, woof. Yeah. Woof. A uh, roof. Yeah, this seems fine. Thanks for being a deadbeat, Bubba. Big ups. Bubba. Bubba's tail. I don't know if Bubba's tail is long or not. I completely forget. I don't even think I know what kind of dog Bubba is. Pose reminds you of the weird cat. Now it's weird Bubba. Smoke. Bubba's breed is cartoon. Hmm, sounds right. Small dog. <laughs> Let's see. Maybe Bubba's got the rapper <laughs> rapper cap. It's only for rappers. But Bubba, he's got a good start. You should check out his mixtapes. Pretty good. Dog breed, cartoon. No hat for Bubba, only rapper hat. Hmm. Terrier. I kind of see that. Rapper hat for rappers. Right here. Yeah! Kinda looks like a Mario hat right now. A hat with a mushroom on it. Working on a cassette release of my music. That's pretty cool. So you're just gonna make it into a cassette basically Because that sounds amazing I really wish that we could release um, cassette merch I think it's a possibility. I've definitely asked them about it before and I feel like it could happen We're gonna make these very small light sticks So they don't get too much in the way of Bubba being Bubba And Bubba's wearing a rapper shirt that's for rappers. Yeah. Do you like the One Piece reference in the, the Fire and Ice MV I see? It's 
good, right? Rapper or Reaper? Yeah! Here we go. That's a good tail. Looks like a clown nose <laughs> for a second there. Dogs don't have opposable thumbs. I don't know if you knew that, everyone. They don't. No opposable dog thumbs. Hey, you get that clown emoji out of my chat. Oh, now they're gonna put a bunch of clown emojis. Darn it, Mori. They would have learned by now. Everyone's gonna turn into a clown now. Nice job. There they go. There they go. Bubba's official deadbeat costume. A roof. Liopy? Always has been. Always has been. Regular Mori. Does Boba have eyebrows? I feel like some little doggy eyebrows would be cute. Da -da 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 -da. Maybe. Yeah, the bean eyebrows are cute. First, Bubba does. True. But this looks nice. Reaper shirt. I've seen a lot of people get theirs in actually, which is kind of nice. Yeah, there are lots of good, good designs available with different colors. Very customizable. Yours came in, yeah, da. Glad to hear it, Deadbeat. Hope you're enjoying it. Everything looks cuter with a little bit of blush. Yeah. Dogs can do this. <laughs> you can dress up your dog to look like a Deadbeat. You definitely can. Thank you, it's perfect. Glad you like it. Thanks for the commission. Okay. 
えっとフォー j a k e やった This is what we've got so far Everything we've done so far here Pretty good progress, pretty good, pretty good. Anyway, gotta massage my hand. A 12 out of 59. Man, who knew that super chats could be sent so many if it's such a small period of time? Though I guess, well, hmm, mama. I did keep them open for about like 40 seconds because I really couldn't see it. Maybe it was more like 30. I really couldn't see if they were coming in or not. I was like, huh? Ada, where'd they go? And then they just came in with like a vengeance and I screamed. Yeah. <laughs> Could have been more that didn't even make it. Crazy. Man. <laughs> Wow, really? Dang, let's go.、Mm. Still couldn't send yours in time because of work Wi Fi?、Oh, I'm sorry, that's pretty rough. But there, there will be another chance. I think the window might be shorter, but there will be another chance. Don't worry.、Mm. Definitely did underestimate. No, but that's fine. It's all for the MV. All of it goes to help the music video that's going to be made, so. It's all gonna be worth it.、Mm. Yup, just took time to show up in chat. You got the pending charge, but it didn't show up in the chat, so it will just disappear in the next day. Oh, I see. Man, that's strange. Wonder why it takes so long for some people.、Mm. <laughs> got up the threshold for reds. I really like the deadbeat Sona idea, though. Yeah. Draw some deadbeat sonas for you guys.、Oh. I might prepare like some, how do I say? Not really like like templates. They're gonna be like pose references that I can add on to and then kind of customize them. I'll probably like trace over them or something like that. I'll come up with like five different variations. You also basically asked for one with your request anyway? Nice. Smart. You, you got, you got, you understood the future assign. You read the future. Yeah. So I have like five different like pose references of sorts that like I'll, I'll like choose and then kind of trace over and customize for you guys. Yeah. Yeah, it's a shame that I, that I can't use an external donation site, but that's just, yeah, that's the rules. That's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I, I'll work with it. I'll make it work. I don't mind so much. It is what it is.、Mm. Yeah. Hold on. Hand massage ongoing right now. Yeah, still crazy. This stream alone really kind of surprised me. I was like, whoa. And some people, some. Absolutely crazy people、um, didn't even just do a hondo. Like, some people really like upped it to like several bricks but condensed into one, and I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Yeah, the fat akas, pH.、Mm. With the pH, the pH part is important. Do 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 da da do do. Dun 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 dun. Face、mm. chats. We deadbeats want to help.、Oh. I hope you guys will love what comes out of it. I'm very, very excited. I really hope I hope the song will do good. You know? The other day I, I had like, um, I had a look at like my year in review, basically. For like, um, Music and for, for streaming, and I won't, I don't want to go in, I can't go into details. I can't give you guys the exact deets, 
but it was definitely better than the last year. Um, but there's still a lot that, that I need to do and try to do, you know? Yeah. Mm. I hope it does well. Yeah. It's really good news. Mm -hmm. It's good that, that I'm, I've started doing better. Um, in all areas and and the label seems happy and stuff like that but you know the one the one thing that they really kind of want me to try and and do and that I think is also probably something I need to try and do but is it's scary trying to figure out how to go about it right um, is how do we welcome um, even more deadbeats uh, into the community right like outreach and stuff like that and and growing um, with all of you deadbeats, it's hard to figure out how to do it in a way that, like, that isn't like too pushy or anything like that, you know? Just be yourself. The shorts have been pretty nice. Just spreading the good word of Mori. Yeah, in a way that isn't aggressive, promotion is hard. And doing new things as well um, can be scary to some people. You know? Yeah. Gift memberships, yeah. I'm glad you guys like the shorts. Yeah. Da, 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 da. I'm probably going to other communities. You found me through Trash Taste. Well, see, that's, that's kind of another thing. It's just, it's hard to do. Because like I said, I think some, some people are scared of change, and I know that, that it's something I have to think about. I have to consider everyone, you know? So I'm doing my best, but... And I'm always happy to welcome new people, but I have to think about a way to do it that considers everyone, you know? I would like to collab with more people. Um, I kind of kept it mostly to Holo Live in the past year. Um, but I'm also somebody that kind of doesn't want to do too much of that. It's hard to explain. <laughs> I have to be, I have to be really like interested in and friends with somebody outside to want to collab these days. So. Simul streaming to Twitch and YouTube like Kiara is. It seems like there's a lot of red tape on that. Um, and I really, I wouldn't want Twitch to be the main thing, if that makes any sense. I really like YouTube. I prefer YouTube. I'm more comfortable here. Um, yeah, but it seems that the Twitch rules say that Twitch has to be the main, and I don't want that. So, yeah. You know? As cool as it would be to, to you know, share, share with uh, the audience and meet new people and uh, new deadbeats over there, but I just can't. I, I'm not gonna make my content pander to Twitch. Sorry. <laughs> to people that like Twitch, but I just, uh, yeah. You know? like and subscribe and whatever. I'd prefer to just focus on finding new fans that like YouTube. Yeah. But I also really appreciate you guys as well already being here. But meeting new deadbeats could also be cool, I guess. I mean, they're always kind of coming in. Every once in a while, I see a really sweet message being like, hey, I've been here for a month, and that always surprises me, you know? I don't want to seem, like, closed off or anything like that, like we're a closed off community or anything. I want to try and be as open as possible, you know? So, yeah. What about Twitter streams, since they're new, might be fun for a short karaoke. Streaming on Twitter. <laughs> it's, <laughs> I know it's a genuine suggestion. I don't know. It, it's X now, though. I'll never call it that. 
We'll never, never call it that ever. That's a thing now. I mean, is it really possible? It seems... I also really hate that place. You know? I really like YouTube, though. I'm sorry, I just... I use Twitter because I have to. Every second that I'm not looking at Twitter is a second where my life is enriched. Twitter spaces were nice, though. Yeah. I don't know, need it for business. It is what it is. I'm waiting for it. <laughs> Yeah, no, I'm really not a fan, but I will use it. I will use it because I have to. You don't like it as an art sharing place? Uh, I used to. I feel like there's so much less of that there now, though. It's more like noise and just other content that isn't really art. Can you hire a manager for, for your Twitter, like the Cali Info account? Nah, I don't think I'll do that. I think... I think I need to be me there. <laughs> I need to be me there. Yeah. It may seem unbelievable for me to say this. This may seem absolutely insane and you may not believe me, but if I could eliminate one place off the internet, it'd be Twitter. <laughs> I know it may seem like there are way worse places but it would be Twitter.com. <laughs> I know you don't believe me, but, but I'm dead serious. That is the place I would choose. Not even, not even TikTok. Crazy, I know, unbelievable. Anyway, maybe I won't, <laughs> maybe I won't have to think too hard about that though. I want to change clothes. Don't look. Close your eyes. Close your eyes or I'll be mad. Sorry for the T-pose. I can start drawing again, I think. Anyway. One place that I genuinely have a lot of fun with is definitely YouTube, I think. Interestingly enough. Let me get a little closer to you guys. Yeah. Just a certain the dominance. There we go. I'm feeling in a bit of a 3D mood today. There we go. I'm settled back in my chair. Back to work. Can I open my eyes now? Yes, you can open them. You can open. Hi. Shall we continue our drawing adventure together? Where were we? Okay, we got Bubba. The Bubba drawing. And next up is Spankenheim, it looks like. Um, but first we're gonna need to consolidate all of these into one layer and then make another layer. Hold on. Stop, pull up the screen. Jesus. All right. ahead and consolidate those, put them in a folder, and I'll put the sign in there as well. And now we've got a brand new sketch layer. Let's do this. Sketch, line, just gotta name my layers. found me via, uh, does that stand for, for Guilty Gear Strive? VOD, and it spiraled from there. You talking about Guilty Gear? Wow, she hasn't started doing the doodles yet? Silence. <laughs> I will destroy you. 
Back it up, Debbie. Back it up. All right, let's see. Spankenheim says, request Sheriff Callie with cat ears saying, howdy. Sp howdy, Spankenheim. <laughs> gotcha. Okay, got it. Not just howdy. It's howdy, Spankenheim. Meowdy. Howdy, meowdy. There we go. There's the sheriff. I have my reference and I'm ready to go. That's a good request right there. Meowdy. Or meowdy. That works too. <laughs> I think that might be that might be good. Let's do meowdy. It's in character, right? Collar. Why is it unbuttoned so far? Why is it like that? Oh well. It's less restrictive. <laughs> to allow breathing. For what? <laughs> You think my lungs are directly breathing air <laughs> from the shirt? <laughs> oh well, I'm sure it's effective somehow. I won't question yuki san mama. She knows what she's doing, more so than I do. More so than I do. breathing directly from there. I guess. That could make sense. Yeah, we can add the coat. Might as well. It's winter time after all. And then we can get the star. The sheriff's star. Through skin because I'm frog? Nah, that's Kiara's thing. <laughs> I can't be a frog, not like Kiara. two finger guns we've drawn today. Might as well, if there's a time to draw a finger gun. It's when you're the sheriff. <laughs> and just like that, Mori lost 2,000 subs that day. Oh well. You win some, you lose some out there, deadbeats. You win some, you lose some. It's fine. We don't need weaklings around here. Only the strong get to stay. The strong that can put up with that shit. I'll do it again. <laughs> I'll do it again! Where's my lemur? Surely someone commissioned a lemur. Just wait for it. Good things come to those who wait. forget the cat ears. Extremely important part of the costume. What costume? This isn't a costume. This is a legitimate outfit.
Ooh, it's getting windy. The windows don't start rattling. Yeah, cat ears, very important part of the, the image. Yeah. Where's my persona? Haven't drawn one yet. But others have for me. like a uh, <laughs> a battle cat <laughs> oh live battle cats collab when hey I'm open to it Ready when they are. Ready when they are. Battle cats have done some crazy collabs. Afraid to ask, but WTF is Battle Cats? Um, it's a game. I think it's you can play it on iPad, I suppose, but it's a mobile game. Dot 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 question mark. Um, you can get it on the App Store, and it's like a tower defense game, but with cats and all kinds of different really weird cats. It's really fun. If you've played Holo Parade, uh, it's kind of that formula. It is that formula. It's the same thing. Same game, basically. It's like Holo Parade, but with cats. All kinds of weird, crazy cats. I did um, I did a, a stream for them. It was extremely fun. It was more fun than I thought it would be. It was chaotic. It was excellent. I would gladly play it again. Right now I have so many other plans in the works that unless it was a sponsored stream, I probably couldn't. But it was very fun. Fun enough that I would want to play it again. <laughs> Sheriff Callie is the best cat. If we did a holo collab with Battle Cats, that's, that's who I'd want to put in the ring. get cat ears someday? I don't think we will. I don't think we will just because there are so many. So many ears. I don't really think I need ears. Unless they were, it was maybe like a headband. Maybe I'll do that. Wanted is a strong word. If I had no choice but to accept a pair of animal ears, then yes, perhaps I'd go with lemur. I mean, might as well.
<laughs> Can't go wrong with bunny ears. I would love some. <laughs> but it's kind of hard. If it's a headband, then I think it might be okay. Yeah. Cute. I hope these are okay. I tried to cut little holes in the ear, in the hat, but... Yeah, it's kind of difficult. Maybe the skull kind of covers it here. Yeah. Details on it than I thought it did. Oh. It was really interesting seeing in the poll how everybody had a different favorite. But yeah, the PJs and casual outfit were definitely a lot of a lot of the the big ones that people liked a lot. And then between like sheriff kimono, um, what else? A red dress. It was kind of split. How did nobody ask for a Cali bunny suit commission? Maybe next time. Maybe next time. Anything can happen. All right. There we go. Meowdy. And I'll sign it here. For you. Mm. Yeah. We did it. Next stream, 50 Bunny Cali commissions incoming. Yeah, da! Yeah, oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> just, just 20, you're fine. <laughs> Thanks very much for the commission, Spankenheim. Let's see who's next. Arnolfo Mendez. Let's see what did Arnolfo Mendez want. <laughs> A deadbeat using Ollie's five gallon glow sticks. <laughs> Colors up to your choice. Five gallon glow sticks. What do those look like? Let me see if I can find them. Hold on. Okay. Glow stick. Like a normal glow stick, but big. Okay. I think I can work that out. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Is it like glow sticks that look like five gallon buckets? I'm just gonna make them huge. Full of glow sticks or liquid? Glow sticks inside a huge water cooler jug? Huge glow sticks. All right, deadbeat, let's go. It's basically a lightsaber. You got it. You know what? That deadbeat's too big. If we're gonna make the glow sticks really big, this deadbeat's gotta be kind of small and he's really, really waving waving them with his whole his all his might maybe it's just it's one it's one because he really can't <laughs> hold any more than that but wow he's really trying
water cooler jugs full of glow sticks. He's gonna try his best to wave them. But you know, he's just a little guy. He's having a bit of a hard time. really going through it. All fun and games until somebody dumps it on someone. Yeah, and who, who even knows what's in there? Like, it's probably radioactive, don't you think? Rapper shirt that's only for rappers. Why'd you ruin it? Radiation, probably. I mean, they have to glow. I think these days it's just electricity. <laughs> it's probably not that deep, is what I'm trying to say, but. I imagine Dragon D. He's struggling. Oh, he's struggling, but God, he's gonna do it. He's gonna support Mori. Thank you. Dragon, what? Nothing. I'm just gonna have it be like, looks like a bat. And he's got another on the ground that he's gonna pick up and start waving a little bit later after he's waved this one enough. He doesn't have muscles. Go easy on him. He's trying. Yes, it's a clearly distinctive bat. It would never be anything else. As I mentioned, PG-13. At most. And even then. Deadbeat. Glowing Asamori. Plug type, of course. Naturally. How else would you get the Asamori? Or a huge stick um, full of Watson concoction. Chilling stream? Yeah. Well, it has to be kinda chill, because I can't I can't talk too much if I wanna draw 
59 requests. It's a decent amount. We can do them. We're like basically a quarter of the way there, if you think about it. And especially if we get some simple ones here and there. I'll definitely choose the more simple ones if given the choice, I think. probably got to have some kind of color so that we know that it's a, a light stick a glow stick rather and that I thought yeah since it is taking of course longer than longer than I thought it might be good to get strategic about which ones I pick Best little guy, you got this. Drawing stream, drawing stream indeed. We're drawing the Deadbeats requests from the Akaspa Deadbeats so that we can fund the music video. Yep, there's a big music video that's being made and it's expensive and it hurts my wallet, so I'm coming up with strats to kind of offset it a little bit, you know? That's what what I'm doing. Alright, let's make this maybe red. Maybe like a bright. Whoa, pink. Oh, that ended up being the wrong layer. Yeah, bright pink. And then maybe behind it. Yeah, that gives like a glowing feeling. He's trying. And then maybe there's a red one. Uh oh. I'll just color it in here. Whoa! Yeah. Have a nice evening, anybody who's heading out. I know it's getting kind of late over in the, the States. Thank you for the gifted memberships, by the way. Jeremy. Hey, big ups. <laughs> you like the cowgirl doodle? That was Spinkenheim's idea. All right. Let's see. Give it a little sign. gonna if you didn't put your name no worries um, I'm just gonna write your username then there we go yay <laughs> drop your fave so far my fave has been Sam and Gura yeah what do you guys like the most so far have a good one Waluigi cubed oh you just got back at midnight EST gang Otsukare good work today mm. oh nice you're in it for the long haul, huh? So am I. I will be streaming for much longer, I think. It's gonna be, this is gonna be a long one. <laughs> yeah. You like the Fuamoko one? Hug with the deadbeat. Gura and Callie at the movies, the first one. <laughs> Sam and Gura for the humor, Persona for the skill. Wow, thank you, it was a good design though. Our supers tonight, JST? Yeah, but I'm gonna keep it in the same stream. It'll just be in this stream and I'll be reading, reading through them. But don't worry if you're not around for it. It's okay. I'll do my best to just keep track on my own. It should be okay. But yeah, just gonna keep it in this stream. I think it's just easier than making a new one. So, it's gonna be a long one, but 
No worries. I'll I'll be able to keep track of them. Make sure that you get some good sleep. Mm. Sheriff Miaori is your all-time favorite. That's pretty good. <laughs> Me and the deadbeat with headphones? That one's pretty cute, too. Some very good concepts here. Mm. All right, let's see what we got. Ooh. Let's see. Wow, that's crazy. Thank you so much to Lopen for the huge red super chat. Thank you. Wow, and we got a, a nifty request here. This is kind of interesting. Thank you so much though for the huge support. Hi, Kelly. If you shared your channel with your twin, can you draw what she would look like? Oh man, twin Mori? Alternatively, can I get a chibi Kelly getting a head pat? Wow. Okay, these are some cute ones. I definitely, for the creativity factor, would like to try the first one. Well, technically, that is true in a different... <laughs> In a different universe, right? Um, Seaman, the Seaman is actually my my twin in a different universe, twin twin brother. But in this universe, what would my twin be like? Not Seaman. <laughs> Probably short hair. Looks different from me, but is the opposite of me in various ways, um, such as, let's see, she probably makes, produces tracks and can't do like vocal stuff. She's like a track maker. The track maker part of the duo. White clothes. Yeah. But still kind of needs to be underworldian. Oh, and. And, um, the top half is just not. Not a lot going on there. But she's a lot more proper than me. any sense. More ladylike. So maybe no hand on the hip. That's kind of like, you know, attitude. Hands in front of body. Is your twin single? Gonna have to ask her next time she joins the stream. Yeah, I was also thinking maybe hands behind back could be cool, but hands like placed in front like proper ladylike might be cool. Yeah. And she's got short hair kind of like this, goes in, and a headband, or rather also a tiara. It's technically the same uniform as me, but maybe she has like a cute shawl instead of a cape. Got long sleeves. She would be flat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> and maybe 
less of a skirt that goes like this, like long, and more of like a short skirt that like flares outward. She's kind of a, a princess, I guess. But also will not admit that she's Ohime-sama. Who is younger and older by seconds? Me. I'm older. By four seconds. Side swept bangs. Hmm. Oh, hey, what's up? Chiorin. Novelty, it's high. I'm drawing deadbeat requests right now. What a cute hairstyle. Yorin, hope that you had a nice stream today. I'm drawing my would-be twin, I guess. If I shared my channel with a twin. I don't think that she would be, like, cutting board flat. She has something, but it's, it's very small. Cute, though. Same neck piece, basically. Yeah. And also, same underworldian fashion. Petite is elite. I mean, I tend to agree most of the time, but I think all is good. She doesn't have a cloak, she has like a cute little shawl. Definitely Ohime-sama though. And maybe she can DJ. Yeah, she'd be like my back DJ. You know? You literally learned about me from buying the, the PC case? You thought it was cute and found the stream later. Really? That's crazy. Some deadbeats end up here in like really kind of off the wall ways. Well, either way, glad to have you here. Thanks so much for being a deadbeat. Cool. That's like the last way that I would ever think someone would learn about me. Wow. Dang, I don't know. I, I really like her a lot. Yeah, and then the inside of the skirt is also red. Kind of like the inside of my skirt, which is a long skirt slash dress, really, being red. Kind of like that one fan art um, of Ina in my, out in my outfit. I think it was by Koari. Ko 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 Koari. Sorry if I'm saying the name wrong. I really like that fan art. And then hands together, all like peaceful and proper and ladylike. Yeah, that person has really, really, really good art. And I'm probably not going to draw it, but instead, instead of a, a scythe. She probably also has a scythe, but it looks different from mine. Wow. Twin Reapers, can you imagine? A deadly combo. I don't know what the name would be, though. Nothing really rhymes with <laughs> with Calliope. Maybe another name that's like a musical, an off the wall musical instrument. A sickle, Malliope Cory. 
We have to have the last- the same last name, silly! <laughs> She's my twin, is she not? <laughs> A harpsichord! Corey. Cantaloupe? Another Greek muse? Maybe. Mmm, Persephone. That's kind of nice. And didgeridoo! <laughs> Karina. I like that. That's a cute one. And she has very round and innocent eyes. But they still have to look kinda like kinda like mine. Yeah, round and innocent. They're round and innocent, but my default is smile, her default is frown. Yeah. It kind of got really detailed in the sketch. <laughs> Quite detailed, alright, but I'll add some details. Yeah. Aw, oh, I kind of wish she was real. The lore. Mm. We always reaped together and then we decided to make music together. We became a unit. Yeah. Beyond that, I'm sure you can come up with something. Guess I'll meet her in my dreams. I was thinking about this the other day, though. Sometimes I really do wish that there was two of me to do everything that I've kind of set up for myself at this point. Kind of take on so many different things, and sometimes I wish that I had another me to, like, switch off, you know, who makes the schedule? Who sets up the thumbnails, you know? It would be nice. I feel like maybe I could do twice the work then. If only we could all have a clone. Yeah, but that's okay. I don't mind so much. Yeah, the f the fuawa to my mokoko. Because <laughs> I'm definitely more more of a mokoko, I think. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little... I'm a little rowdy. I'm a little... I'm a little ragey. <laughs> In my opinion. But you're the one that likes not, though. Exactly. That's the difference. Well, not all twin pairs can be the same. <laughs> so, kind of opposite. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fuzzy, not fluffy. Even though, on first impression, you might think that I'm the fuzzy one, but I'm not. <laughs> not me. Not Mori. It's an interesting contrast, though. She kind of looks like she could be spunkier, but in the end, she's definitely the more, like, well-adjusted, responsible, polite, and soft one, but she's also an Ohime-sama. She probably doesn't think that she is, but she is. I'll have to put some spikes on here, because that's just part of our Underworldian garb. She's all hinge. I feel like if 
if she was around, right, I could go completely unhinged. Because she'd be there to kind of balance everything out. I could go, ah, drop the pen. Dang it. One. That's one. Full unhinged Mori. Yeah. And she's... She's a little... She's a little say-so. She's the opposite of me in that... Mm, let's see. She absolutely will not say any bad words. No curses. Nothing like that. Ever. Hard rule. If I say the F word in front of her, she she gasps. She hates it. But she really loves cultured fan art of herself. Not that I don't, I mean, that's, I don't mind it. I don't mind. You guys draw whatever you want, but, and not only that, she's cultured in general. If you get what I'm saying. So no bad words, but you know. Instead of, yeah, gah, she says, yeah. You heard that? <laughs> Boy. I'm an artist and I'm saying yam it all. She doesn't even exist. Dead beans. <laughs> but it would be cool if she did. Uh, maybe it's gya instead of kya. Gya. Yeah. Gya. Well, being twins doesn't always exactly equal we're opposites of each other's and of each other in these ways. We probably share some things in common too. We're both terrible at games. <laughs> well, it depends on the games, I guess. We probably share the same game sensibilities. But I'm definitely the one playing them on stream. Imagine if she secretly dislikes Shrek, Adam Sandler, and Jim, but won't tell you. I think she'd tell me, and she probably does. She thinks that my taste is terrible. But then also won't... won't divulge too much into her own. She knows that I'll get her for it. It might even be worse. And you just don't know. You just don't know. She probably drops her pen less than me, though. Dang, I got really into this one. <laughs> Sorry. It's been a disproportionate amount of time, but look. This is a really fascinating concept. Didn't really think about it before. Straight-A student, yeah. And I'm terrible at school. We probably have similar hobbies. It's past midnight, you should be sleeping. Darn you, Callie. Sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> you can go to sleep if you want. Don't let me keep you up. Never makes a spelling mistake. Yeah, on the New Year's thank you image. But I think there's a difference between wanting a twin and wanting another one of you. You know? Big difference. I think a twin would be fun, though. It would definitely help with any loneliness, that's for sure. Our first pawn of the year. What a good one. It's a good first pawn. She looks innocent, but don't believe her.
What if she did exist, though? In another universe. And I just can't remember. And she disappeared. What if she did exist, but then she disappeared from this reality for some reason, and I just don't remember her. Ooh, cute. Cute Ahoge. Don't call it the other thing by accident. <laughs> A chinny's showing. I don't know what you're talking about. Banished to another realm. Okay, I'll stop talking. It's We're gonna we're gonna end it here. This is the last we speak of this. It's fun as like, you know, a concept to just think about, but We don't speak of this ever she's chilling with Calvin somewhere, yeah. Another Moriverse. Anyway. Spent a lot of time on that one. But she is cute. I don't know, she's got some name. It's one of the instruments, or maybe Greek, I don't know. Persephone could be cool. Anyway, um, no name necessary. You got it. I'll just give a sign then, I guess. Kawaii. Niato. Kariope no. Futago. Twin. <laughs> Does not exist, but yeah, not canon, but my imagination. I think Persephone is a good name too. She looks a little girlier than me. Younger. Yeah. Sorry you don't exist. Maybe in another world. There we go. Four seconds is nothing. Four, four, born four seconds apart would be, would be crazy though. Can you imagine what that would even look like? Well, maybe you shouldn't imagine in the first place. Anyway, we're gonna continue drawing. Thank you very much, Lopen, for the amazing request. That was fun. Let's go. Ooh, okay. Here's what we've got from Lord Revan. Lord Revan's request is as follows. There are a couple options here. The preferred option is Okami Mio in her Queen of Hearts outfit with her short hair and is drawing from her tarot cards. Option two, Okami Mio in her sweater outfit playing the ukulele. That's cute too. Option three, casual outfit Mori throwing biju like an American football. <laughs> well, you might see the last one someday in 3D, I don't know. We can only hope. We can only hope. It's a possibility. There's always a possibility. <laughs> but I like the idea of drawing of drawing Mio. Because I don't think I've ever drawn her before. So let me see if I can gather a good reference really quick. Let's see. They're all great ideas. Wow. Queen of Hearts outfit is so beautiful. Oh my god, the detail! Wow. With short hair. Let me find the short hair reference. Let's see. You drew scuffed Mio way back in a tier three stream. Back in the day when we had three tiers. Okay, I've got the outfit and then for short hair. Let's see. Um, is it the one that's in the hoodie usually? 
I'm on the I'm on the main site looking at it. I wonder, because I'm having a hard time finding an exact short hair reference. But it looks like it might be it there in the hood it looks shorter. Alright, drawing from a drawing her tarot tarot card. Well that's what I will draw then. Dun, 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 da, da, dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I really like the covered eye style as well. It is very nice. The twin tails with the covered eye. That's amazing. I also really want to, um, someday cover my eyes somehow. <laughs> it's kind of hard. I need those to see and I have hard enough time seeing, you know. So I don't know if they'll let me, but I really want to. Gallery of the VTuber Wiki. I'll go take a look. Let's see. Hold on just a sec. I'll go look for it. Google! Okie dokie. Just gonna quickly. Bum 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 bum. Wakami Mio. <laughs> My eyes are so good though, thank you. They do like to, to jolt around quite a bit. And I know that's <laughs> entertaining for some of you. It's, it's never on purpose, it just happens. So let me see, a gallery. Ooh. Found it! Oh, that's cute. Wow, I love that. The streaks are so cute too. Darting has always been fantastic. I feel like it's become a part of me, to be honest. It's not on purpose. It really isn't. It's just... <laughs> it happens. Out of nowhere. When I get nervous or flustered. I wish that I had it here, too, in this form. My crazy eyes. Top in your features me. Wow. It's too bad that I'm not a crazy, mind-broken person. I could use them way more often. But we might get there. You never know. We might get there. Anything can happen. Goals. Are you sure? Never, of course not. <laughs> You'd rate that as a good thing, personally. Maybe that's why you're here. <laughs> or one of the reasons why you're here, if that makes any sense. Everybody has what they like, their own tastes and whatnot. Never too late to go mind broken, though. I mean. <laughs> I can't force it though. That's not something I can force. I feel like I'd just laugh. Too much. It wouldn't be believable. Not even as a bit. <laughs> it's a feature, not a bug. The darting eyes? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. 
It's a feature. What do you mean? Just Mori already happened. That's not quite the same. I think you know that though, Deadbeat. <laughs> Coming up on two years since just Mori. Staring competition was the real mind break, also true. That was a special stream. Special in ways that. <laughs> I don't think I can do that kind of. I don't think I can ever do that kind of stream again, personally. Not because anyone's disallowing me, but I just, I don't think I can. It was too special. We have to find other special moments. We gotta make them for ourselves. It cannot be repeated. The cursed ASMR, though, I feel like is something that could be repeated if planned well. A lot of people have been asking for it for a long time. I can't ignore the cries of the people. It's what the people want. Yeah. I'll do it again. Just give me a little bit longer to make sure that it's the best that it can be. Maybe then we'll get some real mind break. As I break your ears in ways that you didn't think they could be broken. I'm not joking. I will destroy them. joint one with Subaru and it'll all fall into place. That could be pretty fun. Subaru Senpai, please speak normally. <laughs> but it's just the loudness factor. Senpai has a very pleasant voice. Especially during our, our Mario Wonder collab. From far away. <laughs> like what? Oh, I'll always treasure that moment in my heart. I'm gonna take some liberties with this choker here. Cause it's got quite a few details, but... They're referencing the grandma voice. That's what we need to ask her to do. Yeah. Yeah, because her, her regular voice is very pleasant to listen to. Loudness can always be fixed. <laughs> but when it's ASMR, I feel like I always have to be really careful. Am I, am I being too loud? I don't know. Am I laughing too hard? Subaru has beaten soundproof rooms with her loudness. But it's so charming. I, I want to listen, which is why I guess it would be perfect for cursed ASMR. Okay. You make a really good point. Maybe we can have guests. Okay, this is not what a... There we go. Wolf's ears kind of... Yeah, go up like... Yeah, there we go. Now we're cooking. And these are tarot cards, just trust me. Just trust me, Deadbeat, they definitely are. Yeah. Now let's 
see what the full arms look like. Wow! Fully gloved. You know, I've been I've been kind of brainstorming like if I ever um, get a chance to do another soul alive, what I want the that outfit to be like, and I kind of feel like full gloves would be really cool. Something that's completely different from what I've done before. Something like how do I say? Something really like diva-ish and feminine, but all black. Elegant. Yeah. Like all the way up. Did I say half dress? I was thinking something a little more in the realm of like near automata, automata. <laughs> How do you pronounce? <laughs> With like a short a short skirt dress, because I feel like I want that for me. Yeah, because everything is like I have a long skirt dress. Skirt dress? Is it a skirt? Is it a dress? It's probably a dress. Um. And then I have like long pants, right? Yeah, Mori 2B. But of course with some edits, naturally. So, okay. First pronunciation's fuck. Okay, I thought it was the first one, but I guess either. It seems like it's another thing that <laughs> people are a little split on, but anyway. I actually noticed that. What hair though? I think I'd want to do um, a ponytail, but different than my casual outfit. Like a very long one. Maybe one more similar to, to what Mume has? I don't know. We'd have to see, but I want it to be more diva-ish. You know? Yeah. Like a, a high ponytail, though. I think. I really like the high ponytails. Something kind of glamorous. Anyway. I got distracted. <laughs> I got distracted in my... my fantasy thinking. Well, hopefully one day we can get something like that. So this doesn't actually sweep over her... her eyes. I love the wink, though. I want to draw it because I love it. If it gets too high, you gotta go full samurai. <laughs> I wouldn't want it to be too high up. That's a little... a little too much for me. Something kind of similar to what's in my casual outfit, but... less spunky and more elegant. You know? Anyway, that's my, my dream. We'll see if we get that. Hmm. Mio be like my grandpa's deck has no pathetic cards. So true. You playing some Yu-Gi-Oh, Senpai? Senpai, is it time for Yu-Gi-Oh? cool if we could play Yu-Gi-Oh on stream. I'd kind of want to try it just for the meme of it, I guess. But people playing be super sweaty. You're a third-rate duelist with a fourth-rate deck! Never played it? I did when I was much younger. Have, like high up eyebrows a very calm look I feel like I'm starting to take longer and longer on these I gotta I gotta stop but especially if it's like um senpai or like gen mates or branch mates I want to make sure it's good 
I'll be quicker with the line work. That's who you think my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh character would be? Is it just the one that no one cares about? Or the least likable one? Is that is that the merit that you chose that on? I'm just gonna go ahead and take a guess. <laughs> you know what it helped? Reopening Super Chats to extra pressure from 200 more items. The queue will speed you right up. <laughs> no! <laughs> we have enough Supas that we have to read. To catch up as well. Good thing I've got all day and evening. No other obligations for once. Kinda rare. Kind of a rare thing. I'm gonna take this opportunity. Are there characters in that show besides Kaiba that people like? I don't know, you'd have to ask people that have watched the show a lot. I mostly liked the cards. That was a long time ago, though. seasons and it's still ongoing. That I'm not surprised about. Hmm. Did I have a favorite card? I remember there was one that I got really excited about. There was like a Dark Knight or something. I don't think it was Dark Magician. I'm pretty sure there was like a, a knight, some kind of darkness knight. And I remember that I was really, really proud of it and I kept it safe in a very special card holder and I put it above my bed. Yeah. Now, which one was it? Batman, Buster, Buster Blader. I feel like the, um... Maybe it was that one. Yeah. That must have been it. I don't really remember. It was a long time ago. I really wanted to play with um, other kids in school, but Yu-Gi-Oh! was kind of losing popularity at that time. Well, not really losing popularity. Losing popularity where I was. You know, all the kids in school were playing it, and then I get cards, and then no one's playing it anymore. No one wants to play together, and I'm like, okay, well, never mind. Sad. But such is the way. Sometimes things getting trendy at school. But it must still be popular if they're still, like, you know, making episodes and the like, so... Same for you, huh? <laughs> yeah. It would be like that with trendy games at school. Oh well. Such is the way the trends go. That was you with Bionicles. Are Bionicles not popular anymore? Whether they're popular or not, you should still like whatever you like, but no help if things aren't as big anymore and there are less people to play with. Not really. <laughs> not real. Bionicle mention! Bionicles are gone. Are they really gone? Just among adults. Which is really interesting. That's fascinating to me. No, they're still sold. But it's... <laughs> I see a lot of people saying that it's dead. Ah, uh, what a shame. Well, keep enjoying your hobby regardless.
Oh yeah, the countdown shuffle medley live. Did you see that howling was in the shuffle medley? Absolutely goaded choice of song. But I love that kind of anime stuff. If you asked me like what my one of, one of my favorite or maybe my favorite group song in all of maybe holo or even holo English, maybe I would say rise, which is crazy because you wouldn't think so, right? Like what about something more like, you know, pop or hip hop or rock? But I'm into that any song, man. Yeah. The howling choreography is so good. Goaded song, so amazing. That made me really happy. Let's see, maybe it would be more like um, crisscross. Yeah, it's more like a crisscross thing. Yeah, but we don't really see too much of it here, so I'm just gonna suggest. Yeah, right, we're pretty much done for the most part. the cards. Let's play some Yu-Gi-Oh, Senpai. so you can see it better. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much for the suggestion. For the request, rather. And this one's for Lord Revan. good progress on this new batch. Nice, silly drawn. Thank you. I feel like I'm getting I'm getting more in the swing of it. Yeah. All right, let's see. Next up, we've got Dino Lord Jacob. Now this is really interesting. This is an interesting one. Hold on. Dragon Mori or Dinosaur Mori, your fave, or a Triceratops. Clothing, hoodie, style, or actual creature up to you. Or Roman Armor Mori, but Dino would be my first. Thank you, Callie. Name Dino Lord Jacob. The name checks out. I like that. Um, let's see. Did you know in Japanese, um, Triceratops is pronounced Triceratopusu? Isn't that weird? Like, why? It's Triceratops, but I can draw a dinosaur. Let me see. I have a really long neck, so maybe I'd be like Littlefoot from Land Before Time. Let's see. Um, let's see. Um, <laughs> the Morisaur. Maybe a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Yeah. Morisaur. Dinosaur Mori. All right. T-Rex. Just T-Rex. <laughs> I don't know. Hold on. Mm, Stegosaur is pretty cool. Um. All 
right, here's some long neck dinosaurs. There's Brachiosaurus. Can you guys believe these things lived on the planet Earth before humans did? Like, can you believe it? Okay. I'm gonna use a reference from the Jurassic World. <laughs> Jurassic World Evolution Wiki. God, isn't it crazy? This guy's really cool. This is a Brachiosaurus. And now a Morisaurus. Littlefoot's mom. <laughs> Littlefoot's mom. God, I have so many memories of that movie. Man Before Time. That's another one that I want to maybe discuss with Shiori. On the stream that we're doing. Where we overanalyze children's movies. Land Before Time. The Lorax. Maybe a couple more. I don't know really if I'd consider Shrek a children's film, I think. <laughs> All adults love Shrek, clearly. Unless you've been living under a rock. Mm. Well, Polar Express could be a good one to overanalyze. Shrek was totally a kid's movie. Okay, well, fine. But it's, yeah, it's a masterpiece for all ages. But that's okay, if you don't like Shrek, it's fine, I don't care. <laughs> Why'd I draw? <laughs> it looks so scary. <laughs> You'll see where I'm going with this. <laughs> so frightening. This is the Morisaur. The head shape is gonna have to be different from other Brachiosaurus. I, I look like I look like a Dark Souls boss right now. Or like a creature that you'd meet in like really deep in Made in Abyss. God. Kind of cool, though. I don't know. Clothing style up to me. Like dinosaurs in like hoodies and stuff like that is what you're referring to? Well, I can make that happen. <laughs> what is this? It's me as a dinosaur. Ah, oh, but I probably should wear my Underworldian garb as a dinosaur. Yeah. I just don't know how it's gonna fit me. I'll find a way to make it work. How would a dinosaur wear pants? Uh, modified clothing. Yeah, and then a really long tail. Yeah. How about the casual outfit? Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. That's a good idea, Debbie. Yeah. It works. Look like I'm about to spit some... some fire. Mori dinosaurs don't breathe fire. There's never been a creature that can breathe fire. Except in maybe fiction. If we were drawing dragons, that might be a little different, Mori. Make sure that the teeth are ready for eating plants.
there are two different ways that you can go about this kind of situation. It's this. And this. And I choose this. <laughs> and I choose this. <laughs> what is this? It's me as a dinosaur. Look. Title and thumbnail say drawing your requests. And I I am doing everything that I can in my power to do that. So now I'm a dinosaur. Pretty cool though. Dinosaurs are cool. It's the Morisaur. I can't wait for people that don't catch the stream and have no idea what's going on to maybe download the file and be like, oh, I wonder if there's like some interesting art on here from Mori and then they see these things with no context. That's the best part, I think. It's just a Mori sore. You would think that I'd be a, a T-Rex, right? But just look at how long my neck is. So I think it only makes sense that I'd be a bron bronchiosaurus. Brachiosaurus, sorry. I'm trying to get the name right. The, the lump is endearing. Gotta have my signature crown. Tiara, it's a tiara, sorry. I also draw it extremely simplified. At least four distinct chins. It's true. They're down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. That seems pretty good to me. All right. Now we're getting somewhere. Looks great. Dinosaur in clothes. Can't say I've seen that. And I've seen some stuff on the internet. I've seen some things here in this place in my time here. I haven't seen anything like this, so I feel like we're breaking new ground. Maybe this will bring brand new deadbeats in. Deadbeats that like dinosaurs. I like dinosaurs too, I just don't know a lot about them. I think they're cool though. Pretty neat. <laughs> Any dino beats in chat? Any of you guys like dinos? Aside from Dino Lord Jacob? Yeah, now I look kind of aggressive. I like that. Yeah. Like someone's someone's eating my, my tree leaf. They kind of look like they have like a nose. Here, let me check. Yeah. I mean, they gotta breathe. Would you guys still love me if I was a dinosaur? Be honest. Be honest. Would you love me if I was a dinosaur? Nah, all right, well, at least you were honest. No, all right. <laughs> but look at all the yeses, Mori. Look at all the yeses. So you gotta look at the yeses, Mori. Thanks, guys. It depends on which dinosaur. That's a lot of neck. <laughs> there is a lot of neck there. That is true. That is true. I wouldn't hold it against you. You started liking me when you saw me in this form. It's only natural. 
I forgive you. I forgive you. Dun, dun, dun. As long as you don't try to eat your dog. Okay. I mean, if I'm a Brachiosaurus, I probably only want to eat tree leaves. I'm sorry, we're done with this with this one. Thank you for the request, Dino Lord Jacob. That was a nice request. Some really interesting concepts here. You guys are super creative. Neato. Dino Mori. Two, oh, four, Dino Lord Jacob. Yeah. What the neck do, though? Reach very high up into tall trees for tree leaves. Um. Okay. Let's go, <laughs> true Dino Lord. You're still drawing, it's been so long. Yeah, not so bad though. I'm crunching through them. We will get all of them done. I'm gonna try to make it today, <laughs> but there is a, a time limit for how long YouTube will let me stream and I wanted to read some super chats as well today. I need to crunch through some super chats, especially the, the backlog from uh, the holidays, right? Christmas and the like. So, let's see. Not to sound weird, but you have very nice handwriting. Oh, that's not weird. I'm glad that you like it. Thank you. I never really quite thought so, but I appreciate that. Next up, we've got a request. Let me see. All the ones that I've done. We've done quite a few. I'm happy with the progress we've made. Vampiric Otaku says, I would like a vampiric deadbeat, skull with fangs, with a scar going down the left eye, wearing a KFP hoodie, and a tiny lizard nibbling his head. It's supposed to be Umirix. Oh, that's cute. His eyes are that face, and he's saying, I just work here. Okay, nice and distinct. Deadbeat Sona. Let's run it. This is cool, I like this. I like when you guys ask for deadbeat Sonas. The mission objective is simple. Very simple mission objective. It's a KF beat. There are quite a few of them, apparently. Okay, if you're gonna look kind of vampiric, you're gonna need to have fangs next to the teeth. So I'll have them be kind of like this. Yeah, kind of looking like a like predator here. Cool. Can skeletons even be vampires? Perhaps. Three front teeth? Yes. <laughs> Deadbeats seem to mostly have three. <laughs> yeah, headcrab deadbeat. Let's see, skull with fangs and a scar going down the left eye. Okay, left is this one. It's my right. They have a middle tooth. Nothing wrong with that. Quite a few celebrities have middle teeth, as a matter of fact. Ah, we'll probably need to have the scar going, like, piercing down the middle. Oh wait, hold on. The face is this. Almost missed a mission objective. There we go. Scar going down the left eye. And KFP hoodie. Yeah. Gotta have your headband though. This goes kind of hard. <laughs> OMG, it's Sans, Undertale. Not even close, Deadbeat, not even close. Sir, so this is a KFP, and I just work here. 
cute facial expression. And a tiny lizard nibbling his head. That's cute. What does a lizard look like? Maybe we have the lizard just here. It's supposed to be Umirix. Yeah. Here's the lizard. Yeah, it's like a snake with legs. <laughs> and it's got teeny tiny little hands. Like a gecko. Oh, like the Geico guy. Yeah, salamander, kind of. <laughs> yeah, the Geico guy. Head is very big, so we're gonna make smaller. Yeah. Yeah, the Geico dude is a gecko. Are geckos different from lizards? I don't really... I don't know. Let's go with fangs. Yeah, I think geckos are goofier. <laughs> okay. Makes sense. I can see it. They're, they are a type of lizard. Got it type of lizard. So they are lizards, but not all lizards are geckos. So all geckos are lizards, but not all lizards are geckos, I think, is how it is supposed to be. Wow, you look really cozy. Uh-oh, stomach is rumbling. No, shut up. We had breakfast already. Toast. Toast good. But I guess it will probably be dinner time at some point soon, because we've been going for a while. Oh no, not last drawing, not by a long shot. No, um, since it will be dinner time soon, I'm gonna have to either wait or take a tiny break and eat. Okay, just imagine this lizard is definitely having a nibble. Almost a third of the way there. That's not bad. Lizard eyes. <laughs> Cute. Eat on stream. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I refuse. I'm too shy. I don't want to eat on stream. <laughs> but I've always kind of been like that. I'm also a person that just doesn't really... I'm not super into mouth noises and eating noises on... I don't want to say on stream, just in general, I, I don't really like hearing them. So... 
I guess I just kind of sympathize with people that feel similarly in that regard. I get nervous. You hate eating in public? Me too! Me too! I don't want people to see me doing that. Yeah, let's go for a sleepy look instead of like a mad look. Corona just mutes and then eats with an angry face. <laughs> That's good. I like that. A little bit of attitude during the break. French fries and nuggets during the Mad Father stream? Jesus, what was I thinking? Just thinking about eating on stream makes me nervous. <laughs> so, so no, it's not gonna happen. Do do skeletons have eyebrows? If it's crunchy, you like the sound of it? Yeah, I guess it also depends on the food. I suppose crunch is nice, as long as I can't hear any like any real mouth sounds. I think it's probably fine. Do they have hair? No, we usually don't. Okay. I figured maybe. You would think by now I've seen enough skeletons, right? And I've made enough skeletons that I would know. I guess I'm just a little careless. A bit ditzy. Kind of flighty. I wish I was sharper, but that's okay. Maybe people find it endearing, but I want to be better. You don't remember? No! I have terrible memory. Why are you flying? You made skeletons? Of course I do. Or I did, rather. Not so much anymore. You're fine. It's endearing, don't worry. You guys are too nice. But I am truly very appreciative. Thank you. Alright. We did it. That's a, that's a KF beat portrait. Kaliope. Moe. Proink. Yeah. Four. I'm glad you like it. Empiric Taku. KF Beats Vampire. Thank you very much for the commission. I just work, that's right. I forgot about the I just work here. We go. Yeah. Yay. Did it. Thank you very much for the nice commission. Let me get this on a different layer. Boink. Okay. Looking good. Getting work done. Clean drawing. You're welcome. Most certainly welcome. How many more to go? A lot. A whole lot. Uh, let's see. Maybe when we get to the the random um, two dollar one, um, I'm looking at at Archon's archive right now. Then maybe I will eat. All right. We've got. A request for, let's see, this run, this one's for Koneko, 
Ooh, can I request a doodle of Kyla Kowalskia? Any pose or outfit, if it's too much, can I have Tutu sign for Koneko Aravi, just in case their choice is ring-tailed lemur. <laughs> Thank you and good luck on the music video. Thank you very much, Koneko. Ja'a, ah, I can draw Kyla. I don't think I've drawn Kyla before. Okay. <laughs> what outfit would be good? Maybe I should just do regular. Get some help. Whoa! Thank you so much for the gift super chat, Damon Seal. Oh. Idol Kayla could be cool as well. Hmm. Yeah. Let me see if I can look up a reference from the countdown. One sec. Let's see. Countdown. Wow, it, it does not show it to me, so I have to go to the official channel. Let's see. Dun, 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 dun. There's the countdown live. Do not play sound! Yeah, I was re-watching our performance, Miyu, Atame, and Bay. I was analyzing it. As I do. Let's see. I'm always trying to find ways to improve, etc. But I'm happy with how it turned out. Okay. I've got a great reference image. Lots of energy and coolness. Yeah. It really kind of made me realize that, like... I don't know, everybody... Everybody in Holo is really special in their own way. Right? Um... Because, like... I think before us, there was, like, a whole, like, wave of cuteness, and it was amazing. Everybody was sweet and very adorable and cute, and then... When we three came on, it kind of sparked like a bit of a more intense change because then you had like kickback after that. And it was a perfect balance of cute and cool amongst all, all talents involved. We all have our strengths, you know? Screaming. It was good. It was a great performance. Tummy. Give me tummy. I'm gonna draw the pose that I liked the most from this performance. From Kaela. Get some help. The way you started that sentence, it sounded like they were all cute, and then there was us, <laughs> implying we weren't. No, 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 it's just... It had a different vibe, you know? It just had a <laughs> No, 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 you misunderstand. Yeah, I wish I could have dunked Bay like a basketball. That would have been really perfect. For the performance would have really enhanced it, I think, but ah well. Win some, you lose some. Uh, maybe we can do more of a... Days without misunderstandings? Zero. So true. We can't even go <laughs> one day. Can't even go one day without a misunderstanding from Mori if she streams, which is usually yes, but not during the holidays. Or rather, the holo days. Mm. 
These were really cute. What are these little hair ornaments? I don't know. I just thought it was adorable. details for hair. Headband. Can't forget headband. You can see it better back here, but you can still see some of it back here as well. Because yeah, ID also has their own kind of special idol outfit too. It's quite different from ours. What's a cookin'? Lots of art. Specifically deadbeat requests uh, for red supers so that I can fund my, my music video that I want to do. Lots of bows and ribbons. Lots and lots of bows and ribbons. I might make it kind of... I only realized how tall Kaela is like during this performance. It was like, whoa! It really surprised me. I mean, she is. Isn't she the tallest Hololive member? Unless I'm wrong, but she's gotta be now that, you know. She is on the tall side. And Narissa's taller? Oh, <laughs> and I guess we're gonna see that, huh? Eventually, right? Once Advent gets their own 3Ds. I want to see that. <laughs> the Titans of Holomems. Yeah, I'm small now. There was a time where you could maybe say, Oh, you know, Mori is definitely like on the taller side. Because, you know, Myth as a whole is just pretty short, I think. If I'm the tallest myth member, I feel like almost every single time that new folks come along, it's like we gotta have a new shortest and a new tallest. They're just gonna keep getting shorter and taller. It's pretty funny to me. Almost all of the JPs are super short, that is also true. Let 
let me check to get an official look at hair. Okay. So cute. Kind of longer than I thought. Or at least on one side. The ribbons are a bit bigger than I thought. Yeah, there we go. Nice request. <laughs> Cute, she wouldn't like you saying that, then don't tell her. <laughs> I'd never call her that to her face. My reference. Well, that's kind of a cute smile. Yeah. Calmly, cutely, politely asking you to get some help. I just imagine in in word art text written across her right here like a rainbow. Get some help! <laughs> Stretch! <sighs> that is correct. <laughs> Alright, can't forget the microphone as well. Eh, we don't need it in there. Looks fine like this. All right, now let's get to drawing some lines. Also, sorry if these aren't super high res. I had to fit like a bunch of them into one, one canvas. I think that it's, it's fine. It's high enough res. Save check. Yeah, because um, Paintful Side does not have an autosave function, sadly. Let's see. Quantity over... <laughs> yeah. Quantity over quality for once. For once? <laughs> yeah, maybe. both. Oh, no, 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 no. You're very kind. Thank you. Um, what are we doing tomorrow? I can't promise anything because I need to check the specifics of permissions, but I would like, I would like to try Red Dead Redemption 2 tomorrow. I'd like to try it and see how we feel about it. I just want to try. Um, cause I, I really, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I really want to use the sheriff outfit. <laughs> Yeehaw. The intro is pretty long though. All right, sign me up. I'm ready. I can handle anything. No problem. It'll be another long, long, long stream. <laughs> ah, but it's also the fifth, which means that we're also, we're going to be playing Mario Kart with Bay. Um, I don't know if I will stream that, but I know she will. And I will join. 
so. Are you a part of the Myth Collab? Yes. Um, it's gonna be fun. Um, look forward to it. Look forward to it, is all I'm gonna say. I don't know, I don't know what Kiara has said, so I'm just gonna keep the details to a minimum. A little money too? No. Yeah. But we'll see. You honestly liked Holo Money? It was a nice joke. <laughs> it was a nice joke. But anyway. Yeah. Um I think that I think that it will be pleasant. I think you guys will be happy. So but we'll see. Is it the song you guys announced? Um, we can maybe give an update on that, I think. Thankfully. So, look forward to it. It's a shame that Red Dead Redemption 2 is so controlling during the story parts. That's okay, I mean, I kind of like reacting to story as well. You know, more story-driven games and stuff like that. Yeah. Like, Yakuza looks really fun, but I think Bay is kind of in the the Yakuza obsession mode right now. Maybe I'll pick it up someday. But for now, if you want to watch Yakuza, Bay is streaming it. I think she wants to play all the games. Yeah. But maybe someday I'll check it out. But for now, I'm wanting- I'm really wanting to try Red Dead Redemption 2. I just want to see how I feel about it. What kind of vibe I get from it, you know? is great. The vibes are immaculate. Don't miss out on DMC or Yakuza, Mori. I'll think about it. I do want to play them. Ooh, Alan Wake could be really cool. I really have been wanting to try that out as well, but I don't know about permissions. <laughs> Gotta ask about permissions. I also don't want to start too many new things at this point, but I'll put in the request. The games list, it's growing even longer. It's a trap, you have to play them all in order. Oh well. Or he stopped putting so much detail into it. Now that I've already put detail into it, I feel like I have to kind of keep that up. That's okay. It's because I'm talking. <laughs> talking makes me kind of lose time paying attention to the details and not finishing up the drawing. Sorry, it's the artist way. I did put in the request, uh, put in the request for, um, what was it? I finally got the persona request in. It's 
So fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. And I also ordered a PS3. Is it three or four? I forget which one it was. Um, not PS3. I think it was. What was it? One sec. I'm supposed to check my <laughs> Amazon. Hold on a sec. It is the PS3. At first, I was I'm having a hard time like thinking about like old consoles when I want to play older games because the PS4 and PS3, my mind merges them together. Um, but for I want to play Armored Core 4 and for answer um, on stream. Can't you play PS4 games on your PS5? You can, yeah, but I guess Armored Core would be PS3. Kinda crazy. PS4 still new to you? I can see it. Time flies, you know, it really does. Tony flies. Okay. I'm gonna finish this real quick, just put it, just Put the details on. Doesn't need to be overly detailed, just. lazy with it, you know? But yeah, I'm really excited for Armor Core. I've, I've been wanting to play more so badly, and I know that we could do like some PvP matches, but I mean like I kind of want to experience a new story. And I was wanting to pick up Sekiro, but I feel like, um... After Lies of P, I'm kind of like, oh, let's maybe like wait for a second on that one. If they're very similar, because... But I just kind of want to put it on the back burner. I'm going to have to play all from software games sometime. But yeah, since the new year has come around, I've been thinking about like new adventures for us to go on, you know? I'm excited. Cute. I wonder if we could play Metal Wolf Chaos on stream. <laughs> Another one I want to play. Well, Tom played it on PC. It would be hilarious. We have to have the permission then, if Botan already did it. That game's a trip. Let me put it in my list. <laughs> it seems right up my alley, to be honest. could be really good and I do I do want to try it I really do why does nobody that I draw have a nose <laughs> fixed sister needs a nose too 
Okay. You could probably beat Metal Wolf Chaos in two streams. With how long I usually stream, yeah, I feel like maybe we could. Noses are so weird. Noses are so strange. Thank you for the wonderful request. Wow, Kyla looks lovely. Thank you very much, Koneko. Sign for you. Okay, and this is for... Making some more good progress, Deadbeats. Good progress. It's the Kyla Idol buff. Thank you very much, Koneko. The wonderful commission. Now, next up, we've got Kazuma. Ooh. Sorry, Kazuma. King Kazuma, who says, Hey, Callie, could you please draw a Deadbeat with an afro fist bumping with you? If that doesn't work, could you draw a Deadbeat running from you with your scythe brandished? Nolan is my name, thanks again. Awesome. You got it. All right. I'm gonna do the fist bump. <laughs> so many good ideas for me and Deadbeats, like, interacting. Fist bump. I'll make us the same height. I'll meet you in the middle, Deadbeat. <laughs> meet you in the middle. Hands on the hips. The fist bump is here. <laughs> that is where the fist bump is occurring. I've determined the location of the fist bump, and now... I just need to move. I need to get a little more space. Hold on. Okie dokie. It's a dead beat. The composition done. This is just a composition sketch. I gotta stop getting so detailed with the, the composition sketches, I feel. Because I get lost in it. I lost in the sauce. Dead beats, lost in the sauce. This bump has been located. Copy. There it is. Oh, there it is. There it goes. It's getting real late. We'll go ahead and, and take a load off and go to sleep if you must, Deadbeat. It's all good. Thanks for hanging out today. That's a pretty cool fist bump. We need to get the full goodness of the afro in there, so let's move it a little bit this way. We'll have the fist bump continue here from me. This is me over here. Mind casual outfit. I think that'll look cooler. What is this playlist? If you look up Hololive Lo Fi, there's a Bossa Nova remix video, and this is that. Totally up to you. Sounds good. Thanks. Okay. And that's what we'll do. Dun, 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 dun. Mm Okay. 
nice and bow-legged. We'll get a Cali song in one of these someday. Oh, I hope. That's my hope. I'll just wait patiently. Surely someday, right? It would be cool if they did like end of a life or something like that. Even an unalive song would be fine, honestly. Huge W where we riot? Oh my god. I don't even know what that would sound like. Because it's just such an, an off-the-wall song. <laughs> But, you know, Unison ended up sounding really, really beautiful um, in lo-fi, so... I mean, I like the original as well, but I feel like I like the remix even more. I remember, Maury's just, uh... Maybe we get the fist bump like this. Yeah. That kind of fist bump, okay. W Bossa Nova on a guy. Jeez. Scuffed up age though would actually be really good. Okay, Afro Dead Beat and then Casual Mori. Cap on. Okay. Got the basic sketch done. Let me move out of the way. <laughs> and now, onto the lines! I might switch the Bossa Nova track to a different one for now. Uh, yeah, Perms would be tough, but Future Island would be really cool. Yeah, I think it's just hard to do um, some of the UM songs, but if I really bargain for it, I bet I could make it work. Yeah. But in the first place, it's like they have to kind of want to make it, I think. to draw a uh, paint tool sigh is what it is called it's what I've always used all my life it's a really solid tool especially for how cheap it is it's like 50 50 dollars for license to use It does the basic stuff, though. You know, usually I'll take a drawing that I've done here and then um, I'll put it into um, Photoshop on my own. At my own convenience, I guess. And edit it more there, you know? You know, it kind of goes off the shoulder. Honestly, yeah, low-key, not bad. Clip Studio Paint is awesome. That's also what I hear. I really ought to give it a try. Right now, since I got, um, I got an iPad Pro recently, uh, and I've been using that, 
been using the, the iPad Pro um, to use to test out Procreate. It's nice. Oh no, it was a. Uh, I don't forget what my own outfit looks like. No, it's not like that. It's. Don't worry. I don't forget. <laughs> I'd never forget. No. Wait. I have a couple different wrapper hats, okay? It feels really smooth, right? And especially, like, at the Apple Store, they let you kind of mess with the, the iPads and stuff like that. And it was just so smooth. Using it there, I was like, whoa, okay. I guess I'll give it a try. I've really liked it so far. Is it the wrapper hat? For casual outfit? I don't think it's the wrapper hat. Sadly. There is a difference. could run the holo app pretty good yeah but i probably won't won't use it for anything like that it'll just be a a personal ipad for me to just doodle on and browse the internet i guess yeah Feels kind of weird to use. What do you use instead? Ah, oh, Clip Studio. You can use it on an iPad. I didn't know that. Hey, okay. Well, now I've got to check it out. All right. We're almost done here. They don't have eyebrows. <laughs> it's a monthly subscription. I see. Interesting. Maybe I'll have to check it out. If it's worth it, maybe I'll, I'll keep it. buy it permanently without the subs, that's kind of nice. That was all the features of the desktop version. I guess it kind of, I don't know, does it depend on maybe what you're using to draw? I don't know. Yeah, there we go. Thank you very much for your request. I'll sign down here. You can buy the permanent if you use it on PC, but for iPad, it's monthly only, sadly. Got it. Thanks for letting me know. All right, let's see, this is, all right.
is done. Bah! This will be on a different layer. Okay. This is what we have so far. That deadbeat is righteous. Love it. Pretty cool. It's a good request. All of them are pretty good. Really love the dinosaur one. In case you ever wonder what I look like as a dinosaur. <laughs> the next one, that's a really good one, Caffeine. They're all, you guys, you guys cooked here. Let's go. Caffeine, that's also a really good request. Doodle request from Caffeine. A smug looking bay in a mug of coffee like she's at an onsen with latte milk foam on her head. <laughs> that's so cute. You're a third of the way there, yatta. Okay. Third of the way there, but we're six hours in. Dang it. I don't know. Uh, we'll go down to the wire, I guess, on these. Um, maybe I can do them a little quicker. I don't know. Um, if we have to continue them, um, then I'll set a date on this stream um, for the next one. And we'll just finish them there, and I'll turn off the super chats for that stream. And we'll just finish these there. Yeah, whatever we gotta do. Hmm. Finale part two. It's okay. I won't overdo it. And then we'll just do um, one more quick opening and closing for requests. And then um, after that, it'll be me drawing you guys as deadbeat sonas. That'll be cool. Mm. Yeah, might as well stop halfway then. That's also a good point. And then we can read some super chats. And we can set a date on the calendar today for me to finish it in the future. Uh, this month. This month. Earlier would be better. Maybe the 11th, it looks like I'm free. Okay, let's see. Eleventh, um, which is the tenth, um, for America. Finish the cards. Cool. All right. I'll still do as many as I can today, though. Do you know when you'll do the next commission opening? Great question. Um, I don't think I'll stop halfway today. I think I'll go a little over halfway and then maybe not a little over. I'll, I want to get like two thirds done ish as far as I can. And then I'll finish the drawings on the 11th and there's a possibility I'll open them really quick then and then close them. Yeah. Um, but we continue for today. We continue, we continue. Yeah. I'm just looking at my calendar for the week. Seeing what's going on. Okay. All right, we've successfully changed the music. It's gotten dark so quickly. Huh. So we should get our akas ready for the 11th. Got it. Yes, I would say so. Mm. Get them ready for the 11th. Yeah, and also as a rule as well, if you get um, if you get a drawing, if you got a drawing this time, um, please do not request one during that stream so that everybody can get a chance. Everybody who wants to request one, um, or most most people that want to request one. Anyway, yeah, very interesting. Okay, um, interesting idea here. Oh, sorry, I skipped a little too far ahead. <laughs> right now we're drawing Bay in a mug of coffee. Okay, let's 
see. Let me get a bay reference. Where is that rat? Where's Bale Seikos? I'm gonna sneeze. There's the rat. <laughs> okay. Thank you for the blessings. Here we go. Cup of coffee. Onsen. Let me just drop it first. <laughs> I know exactly what kind of face she's gonna have. I can already envision this. In my head. It's so crazy that she has four ears. Poor oh, rat. I don't know if she's wearing any clothes, but we're definitely going to have the collar in here. I can draw a perfect circle. Not as perfect as Spongebob, but close enough. Close enough. definitely my favorite lo-fi mix video this one specifically it has so many of my favorite bangers but also it's like weirdly nostalgic to me for getting over it for some reason because <laughs> we listened to it while I was really struggling through getting over it that was another really fun one from last year and that I'm proud of myself for finishing You draw Michelangelo's David, then you erase the lines. <laughs> Just artist things. A latte foam on her head instead of Mr. Squeaks. I'm surprised no one's asked me to draw Bay as Steamboat Willie. Maybe next time. Don't do that. Ask for something you actually want. <laughs> ah, missed opportunity. Maybe someday. <laughs> I actually want that. <laughs> Thought someone thought about it. <laughs> Public domain bay? No way, no way. No way, no way. Eh? Baby, don't be scared. Yeah, one one side of the the twin tail is really, really long. How does she stream? <laughs> she finds a way though to not get too in the way. One side being bushier, she's just chaotic like that. Mm. She just do.
Red, white, and black are just perfect combination, to be honest. Excellent hair color. Did you see her Mario Kart training yesterday that was basically just trying to beat Iris's ghost on one singular stage for nearly three hours? I... I didn't tune in. I didn't see it, but I heard the rumors. <laughs> and I went in on that action. I went in on that action. It was the Sunset Wilds, right? Okay. Nobody tell her, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna get that record off stream. <laughs> and then when I meet up with her tomorrow, I'm gonna say, hey, bae. And she's gonna be like, yeah? Yar? That's not how they sound. It's nar. It's not yar. <laughs> she's like, hey, Callie. And then I'll sh and then I'll just send her the screenshot. It's it's because I want to push her. I want to push her to do even better. I do want to join in. I really battled it out yesterday. I know it's gonna be hard. I know it's gonna be hard to do, but it, I want I want to hear her reaction. If I can do it. If I can. That's, you know, pretty confident of me to just be like, oh yeah, definitely I could possibly do it when I probably can't, but listen. That's what's gonna be motivating me. Then we all get into a match together, somehow we get into the final, after the prelims, together, and then we just, we all choose Sunset Wilds as the track, and then Ian takes the go takes the freaking gold all the way back to, all the way back home. It'll be perfect. It's gonna be pretty rough, though. I'm ready for the challenge. I'm ready for the challenge. I watched a bunch of short cat videos and I'm still watching them. I'm going through the whole collection. They're extremely insightful. So I'm gonna keep studying. Wasn't that, wasn't that person literally in the luck? That was, that had to have been an imposter, right? You can't really tell, I don't know. We'll never know. Might have been an imposter. They were really good though. I mean, they won every single one. But maybe they're just a big fan. People impersonate him a lot, not surprised. Is Lorax character. Still cool though. It was really good. I mean, I guess if you want to impersonate the dude, you gotta be really good. <laughs> but, yeah, like the person pretending to be Mr. Beast in the chat. I mean, that was pretty obvious though. That was just silly. That person was being silly. And nobody believed. <laughs> What a cute idea. <laughs> but what if? Next thing you know, there's a video coming out on Mr. <laughs> Mr. B's channel. I was going to donate five million dollars the VTuber Mori Calliope, but she didn't believe it was me in her chat, so I just left and gave it to someone else. Can you imagine? <laughs> Mr. Beast funds the MV. <laughs> That'd be a funny meme. Please fund the MV, Mr. Beast. That's okay. I mean, I know we're just joking. 
but at the same time, I don't know, I think this is kind of more fun. Anyway. It's cool, it's cool. I'll just draw. I'll just draw and draw and draw. I don't need your handouts. I'm not going to be part of your system. You can't buy me money, man. <laughs> that tantrum level screaming, I'm an adult, is probably the sing the singular most comedic moment I think I ever witnessed as a as a young person. <laughs> as a young person. The juxtaposition <laughs> the display of the oxymoron, not through words, but through word and action combination, is just prime comedy that I think is so difficult to attain. Ugh, real art. Anyway. If you have a part of whole life shuffle, who do you want to swap with and why is it Ina? Probably not Ina, to be honest, in terms of like costume. Because I know that, that Mari and Sancho could do it, but I, I'd be too embarrassed. Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't do it. I, I'm a little more shameful. <laughs> um. I think I think we talked about this a little bit before. Um, I, mentioned, I said that I asked um, to do Dewey's Baka Baka, but I think they wanted a different song for her. I don't know. Um, Nerissa would be cool though, and I'd like. I heard that Nerissa wanted to swap with me, and I feel like that'd just be insane like an honor to have her sing one of my songs she's like god tier singing you know would be an honor and then to have to see her in my outfit would be really cool too i could dig it mm. oh yeah me and botan clothes could be really cool botan's made some bangers as well Right, we're almost done with this one too. Bay's hair is kind of detailed. I never, I never realized how detailed it is. Chill rat. Oh yeah. Okayu senpai doing doggy god street. Body dog street. <laughs> It is extremely difficult to do. The rap portion is the hardest part, but you know, the the hook isn't for chumps either. Okay. There it is, for caffeine. I'm just going to I'm just going to write coffee in big letters so that you know that this is definitely coffee. Coffee has one f, right? No, it's O F F F. It's two it's two. I knew that. I knew that it was two. I knew it was two. I knew it already. I knew it. I was just playing. I was I was trying to be funny. It was a bit It was a bit <laughs> a bit AP English, by the way. AP English, top of my class. Anyway, just a joke. <laughs> about the ES, oh, success? <laughs> I was just really happy about the new year and caught up in the moment and wasn't really, I was so emotional. There were tears falling on my, my tablet and I couldn't see where I was writing is all, sorry. I, I thought that I had put um, two C's in there, but it, there was only one. Anyway. Was 
Isn't I a teacher? Side swinging, yeah. But you know, you don't need to spell very good. Um, sorry, spell very well. <clears throat> uh, to teach scythe swinging, so. It's not exactly a requirement, so you know. Yeah. For caffeine. What a great request. Thank you very much for the request. I spelled caffeine right, at least. Yay. Very goodly. Mm. Thank you very much. The excellent request. And then next we have one for Da Bomb. This one's pretty interesting, kind of random. But Crony wearing Pecora's outfit, since both are prankster comedians. Thanks, Callie. Oh my god. What's that gonna look like? All right, I can make it happen. I'll need two references. Get the Kronster for hair, especially, and then we'll need a Cora. Speaking of a swap, indeed. Ooh, maybe a swap with Crony would be cool. I want to sing Crony's song that she hasn't released, the, the one with rap in it that she did at Connect the World. I want to sing that. If they would allow some EN swaps, inner EN swaps, wouldn't that be cool? Anyway, imagine. Yeah, I don't know about the release or anything, though only Crony knows about that, but when it releases, when it drops, it's gonna be great. There's so many you can swap with an EN. Yeah, I hope that they do more ENs next year. If they if they do it again, I hope they do it again. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna draw Crony in the same kind of general pose. How is Crony gonna fit in this outfit? In this outfit, she definitely has um, a lot going on. Probably the most in EN. <laughs> Even more so than Narissa, I would say. Which is saying something. So, I mean, I don't know. The same way Muna did. But didn't Muna have like a cover or something like that? Pretty sure he is not getting that outfit back. That's for sure. Ah, oh, yeah, she got the, the modesty cover. That is also what I would choose in a similar situation. Just, just me personally, that's how I feel. Because I'm shy. You guys know I'm shy. Just full on swapping with Narissa would be cool though. But I also want to wear Crony's outfit. I think they both would be good matches. Maybe I could sing a Kobo song and do a Kobo outfit someday. Was, was already technically kind of swapped this past year. Oh. Would be cool though. Hers is definitely one of my favorites ever, ever designed. Okay, 
Um, we'll figure out how this looks. We'll figure it out. <laughs> steal the iris horns. Yeah, I'd want to steal those. Could you handle the short skirt? Yes, skirt is different than the chest area. I can, I can handle it, it's just the chest. This is about where we're at right now. This is about, hey, PG-13, this is definitely PG-13. And I will keep it PG-13. So if it's not, if it's looking ya by, then I will edit it so that the black part is a little bigger. Good luck. As I mentioned, well, technically it's involving another member, so, so it should be PG. I've seen some things like this in PG stuff. Technically, just a swimsuit. I've seen, look, I've seen looter swimsuits than this, okay? I've seen looter swimsuits. So, don't worry about it. <laughs> this is the promise that I made to, to myself and to the audience. Bunny girl outfits. I've seen bunny girls in in PG movies. Besides, it's just a senpai's outfit. <laughs> and crony's outfit but yeah but see here's the thing i know why you wanted to see this because it's a great concept that's why and that's the only reason of course no other no other has some great concepts We've had some good ones. My favorite is still this one, though. Let me massage my hand a little bit, but you can keep looking at this. Hold on. Just massaging my hand. Will you be posting them on Twitter or something? It'll be a YouTube community post that links to a giga file that you can download. Everyone can download it. Great, great asset. Ah, hydrate, I almost forgot. Mm. Mm. Great dinosaur. This, you know what? This looks like a lethal company enemy. Whoever's making lethal company, I think that if you made this, as like um, a monster that's like roaming in the forest, I think it'd really be a hit. Anyway, save button. I don't think I've ever drawn so much in one sitting. It's great practice. It's our time, baby. Yeah, death herself roam in the forest, but as a dinosaur, I think would be cool. All right, we'll just draw the important part here. There we go. So you can kind of see 
this bit. But that's about it. You would throw a flashbang and run? It's not gonna work. Need something more potent. Something stronger. Like, um, a whoopee cushion. Or a horn. Clown horn? That's how you scare it away. Throw rocks works every time. What about the boom box? Yeah, that's the one. I think the one <laughs> creature where if you use a boom box, it becomes docile. Callie's already blind. A flashbang wouldn't work. All right. That's just your opinion, Deadbeat. It's just your opinion. Okay. We've made some good progress here. Time for crony hair. Uh, let's see. Oro koroni kronichiwa. Kronichiwa. Band. So they might have some, some trouble drawing. It's kind of detailed. It's okay. My hair goes over that part. And antennas. <laughs> you mean these? Some pretty, pretty big antennas. But yeah, they do give me that vibe. looks concerned. Uh, Mori? Why did you draw me in this? Nah, her voice is more sultry than that. But she wouldn't be trying to make it sultry. It just would be. <laughs> Mori says, you know why. was supposed to be the composition sketch. Hold on. Eyes a little crooked. There we go. So concerned. Okay. Nice. 
almost done with your doodles. Uh, almost a third of the way. Wait, maybe we are a third of the way. You've drawn. Almost, almost. Mostly. Yeah, just, just over a third of the way done with today. <laughs> I didn't think they'd be this popular. But you know, I'm really happy. You know, I'm really grateful. I have a lot of hope. Um, that the MV is going to be great. You know, thanks to you guys helping fund it. What better way to fund it than with some art of my own? You know? Yay, my favorite song. We believe in you. Thanks, guys. I'll keep doing my best. Here it is. Such a good song. impressed by how much work you do. Thanks. It's just fun. It's because I have a good time with it that I do it a lot, so that's all. But thank you. I guess I could rest a little bit more. I was kind of thinking that the other day, like, huh. Maybe I should, but... There's too much I want to do. Stop being so detailed, Maury! Jesus, it's not supposed to be this detailed and now the rest has to be that detailed. Oh my god. You don't need to be too detailed. Thanks for the reminder. <laughs> Thank you for the reminder. I wonder what's for dinner. Oh boy. I don't know. I don't even know what I want to eat. I really haven't thought about it at all today. I've just been streaming and playing Mario Kart in the morning. That was really it. If anything, Mori, stop being detailed because it's not fair to the deadbeats whose you don't do detail. Yeah, that's right. Uh, but when it involves my my friends slash coworkers, I'm like, oh, I want it to be really, really, really good. You know, pasta, pasta. You can never go wrong with pasta. Most of the time, you can't go wrong with pasta. Depends on the pasta, though. on the pasta. Okay. Let's see. Gosh, Crony's legs are just so long. 
she is long. I'm only now realizing <laughs> any advice for an artist to not lose motivation on personal art, piece, or project. I know it's it's really hard to like um, keep working on something when you don't feel like you have a reason to. And if you don't have a reason to, then I'm gonna be honest, you should not. Um, but you gotta think about the reason why you're working on something, you know? And if you fi figure out the reason, if you find that reason, right? That may help you find some motivation. For example, um, if you wanna draw something just for fun, then I feel like um, just take a break. That's like a kind of a simple answer. If you're drawing for work, um, then try to try to think about you know all the future opportunities um, that you may have. Uh, you continue working and do so working well. Um, but at the same time, I think it just depends on why you're making art. Is it for work? Is it for fun? You know the reason that you're doing it. Um, affects very much like how I think you should maybe motivate yourself to continue onward with it, you know? But if um, if you draw for fun and you're having a hard time finding motivation, I think you shouldn't like force yourself to find it because if it's a fun thing, it should be fun. Um, and I think um, instead of forcing yourself, maybe like find something else to do for a while and who knows, maybe that motivation will be back after you've done something else for a little bit. If you're drawing for a living, though, it's kind of a more difficult situation because if you need to draw to put food on the table, it's rough. Um, but I, know, I have some friends who draw professionally, and a lot of times the things that motivate them to finish, or rather, uh, yeah, to finish their work, is thinking about drawing like their own original characters and stuff, and all the free time they'll have to draw the things they want to draw um, after they finish their work. You know? And some friends get really excited about the fact that, you know, a bunch of people will get to see uh, their drawings and the hard work that they did um, in, like, the next update of whatever, whether it be, like, a comic or a game or something, you know? Basically, it depends on the person. So, I know it's not the best answer, but I'm also not a professional artist, at least anymore. So. But, yeah. Everybody's got their own things that like motivate them and keep them at it, you know? Different things to motivate you to keep at it. But don't force yourself, because that's the worst thing you can do. It took way too long on this one. <laughs> I gotta try and make them a bit quicker. couldn't help myself. This is also really- you guys are too good at requesting things. You have too many good ideas. Actually, I should just use this nice rabbit ear. Yeah. Not for crony though, because they'll just go off the screen. <laughs> make her wear this. I don't know, for fun. Seems kind of cool. Kind of a least request. Nice. What playlist am I using? Look up Hololive Lo-Fi. And it's the newest one, actually. Maybe she does have bunny ears, but you can't see them. They're going off screen. Because they just do that. And that's it. We're done. We're done. We are done. We are done. We're done. We're done. We're done. 
We're done. We're done. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta be careful when you're drawing perfection, deadbeats. You don't want to make her mad. If you do like a bad job or something like that, you know? Anyway, <laughs> just, just to be careful. Gotta be careful. The embodiment of all perfect things. Anyway. True, true. She'd say that's perfect. Maybe. I'd hope so. And it's for the bomb. Thanks for the request. I'll sign it here for ya. Okay. For the bomb. We got two left on this particular page. Yeah. And then I guess I'll see what I want to get. I don't know what to have for dinner. I don't know what to do. Me too down, 37 to go. Woo! We're getting there. We're getting there. It's crack. Crack. Maybe halfway would be good, but I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Maybe I can make the stream on the 11th extra long. I mean, I'm gonna have to anyway. But I'll try to make it even longer. Yeah. I've made it 12 hours. I'm glad you think it's a good idea. Um, I'm just trying to, to fund the, the MV, I guess. You know? Oh, Kiara does a, a cool thing with Polaroids that's pretty neat. sleepy I kind of thought oh maybe I should think of a way to um to save up some money for my music video after that so I was like well what if I did something like drawing for money yeah so but I do like the deadbeat sona idea a bit better just for the sake of my hand because I'm already kind of feeling it but I can I can definitely get halfway today. Mm. In a little over six hours, we've gotten a lot of doodles done. All of these. And then we can't forget the original set, which is these. Pretty nice. How are your hands and eyes doing? It's more, I think, my back that's gonna gonna be taking a beating, so I'll try not to overdo it and just do a bit more. Well, as someone who didn't commission anything to stream, I'm digging this. Just a super chill doodling stream that's been really fun to hang out in. I'm glad to hear that. Thank you for letting me know. I hope everybody's having a good time, even if I don't like talk as much as I usually do. You know? reading the next request. <laughs> Lori's cute when she's calm. What about when I'm not calm? Am I not... cute? Oh. When you're not 
not call me a riot, and it's great. Really? As long as... As long as it's a good thing, as long as it makes you happy, then... Okay. Cool. You're only getting halfway through for this batch. Will there be another chance for you to make a request? Indeed. Um, on the 11th, I'm doing an extra long stream where I finish these and then continue drawing just a bit more. And I'll probably open it for a shorter period of time, but it'll be kind of evening JST. JST time, so um, I think people who didn't get a chance um, to request today might have a better chance of requesting. 29 doodles in a day. I wish it was 50. I wish I was a faster drawer. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Super chats closed a long time back. They were open for like 20 seconds and it was a flood. <laughs> Correct. I thought they weren't coming, so I, I kind of screamed um, when they when they started showing up because it was like a bloodbath, making them pretty detailed for for doodles. <laughs> yeah. Well, good luck. I hope that that everybody who wants to get one will be able to to get one. Um, I hope. Um, at least for the, the requests. And then after we've done that, um, I'll be opening up um, the same kind of deal for, for deadbeat saunas. As in y'all is, y'all is in you guys as deadbeats and request how you want me to draw you. Um, and we can do more of those, I think. <laughs> yeah. I think we can do, yeah, more of those. Cause some of these, you know, have multiple characters and stuff like that. The next one, the next one has multiple characters. This one's from Asasa Sauce. My name is Squiggly Bomb Shoes. Wow, what a strange name. I hope people don't make fun of your name. I would like to request Mori visiting Choco Sensei to get her blood drawn. Actually, it's just Mel in a tiny nurse hat biting her arm. <laughs> That's a really cute idea. I like that. All right, let's see what kind of pose we're gonna do. Maybe me, kind of laying back, stiff as a board. And then I've got my arm out here. This is the Mori arm. And she's very close to me. She is like right here and I'm right here. And I'm like, oh my god. And then this is this is her. And she's like got her arm around me. Yeah. Yeah, to support me, because I'm stiff as a board. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mentioned um there'll be like a, a temp kind of a template. It'll just be um like five different like poses of sorts, I guess, that I'll just have like ready and then I'll use that as a base and I'll trace over them for for each person's kind of maybe cycle through them, um, but then customize them for each person and like their request, basically. This is kind of spicier than I, than I thought it would be. We're very close to each other. Wow. It's like we're dancing. Your mind is taking you places. It's not my mind. It's just the pose that came out. It promise. It really is. And that Mel is here. This is where Mel is. I've got my hand here. It's your mind, Cat. No, it's... I'm just drawing what was requested and then adding some of my own... No, you know, it's whatever. I'm just not gonna... 
make a big deal out of it. Maybe I do want to dance with Sensei, and not Death Sensei. I don't know, I think she's cool. We had a fun collab together, it was really nice. Remember, Mori, make them a little faster. Gachi. Gachi. Let me look up a reference. <laughs> Yabe. What's she gonna do? I'm sure she'll be very nice to me. Need to find that drawing I did of her from before. It was really, really nice. Wow. Beijing. Sorry, I'm looking at the reference. is increasing. Mel is biting my arm. <laughs> but I can't draw the red cross on it. <laughs> I cannot draw the red cross, so I'm gonna do a heart instead. <laughs> I'll get the details later, but here, give some bat wings. No crimes in this stream. <sighs> no war crimes in this stream. All right, Mori, pick up the pace. Pick up the pace. I'm like, wow, oh my god. I didn't know that you could do that. Are you a licensed professional? And I'll draw the facial expressions uh, with the lines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. It's kind of yabai. Oh well. Kind of yabai. Oh well. It's not. It's not. It's not even PG thirteen. We're just very close to each other. Maybe it is my mind taking me places. Be fine for the general sketch and now we go to the real thing See, that was fine I'm picking up the pace you guys Cheeky whisper. Sorry, I'm looking at the official art. <laughs> I've got it on a different window. Can you imagine being a, a streamer with only one monitor? 
I'm sure that there are lots of people that do it and do it well, but I'm very spoiled <laughs> with my almost three. It's technically three. It's like two and a half because one of them is ultra wide, right? I'm very lucky. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, we've come a long way since the rectangle. <laughs> Streaming on the rectangle. Yeah, we have. Get the ruffles those are very important yeah we can simplify them they don't need to be ex exceedingly detailed yeah no can't forget this part this hair with the bandage around it Ooh. Very cute. Is it even possible for it to be PG-13 when Choco is in the frame? Maybe not, <laughs> but we're gonna try. We're gonna try. To my fullest abilities. bumps the rating no matter what. <laughs> yeah. I guess I can make an exception to the rule then. If the holo mem in question is in essence PG-13 or above. No cloak for me this time. We only have like one more left for the this page in particular. That's kind of nice. Great progress. It's definitely taken longer than I thought, but it's manageable. take off my sleeve so that they could draw the blood properly. You did not have to draw her arm around your waist like that, but you did. I admire that. Well, it's just that I'm getting a little winded from the possibility of, you know, my blood being drawn, because that happens to me sometimes. I get, you know, pretty, pretty lightheaded and stuff, so... piece is kind of in the way. Excuses, excuses, Mori. Excuses, excuses. Okay. 
draw this part first and kind of figure out where these golden parts go. This is more the level of detail that I should be drawing these in. But then you look at the crony one and it's like, Mori, you did not have to go that hard. Cooked. Oh, too much. It's cool. I was a professional artist, so I, I can't help but put a certain amount of effort into it. It's just the principle of the thing. Can't forget Mel here. Fight, fight. Wow, there's Mel, thank you for helping. Ah, uh, these two, special combination. Perfect combination. Proink! Proinking my arm. What does that word even mean at this point? Doing something to. That could. <laughs> That could be taken out of context in a weird way. <laughs> it means everything. It's on the same level as guh by now. When was the first time I said that? Was it Mario? Was it Mario RPG? Four at least. Okay. A lot during Suica game. Boink. Was during a splash party swimsuit stream that you heard it? hearing it in one of your Jump King streams earlier last year. Really? I thought for sure it was a new thing. Pretty sure it started around Armor Core 6. That sounds a little more like I could believe that, but at least it's not tee hee. Oh my god. Has it been that long? I don't... I'm not gonna lie. I don't think so. I think it was about around Armored Core. more. Is the AC6 friends versus thing still happening? It should be. I did ask everybody on the 16th. And they said, they said, yeah. And it's going to be four of us. It's going to be me, Iris, Bibu, and uh, Ririka. So that'll be fun. Gachi. Got 
Versace. Meta build or just fun builds? Bunch of different ones, I think. I don't know. I'm excited to try different different ones. I'll probably play around with it a little bit. We're gonna need to train a little bit beforehand, but I'll probably do it on my own time, to be honest. I need to sit down and get in the lab. When's 12 hour star due? We put it in the calendar. I need to check for when. When was that? Hmm. Not finding it anywhere. It'll probably be either the 28th or 29th, though. A uh, JST. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. I look nerfed compared to Choco Sensei. Kind of unsurprising. Okay. This one's four. Squiggly. Four. Squiggly. Bomb shoes. Thank you for the request. Nice. It's the blood loss. Nose doke. Shh. I know, I keep forgetting the noses. All right. Oh, speaking of, this could use a nose. Maybe like, here you go. Ah, uh, Twin Mori. Where are you? <laughs> I believe that she exists. Anime girls don't have noses. You would think. Sometimes they have too much of a nose. Um. Wah, 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 wah. I keep forgetting the noses. All anime since 2008. She exists in our dreams. Mm. Yeah. I did not see her signature until now, but it's so nice to look at with the skull and the neatness. Thanks. It's a pretty cheeky one. I like it. It's simple, yet... I don't know. You can tell it's mine. And the skull... It's an important touch. Alright, now let's see. What do we got here? The next one... Can you please draw a cartoony, casual picture of you and a blue penguin wearing a crown playing games together? As an alternative, I would also like a tasteful picture of you at the onsen hanging out with non-specific penguins. Signed to Prince Penguin. That's such a cute idea. I like that. Okay, with a penguin? Let's go. Penguins are cute. Alright, I'll 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 try to keep it simple and cartoony. Just sit in together, playing some games. Maybe like in a more like chibi style fashion. Yeah, try to keep it like kind of cartoony. Penguin. Wallace and Gromit taught you that you can't trust penguins. <laughs> Those penguins. <laughs> Always causing mischief and havoc. Penguins have opposable thumbs? I don't think they do. Oh, that's okay. Try to make it cartoony, but not Nezumori. Because, you know, she's a character all her own at this point. And then here's a penguin. Penguin here. And the penguin play games too. With its non-opposable flippers. <laughs> Yeah. 
playing games. All right, should we go Club Penguin? <laughs> Let's maybe not go Club Penguin. Because then I get in trouble. <laughs> non <laughs> I mean, I don't really think that this... <laughs> Look, he's wearing a crown. It's it's different. Where were you when Club Penguin was <laughs> was kill? I was eating a Dorito chip. <sighs> no. <laughs> This is what kills the stream! No. Phone ring. Penguin ban RT. <laughs> oh, jeez. That's fine. We were never gonna play there anyway. Can you imagine, though? If we all stormed the Club Penguin server together? What if I didn't show anything on stream? What if... What if I just told you where we were? It would die a second time. Isn't the game shut down? I mean, I thought they made a new one, but I don't know. Maybe not. I'm gonna be wearing my PJs. Cause it's... it's pajama. Pajama time. Come here, little kitties. On my lap. Guess who's back with a brand new wrap? Um, I'll, wear, I'll be wearing the, the Death Sensei slippers. Ah, there's a new one. Yeah, the video essay is talking about what happened. You're right. I definitely saw some of those, but I kind of forgot about them. And I still am going to wear the tiara to match the penguin crown. I see a fan version or something like that yeah well no way we're getting perms for that so <laughs> missed opportunity but oh well oh this is kind of cute playing games, so it's a good game symbol. It's not going to get me sued. <laughs> Just so people know we're playing games. I'm traveling permissions. I bet we could grab those. Club Penguin, obviously. No, we're not. Okay. Cheat. Because I want to make sure that I can get to as many as possible. But I won't for everything. Hey, you know what? Work smarter, not harder, that's what they say. That's a penguin. Haha, <laughs> cheat! <laughs> ah, good old Hub Hotel, I remember that game. Not like I played it or anything. <laughs> what a time to be alive. You know, because death's been alive for a while. I've I've seen almost everything. How 
are you gonna press the buttons, little guy? How are we pressing those buttons? How are we gonna press them? Sounds like someone who's played it. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Okay. Penguin drawn. Cute. Now Mori. Wow. Cute penguin. Maybe I'll do a similar thing here. A little copy-paste action, but nothing too intense. Just enough. Just what I need. You know, to be samesies on both sides. You know? Yeah. Gotta sleep soon. I'll have a good rest. Thanks for dropping by to even say hello. I'm probably really beating this penguin because I have opposable thumbs. But give it your best anyway. Claw grip? <laughs> no, but how about the armored core grip? I kind of want to learn how they did it back in the day. Is that a real thing, though? My eyes look so silly like this. Let me fix it. I fix. The legendary armored core grip. Gotta try it someday. It's a real thing some people did. How do you even learn to play it that way? I mean, that's a whole different way of playing it that you gotta learn. You know? Mm. Yeah, the limited mapping space and the, they had the lack of the double stick, yeah. Dang. It's cool they figured out how to do it though, make it work. Gamers find a way. Yes. Sensei slippers. Any of you guys get your Death Sensei slippers? Hopefully by now. If not, they should be coming soon. But I wear mine every day. And Ghost Cat is terrified of them. You're wearing them right now. Let's go! Let's go! They're great! Got them a while ago. Aren't they high quality? They're very comfy. <laughs> Death Sensei, too scary for Ghost Cat. Yeah. Ghosty's really afraid of them. Whenever I walk around in them, he just flies. Flies under the table. Poor baby. And then I see him purposefully go out of his way to avoid walking near them. What's so scary about him, Ghosty? Not that scary. Oh, baby. How are you? Keep 
dokie. We're not playing Club Penguin together. I'm gonna give this crown a couple gems. I'm playing a game, so I'm just gonna have it be a game controller. Like, hey, we're playing a game together. In case you couldn't tell that we're playing a game. Apparently it's a PS1 game. Because there's no analog stick. What console is this? It's the Mori 64. The Mori... The Mori Cube. The Mori Rectangle 64. It's a super exclusive. Only me and this penguin have it. Yeah, you remember those days. Probably the best console ever made, to be honest. It's a shame they don't make games for it anymore. Can you imagine if I had tried to make my own console <laughs> like some <laughs> like some other people have done in the past? I heard that there's some rappers that tried to do that. <laughs> the death box, the Mori Sphere. <laughs> A Roomba can run Doom? Wouldn't you call it a Doomba then? Maybe that was the joke. Hold on. I don't think that's possible. <sighs> KFC is a rapper. No, I was referring to someone else. I didn't know KFC did that though. That's news to me. Four? Prince? Penguin. It's a cute name. Prince? Penguin. Yay! Another batch done! Thank you very much for your commission. And thank you everybody for your commissions. Here's the second batch. KFP gotta put out their own console to compete. Yeah. And it only has Kiara fan games. Well done, Callie. Thank you! Ugh. My hand is definitely feeling it, so I'm gonna figure out what I want to eat for dinner. And just chill for a second. And talk to you guys. And we'll see how many more we can get done. But, yay. Yappa. Nice work. Nice work. It would make a billion dollars, yeah. The KFP market is strong. Gotta get those stonks up. Oh yeah, I started in... Bleh. I started investing, but it's more of like a, I'm just dipping my toes in the water because I don't understand how any of it works. But I'm buying stocks. Investing. I just don't, I don't know how to do it. I probably need to like call a broker and like get some help, but Stock exchange is kind of wacky, but so many board games. No, 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 it's not like that. It's no, it's it's like it's like buying stocks, like stocks. But I only threw like a little bit, a little bit of money in there, and I'm just I'm just playing with it right now. Index funds is the way to go. You can't go wrong. You know, actually, my my manager said that weirdly enough, because I got into the the conversation of investing with my manager, and Manichan was like look into index funds. I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah. Hmm. So, I'm looking into that, but, yeah, because I don't really have a clue. Um, but, yeah. It's gonna be interesting. I just feel like I, I definitely should start looking into it just as, um, as a, for the future, you know? Might as well do something with it, you know. Remember, never take advice on stocks from the internet. <laughs> yeah, I've heard lots of conflicting advice, etc. So, but I do think it. Yeah, it might be a good idea just to put some away, even if it just accrues a little bit over time. You know, but that's nice. 
Remember to never take advice on stocks from chat. <laughs> the general advice is fine, but what to invest in is a little... I probably should do my own kind of very intense research on that um, before I do anything drastic. But I don't think I'll do anything drastic, to be honest. I just, I think, yeah, just going simple with the, the index fund might be good. You know? We'll see, we'll see. I just figured I should I should try it, you know? Stonks. Donkeys. You know? Just to, just to give it a shot. Because I'm curious. And I ought to do something with, with the amazing support that you guys have given me. And I, I want to build my own house someday, you know? It's a lofty dream. You can't just get it out of nowhere. So I think putting it away somewhere safe where, you know, it can grow over time. Like a plant, like a little house plant. Yeah, invest in Mori coin today. They say that the it's going up. <laughs> We're taking Mori stocks to the moon. Yep. Are you self-researching or using broker investor for help? Um, family recommended that I go to a broker for help, so I'll probably do that. But I'm also trying to do my own research just so that I know what's going on on the inside. I want to know, I'm really curious about what's happening to that money and how it accrues value over time, etc. Why not to Mars? Let's go to Jupiter to get more stupider. <laughs> That's such a silly line. Worry to the moon. Ooh, physical, physical gold? Do people buy that? People buy physical gold just to hold on to it? Go to Uranus to get more famous. Isn't that what it is? Ah, just meant for savings, not investment. I see. We call them gold Bugs. Oh, I'm learning so much today. It'll never be worth nothing. Mm. Gotcha. It's like freezing your assets. Yeah, because no matter what happens, you got your gold. You no? Know? Interesting. I can kind of understand. I can understand what that means, actually. Hmm. <laughs> I know the net. Sleep on it like a dragon. Hoard it in my, my treasure cave. <laughs> well, better than letting it rot in the bank, I guess. I don't know. Gotta do something with it. Mm. Deadly winks. Not deadly, but deadly. Dragon Mori. Yeah, like Smog. Like Smog from that movie that Kiara likes a lot. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm not stupid. <laughs> I just like to see the reaction sometimes. Carefree Mori just likes to see the reaction sometimes. Cats? <laughs> no! <laughs> Hold on. If you're not joking, that's worse than me. <laughs> Smog from cats. What would Kiara's reaction be to that? <laughs> I wonder. He's Jork. Oh, Nas. whole lot of supers we've been drawn for. It's interesting because the the blue one that's in the middle is like a nice little bookmark or like benchmark that sh like a checkpoint for hey you've done about half. Kind of cool. Dun, dun, dun. How many have you done? 12 plus 12 is 24. I've done 24. So, we're very close to being halfway there. 
once I do like half of the next batch. Yeah. Well, maybe Vlad is the half, so we'll be going like slightly over half. Uh -huh -huh. What's... I wonder what's for dinner? I guess I should look while I'm resting my hand. Dun, 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 dun. What's for dinner? Are you posting these anywhere afterwards? Yes, the community tab will have a link to Gigafile with all of the, the artwork that has been done today. Mm. It's only kind of unhealthy things available right now. I'm gonna kind of scroll for a while. Yes, the later it gets in the evening, it starts to be that's all that there is available. <laughs> Soup curry is pretty good. Curry udon is also delicious. Spicy. Even the spicy soup place is not, not in operation. <laughs> if I did get soup curry, though, you would definitely not be hearing me slurp it. Good old hot dog sushi. Hey, hot dog sushi is good. I don't care what anyone says. It was delicious. I was I was really surprised at how delicious it was. Oh, you know what? I found an incredible spicy noodle place that has cognac noodles. And it was damn near the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. Maybe I'll get that. I just gotta go look through my history. Where, oh where? Dun, 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 dun. Where did I put it? Spicy noodles, spicy nudes. <gasps> found it. Yeah, I found it, okay. Operation. All right. <laughs> Extra spicy. No, 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 no. The normal spicy is perfectly fine. Then they have <laughs> volcanic spicy noodles. I want to see Kobo's reaction to the volcanic ones. <laughs> I want to. I just want to see how she reacts. Let's just get the regular. Ah, cognac. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I get a bunch of those. Okay. Spice level. Um, I mean, I kind of like... I like where it's at right now. I don't need to add more. <laughs> you can add chili peppers. No, might be too mild for too easy for Kovo. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't need that. I'm. I just want regular spice. I can handle spice, and I like spice. I do. I genuinely like it. Um, but I don't feel the need to go too hard into it, you guys. But that's as weak. No, that is weak to nothing. Except cats and there are a lot of things I'm weak to. I'm now realizing cats, my cute friends. Also, no, I'm strong against sleep, but I do like sleep a lot. Cats the movie, not cats the movie. Don't get it twisted. I have nothing to do with that movie. I was referring to, to Doodoo Dada and Ghost Cat, which I really hope they're okay. I need to go look and make sure they're okay because I have been streaming for over seven hours so far and it's not ending yet for a little bit. So let me go check on them. I need to make sure they're okay. I love them very much. Be right back.
Sorry, I was playing with them. Sorry, I was I was playing with them. They were both chilling on the couch. And it was really cute. I knew it. I knew it. I'm too predictable. Yeah. Sorry. I'm too predictable. My cats are too cute. It can't be helped. Ah, my babies. God, they are so sweet. I can't take it. Yeah, I'm all... All right. Let's see. I have more juice. I've brought more juice. Well, this one had like a weird lid on it. Oh, you must... This one's cherry. Oh, there is alcohol in there. Wow. Okay. I did not realize that. Oh, only 6%. Yeah, that's probably fine. Ah, we're juicing. Cherry wine cooler? Probably kind of similar. Oh no, you're making me... <gasps> you're making me think about Stardew Valley. When you said cherry wine, and then I thought about cherry wine and Stardew Valley. And now I'm thinking about Stardew Valley and now I want to play it. That you dislike the sounds? It's different drinking and eating. <sighs> anyway, the kitties were very cute. I did a little laser pointer, played with them for a little bit. I'll play with them a little more after we're done today. If I'm not sleepy, I won't be sleepy. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. It will be a-okay. We got this. We're actually going faster than I thought we would at a certain point. So that's good. Mm. 6% is light. You'll be good as long as you don't drink too many. Yeah, it's only one that I got. I just randomly found it at the convenience store and thought it looked good. I didn't know that it had alcohol in it. Now that I think about it, it was kind of close to all the beers and stuff like that. Oh well. Let's see what we got next. Next up is K-Walk. Let's see. Hello, Miss Mori Calliope. Whole live English Ian. I'd like to request one of the following doodle options. Nothing. LOL. Enjoy the free money, Dad. Dang it, K-Walk! As you wish. <laughs> Here's your nothing. But I, I have to sign every single one. Jesus! <laughs> Thank you. That's very, very kind the free money <laughs> for K-Walk what a chat the bamboozle <laughs> hurrah hurry only 4 minutes 50, 30 seconds left all done do you like it I worked really hard on it Mori in her real form censored for fragile human eyes? Might just be. Might just be. Add the words nothing out of spite. Nothing lol even. Nah, it's okay. I think this is good. The point gets across right here. <laughs> it's everything I wanted and more. So I'm glad to hear that. Probably my magnum opus from tonight even. Thank you, K-Walk. <laughs> Big ups. Big ups to VDragon348, whose request is as follows. Let me see. Oh, I'd love a cute deadbeat dragon doodle to match my username in red since that's my favorite color. I want to use it as a profile picture. If it's too complex for for time, a turtle or rat works too. Sign it to Tori. Thanks. Okay, you got it. I can do a dragon. Um Let's see. It's gonna ha it's gonna be a deadbeat like a, a deadbeat skull dragon though. I, I can't. I don't think I'm gonna draw um like the bone structure of a dragon, but I'm gonna give you a dragon skull. Let me look up what a dragon looks like. We think in like mystical, mythical Dungeons and Dragons dragon or like Ord from Dragon Tales. Let's go. Let's go like a mix, like a kind of cartoon. This one's kind of cute. Okay, I think I have a kind of cute idea of what we can do. My phobias though, I'm not afraid of dragons. I'm not. I'm just kind of scared of them in games. Well, that's a ways to simplify. Okay, I kind of have 
I see how this could, this could work. All right, um, I'll do like a dragon skull. Lion, what does a dragon skull look like? It's, it's not too difficult, I'll figure it out. Okay, ooh, okay, that's kind of cool. That's cool. All right. And we'll make sure that the lines are red. That's cool looking. I mean, dragons don't, it's not that they, I mean, they, they exist, surely, just, I mean, I know a dragon, but the anatomy is like, everybody's got a different idea of what a dragon skull looks like, right? I'll kind of make it cute though, maybe. That could be good. Fantasy dragon skull. Yeah. I love dragons. Such regal creatures, just not in games. I don't want to fight them. That's the one, the one thing. I love the dragons I know. This is kind of dragony, dragony skull. Cool. Yeah, and then gotta get the nose. Yeah, it's Year of the Dragon, isn't it? Cool. No, no more. <laughs> no more of those. I see what you're trying to do. Maybe this is kind of a cool dragon skull. I'll put a little eye in there or something like that. Cool dragon. If you want it to be a profile picture, maybe I'll focus on that. Have it be more like a portrait, kind of like the deadbeat portraits, except you're a dragon. Yeah. I guess this kind of counts as a, a deadbeat portrait. Definitely does. And we'll make sure it's red. Yeah. Cool, and then back to what dragons look like. I know what dragons look like. Like I said, I know a dragon. Let's give you some cool horns, maybe. We can do. Yeah, there we go. Those are cool. Yeah. Ooh, that's like some some Aragon shit right there. Let's go. Aren't you scared of dragons in games? <laughs> in games, Deadbeat, it's different. It's different. It's just in games, like Skyrim. They frighten me. I don't want to face them and Elden Ring. That's why I haven't beaten like any of the dragons in Elden Ring. I get so much anxiety from fighting them. They're just, they're big and they breathe fire. Spyro, Spyro is nightmare fuel, I get it. But Spyro's, Spyro's different though, because he's got like, he's cartoony and small and he's got a funny personality and... I'm talking like Aragon dragons. And like Elden Ring and Skyrim dragons. Dragon and Elden Rings, those are easy. No, I know, but I don't want to fight them. Here we go. Cool eye and a smile. Yeah, it's kind of a smile. It's more cool than anything, though. That's one cool dragon. 
I'll make the pen a bit thicker for this one. Why does the dragon have a lip? I'm just trying to think of how the jaw would look. Now it would be more like rugged. Yeah. What kind of sky What what of sky serpents then? Um also probably kind of scary. <laughs> Not gonna lie. You know, part of that actually may be because of smog. Because I remember that story from when I was young, and I remember being very afraid of uh, hearing it read to me. As a wee child in bed. I'll give you some scales, too. Did I draw my body? No, I didn't. That was um, Yukisame Mama. Oh, she gave me my human form back when all I had were bones. Kind of awesome. About wyverns? 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 No opinion. No strong opinion, at least. Kind of looking like it's from Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> I like this nose bone. I feel like dragons just don't really have, um, like really skin to speak of. Or at least it's very tight to the bone anyway, so it kind of just looks like a regular dragon. But cool and deadbeat-like. Maybe we give this deadbeat a headband. Yeah. There we go. Get a Mori headband on that, that dragon. Your forehead's kind of weird, though. Not in, like, a mean way or anything. Sorry. It's not what I meant. It's... It's not what I meant. Let's see, actually, I'm gonna find a different way. <laughs> the headband is not fitting on your head. I'll find a different way to make you more deadbeat-like. Not even the, the rapper hat only for rappers might work here, so... Hmm. Maybe the headband only fits around one horn. Yeah! Ellie says we look weird. No, never said that. That's a really good idea, actually. All right, we've got the band around your horn. It's the Deadbeat Honorary Band. And it's gonna have the Hone symbol on it. work. That'll be cool. Yeah. Dragon. Okay. Here we go. Gotta fill in the teeth. Ooh, kind of fierce. Strong enough to destroy any enemies of the deadbeats. Yeah. Oh, net. Maybe the easiest kanji for me to draw. It's so easy to remember. I did that from memory. Let's go. Dun, dun. 
You find Mori to be easier yourself? It is an easy one, that's for sure. Definitely easy to write. This one's also pretty easy. And this one. And this one. And this one. See, I can already write four, five kanji. <laughs> Now there's only a gazillion more to learn. I'll do some Wani Kani streams again. Anyway, there you go. This is your dragon. Okay, go ahead and give it a sign for now. I wanted to use it as a profile picture though, so I'll try to make the sign smaller. Actually, no, not everybody has Photoshop. Maybe I can include a version with and without the signatures. I'll do that. I'll do a version with signatures and without. Yeah. How to get the stickers? You gotta join as a member. do that there's a, a blue button below the video that says join everyone has paint though true true they do so if I saved it as like a PNG or something all right thank you very much for the commission V dragon 348 and next up we've got one for admin wonder thank you very much oh that's cute for the doodle, I just would like to see you in your Oyasumori outfit, giving a wink and blowing a kiss with a little heart. Surprise me with any type of pose, and you can make it out to... Mikey, thanks for doing this. You got it. No problem. Aye, aye, Captain. That one should be no problem. We'll do facing this way. Nice idea. You can't see it? It might not be available in your country. I don't know if some countries you can't join membership, right, guys? And if that's the case, I'm sorry. Let's see. How about something like this? That's unfortunately still a thing. Really? And I really hope that they fix that. everybody to be able to join if they can. Oh, so there are some deadbeats that would totally join and get to use the emotes but can't because YouTube doesn't let them be a member? Aww. Man. Maybe something kind of cheeky like this. Hold on. Mm. I'm looking at my, old, my own hand. <laughs> blow kiss. So I'm actually gonna blow kiss. Make it look better later. But for now, this is what I got. 
I can straighten it out. Hands are hard, but you know what? I'll fix it. Just want to get the basic. Ooh, that's a weird looking arm. Here. Maybe move it a little further away from you, Lori. For just a sec. Okay. Oh, yes, and Lori. There we go. Much better. But needs to connect here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, would it would you would it be okay if I used your twin as a reference pick for a TTRPG character in your friend's game? Sure. No problem. As long as it's not something that's like making money or something like that, you can do whatever you want with it. good idea. <laughs> that was a really good request. All right. Oyasumori. I'll need to look at the reference again to get the full details, but it's something kind of like this. Just my standard nightgown. Yeah. We'll do twin tails for this one. Not big enough. Jesus! It feels weird drawing myself drawing myself like that. Bigger! Draw yourself. <laughs> That's what you wanna see. I'll just give myself a boob job real quick, I guess. You're just going for accuracy. If you say so, Deadbeat, if you say so. Gotta stay on model, I suppose. The red dress is kind of nerfed though, actually. If you look at it, you'll notice pretty immediately. Again, I gotta not spend too, too much time. Okay. There we go. Just a bit squeezed, that's all. Just a bit in the dress. Something to this effect could be good. With a nose, of course. Naturally. Yeah. Nice. What kind of 3D would I like to have next, Callie? Um, I already kind of answered, but I kind of want to do another show someday, and I feel like I'd want the dress to be kind of like, um, to be some near automata, near automata. <laughs> it's not automata, automata. That's what I would like to see. Yeah, kind of similar, but maybe, um, 
not the same like shoes you might want like ankle boots or something and then like full armed gloves that extend like from the dress yeah i have a whole idea already for what i want um but need to get that to happen first so Um, I should look up the reference, even though it's it's fairly simple, thankfully. English. <laughs> so you're saying you don't get enough by fan art as it is? I mean, fan art is great. I just want official. <laughs> I mean, now this is this is nice, the kimono. I'm looking at the kimono one. But most of my stuff is like long pants, long dress. The kimono is pretty nice, but like, that's my calves. I want thigh. Which is why Oyasumori is really great. Anyway. <laughs> oh, I did make the, the twin tails too high up. Now that I'm looking at it. I should have just changed into that outfit because I have it. I can just look at it. It's here in front of me. Yeah. It do look cute either way, but we're going for accuracy. <laughs> going for accuracy. Yeah, I feel like in, in 3D I just don't don't have anything that um that shows that that part the thighs so thought why not you know why not go for something like that next time something a little more I don't know I don't want to say ladylike a little more feminine I guess yeah that's what I want for next time We'll see. Nothing that shows off the ass. <laughs> well, see, that's the thing. Everything is usually the chest, you know? Alright, I gotta get moving on this. Get moving, Mori. Mori's moving. Jeans are a pretty good look, I don't know. <laughs> They're alright. <laughs> I like them. I like them. But I just kind of want to try something else, you know? Never want to do the same things over and over again, right? Eight hours? It's about to be longer. Thousands emo jeans are due for a comeback soon. Are you tired though? Stay hydrated. I'm okay. Hold on a sec. ripped garments um, around my grandparents <laughs> they would say did you do that yourself to them <laughs> and I'm like no I didn't I bought them that way and they'd get this look on their face roll their eyes <laughs> That's just grandparents, though. 
Why would you pay for something pre-wrecked? Kids these days. Did you do that to them? <laughs> kind of with them on that one. <laughs> hey, everybody's got their own taste. I liked the torn style, though. It's just... I don't know. It's for me. It's just my style. these days. Occasionally though, I have like one pair that I like, but it's mostly sweatpants these days. Now this is a taking a little bit of liberty with my bangs. I kind of made them more like side swept, but hey, who can keep their hair and bangs perfectly intact all the time, especially when you're about to go to sleep? Hard to do. similar fashion sense? Hmm, I can believe it. It's kind of cool. Recently it's kind of boring, but it's because I don't really leave my house much. <laughs> Just the usual underworldian uniform for streams. But sometimes, you know, pajamas, etc. But then after that, it's a sweatpants and big shirt. <laughs> I mean, what are my cats gonna say? <laughs> if anything, they think it's more cozy to, to snuggle that way when I'm dressed very casually. You know? Too long. Chew, quite a big man. If I did some nails. Ooh, walk, walk, fashion baby. are the last thing that you think about when you're working on doodles, after all. Nihongo sugoku umai. Ureshi. Arigatou gozaimasu. Onmari tsukatte nai kedo, saikin. We should do a JP stream again sometime soon. would be pretty fun, I think, maybe. JP streams are always nice. JP Rose deserves some more. Mm. Yeah. I want to find some time. Yeah. Radden and I still have to do a Nihonshu stream together. We both really want to. Anyway, I hope that this is alright. 
Thank you very much for your request. Cool. This was a cute one. Okay, this one... I'll sign here. like because my Japanese isn't good enough though I wouldn't be able to understand it to its full potential you know I wouldn't be able to enjoy it thoroughly I think my Japanese needs to get better first all right almost the first line done okay next up we've got something for the tail oh that's cute Hi, Callie. I'd like to request a drawing of Mume and you giving each other a hug. I think that would be cute and have a feels-good vibe. Cool. Thank you so much for the request. That's a cute idea. Yeah. Considering I've already hugged Mume in real life, I guess we might as well draw it. Let me look up a hug pose. <laughs> Just as a reference. Aw. Cute. I like that. Alright. I have my reference in front of me. Boom hug. That I can draw. Cool. Nice. Awesome. Boomers. Hey, look, there's a hug emoji. Very, very convenient and useful. Very convenient. Look, there it is. <laughs> yeah, you guys found it. to draw a lot too actually I just remembered I was trying to think about who who in promise draws a lot yeah because in council we had sauna that, that drew um, but Mume also draws a lot cute cartoony picture so we'll keep them a little bit bigger than normal drew Mokoko and made her look like a soccer mom. <laughs> That's kind of awesome. <laughs> a soccer mom. <laughs> I'm gonna wear my casual outfit for this one. Maybe also Mume wear her casual outfit too. Wait, no, I, I have my... I'll do... I'll do my usual uniform. I can make it work. Or, you know what? Actually, still 
showing. Moko ko soccer mom. Oh yeah, I get it because of the back seating. <laughs> now it all makes sense. all the sketches. Ah, that's Fuawa. Well, sometimes... Fuawa's the backseater, true. Don't they kind of backseat each other, though? It's the hair, isn't it? <laughs> Mokogo plays most of the time. Just sister things. You gotta backseat your sis every once in a while. Okay. I think we kind of got the basic sketch here, but I'm gonna need to draw some hair. For you. Good night. Have a nice evening. Thanks for sticking around for as long as you did, though. I know it's really late for a lot of people, so don't feel pressured or anything, but thanks for joining in. Okay, now look up Mume reference. Mume casual reference. Mume and Bay have the same kind of like white hair with black streak deal thing going on. Wow. Chaos. So there is a little bit of chaos in there after all. Oh. I never doubted. I I always believed. Long sleeves, very very long. But so cute. Awesome. Ten thirty AM where you are? Are you EST? No, it can't be. Maybe EU? Neck is feeling pain. All right, we'll draw up until the halfway point, as mentioned before. It's a lot of art done today. Maybe 
maybe read some supas from when Crimbo was happening. Mary Crimbo. Yeah. Hydration check. You got it. I say as I don't. <laughs> As I don't. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll do it. Just. I want to finish some lines. I'll do it. I will. I love this song so much, too. High Tide. I tried to learn it as well um, before New Year's, but I wasn't happy enough with it. Because I feel like I can I can do a good job. Like I wanna I wanna do it justice, but I need a little more practice. You guys know how I am. <laughs> Such a powerful song though. It really fits Muna perfectly. Very much like an image song for her. You know. Also very strong in that song. It's really good. Still ongoing, indeed. Maybe for a bit longer. I drink water in a sack. In a, in a moment, I promise. In a moment. No, I'm definitely going to. It's just... Alright, I'm doing it now. All good. Drink with the with the little angry face emoji. Is this your longest stream? No, no, it isn't. It is not. The longest stream I've done is tw twenty four hours. Twenty four hours stream. And there will be another one. Not sure on the exact date, but I'm organizing it right now. Oh god. <laughs> February is going to be insane. Absolute lunacy. There's gonna be a 24 hour stream, a 12 hour stream, and then a week that's just full of collabs to promote something. It's... Ooh. Because I thought that we were gonna do some of those things this month, but it turns out, no, it's, it's, uh... It's next month. <laughs> and it's all around the same timing, so... It's just a lot. No rest for the wicked. Born to be wicked. We just 
gotta forget mess with it. I like it like this. It's because it's a doodle. It's better than not for now. Yeah. There we go. for the request. I'll go ahead and write your name and my signature. Verify stream for authenticity. <laughs> this one took a while, but we got through it. Um, yeah. Keep on crunching through them. Cute, cute, cute. Mori Moon. Alrighty, let's see what we got here. Next up, we've got something for Vlad. So let me read these really quick. <laughs> this is kind of cute. Add some of ideas involving cosplay. Pick your favorite. Callie in Kiara's outfit, posed like her pop-up figure, shyly glancing to the side. Or Callie in Crony's outfit, <laughs> doing an Ojo Sama laugh viewed from a slight low angle from Vlad. I like the Kiara one, I think. Yeah, I think I'll do that one. I like both, but I think this one will be easier on my hand. Found it. Cool. Have all the pop up parades come out yet? Cake reduction incoming. I'd never. I could never. Not to Kiara. Don't think Ames or Ina's did. I think that Ames very recently came out because I see her included in the lineup. And then it's just Ina missing in the lineup. Gotcha, interesting. Okay, I'll try to do the pose well. No cake reduction. No cake reduction. I'm no fool. I gotta remember, it's me. It's a me, a Morio. If anything. I wonder, is Kiara's butt flatter than my- No way. I wonder who does have the flatter butt. Oh, maybe it's me. I don't know though. You would think I would have seen by now. It's a me, a Morio. This 
a good pose though. realize she has pink fingernails. Well, I didn't just realize that. I've always known, but I feel like I'm really thinking about it now. You know? Kiara fighting for the assets. Hey, you guys got fire and ice, and there was a... There was, a, there was something nice in there for you, but it's probably kind of Uru's work, so... Lots of thanks to Kana Uru for that. She recently whipped her pants. That is true. <laughs> and then there is the time. Yeah, my time as a waitress. That was a special time in my life. I can never forget. I can never forget. <laughs> that story. never have to return to that place. <laughs> Sometimes I do think to myself, though, mm, maybe it would be nice to just take a day to go work the cash register again. <laughs> Not waitressing, but I liked the cash register when I worked it once upon a time. One so bad. But I also worked at a pretty decent place. I was lucky for that. Otherwise, it would have been like restaurant time all over again. Oh, the collar actually is pretty high up. I don't really see Kiara wear this anymore. I'm realizing. But I like it. Do you need a break? I'm fine. But I'm not going to continue on for much longer. At least drawing. But I have a new date set. The 11th. January 11th, JST. Where we'll finish them up and open them up for just a little bit more. them in time because <laughs> it might be a bloodbath but I'm very lucky that there's been so much hype and support for this thank you yeah her default attire the KFP workers uniform I don't really see her wear it much but she's got lots of nice stuff to wear so Understandable. I wonder, do I use both hats? Yeah. I think I will. Hard to be a bloodbath when we're all bones. Also, you make a really good point. have marrow that produces blood you're not wrong I also I'm pretending like I knew that already but I I didn't you learn something new every day all right 
I am not going to go into detail on this. I will just do the basics. It's something like that. And there's a belt. There we go. Still living Skrellingtons, do we constantly bleed? Or are we magic? Um, I don't know. Every dead beat's different. Up to you, really. <laughs> Whether you bleed or not. random meat on your bones. If that's how you see yourself, then let it be so. And hopefully I can make the lines quick because I spent quite a bit of time on the composition. Jaw, truly magic, also true. That you can. That's gotta be magic, right? Who else would you be able to do that? Making me hungry, Deadbeat. <laughs> don't say that. That sounds kind of yummy. I don't want to think about you that way. That's messed up on several different levels. Deadbeat. Okie dokie. We're getting somewhere. Gotta wiggle my fingers. There's just one more before the blue super chat. Which pretty much marks... It's a little... It's like one over the halfway point. But... Can I even play Mario Kart after this? If that's even possible. Eh, maybe. I don't know. If it uses different fingers. <laughs> Drifting is gonna be tough, because I use my right hand for the drift. And if I can't drift, might as well give up. I got excited because I started playing online again, right? Um, and I was like, oh yeah, nice! I'm like, actually doing okay. And then I realized that it matches you with or it tries to match you with people that are your skill level. <laughs> and I'm like, dang it. <laughs> I wasn't getting as good as I thought I was. Oh well. Like ranked matches. The better you do, the stronger opponents you face, true. Which I guess does make sense, and I prefer it that way. It was interesting because I actually did 
I think I got um, against the computer, of course, um, while learning the tracks. Uh, for all of the spiny shell, first place on like all of those, but then randomly for some of the others, like um, maybe the boomerang cup, um, I would get like first, second, seventh, first, you know, it's kind of weird. You should still be proud, thanks. I'm trying my best to learn. Um, I especially finally kind of got the item usage thing, and I saw um, a lot of really good tips um, in the comment section of some of the past VODs, like talking about like, mushrooms actually really don't boost you as much as, as much as you may think, and you really ought to save them for like grassy spots and stuff like that. Um, go ahead and like throw the shells that you have if you're in like seventh place, etc stuff that like I kind of didn't really think about so hopefully that'll help me out you know basic things and then after that it gets to a point where it's just it's just skill after that but I'd, I'd like to at least get those basic things nailed into my head ASAP oh it's okay nine cats no worries welcome 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 <laughs> skilled alcohol <sighs> Especially don't mash when you get the three mushrooms. Yes, yeah, sometimes I'd like use an item and then those three would pop up and I'd accidentally use them. <laughs> like if there was a golden shell and then I'm like, yeah, I use the golden shell and then it disappears and I keep mashing it because I'm like, it's still here, right? And then it's not. It's, it's three other mushrooms that I used. So just little things like all things that can be corrected. Are we drawing Shuffle Metal Mori or KFP employee? Both! Mori as a KFP employee. I'm in the pop-up parade stance right now that Kiara has for her figure. Yeah, there we go. Are she blows. really nice. I think they did a great job with our pop-up parade figures. I mean, I'm really happy with mine. I finally have all of the Mori figures united. I need to get them all together and take a picture. Just haven't had any time. Yeah. It's crazy. I haven't had any time since I, since I got back because I've just been working on stuff. I mean, I know that we didn't have to do this, but I... I wanted to. <laughs> I'll get to it. I'll get. I'll get to everything someday. Maybe. Maybe. Mm. Sorry, I really like the song. <laughs> you guys know how much I like the song. I've said it over and over again. But I feel like someday it's gonna be like nostalgic to me. You know, like it'll remind me of these times. Whenever I hear it, that's what I think. Anyway. Oh, this is shy enough, a shy enough look. Maybe I'll do something with the eyebrows. It's kind of like, now that's worry. There we go. Yeah, that's better. Nice. Nothing a little more blushies can't fix. Okay, nice. I think we can call it there for that. Thank you very much for the request for Vlad. Okay, here's my sign for you. 
Oh my gosh, so cute. Yay! Glad you guys like it. And this one is for Vlad. Thank you kindly. And I think we'll finish with Danny the Gunsmith. Redraw the picture on the bank error in your favor Monopoly card with you in the place of Mr. Monopoly and the hand is a skeleton holding out a hundred dollar super chat icon. <laughs> nice. That's good. For Danny the gunsmith. That's a good one to finish on, I think. And then we'll have a nice checkpoint. Yeah, we'll have it as a checkpoint and then we'll finish all of these on the 11th. Yeah, just so that I can, for the sake of my hand, but yeah. Don't forget the nose. Th th there's a nose on this one. It's just, it kind of looks like it's part of the blush. Maybe I'll... Deadbeat's always here to remind me of the nose. Thank you. Thank you for the gentle nose reminder. Alrighty. Now let me go look up the reference. Bank error in your favor Monopoly card. Alright, this should be fun. In your favor. <laughs> ah, so cute. Community chest. Bank error in your favor. Collect $200. Would you like rather aggressive reminders? No. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. All right. We'll put it here. <laughs> this is good. that we'll do another sketch layer I swear my Oshi has a nose I swear this is me in the place of the monopoly <laughs> in the place of the monopoly man I guess I am the, the monopoly man now I feel like a lot of people really like the monopoly shorts <laughs> Any shorts that have to do with Monopoly. <laughs> oh, 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 hold on a second. Okay, cool. I don't have to draw the card. <laughs> I was like, oh, I don't want to draw the, the card, but turns out I don't have to. It's just literally the, the picture. I can do that. That's easy. Okay. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> I like the, the shrugging Monopoly Man picture. <laughs> it's me every day. Every day. All right, I'm gonna try and make it kind of similar in style. I actually think I might want it to be the same style. It makes it funnier. Yeah. But, you know, of course, with a mustache and everything, it's important. Oh, I think that di the noodles might be... <laughs> they might have gotten here a while ago. We can do this one fast. We can do this one fast. Oops. <laughs> the noodles, not the spicy nudes. I mean, not the spicy nudes. Okay. Nice, that's the Monopoly Man hat. The ear, and then it's gonna be my hair, of course. Bank error? I got money. Cool. Thanks, Skirlingtons. Soggy. No! This is me, by the way. <laughs> you just give me a sec. There. Now it really is me. Look, it kind of looks, it kind of looks like me. 
Yeah, now it definitely does, because the Monopoly man totally doesn't have this kind of hair. Yeah. I know, I know. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> no way, money. Yeah, I'll make it all like blacked out, I guess. Well, I wasn't gonna say it, are you sure? If you say so. I still made all that blacked out. Blacked out. Yeah. And then, skeleton hand. The hand of a skirlington, which is just gonna be bones. <laughs> it's bony. Akaspas. We'll do a couple akaspas. If it's 200, then it's gotta be two akaspas. Right? There really aren't a lot of bones in the palm, though. Yeah. You're still alive? <laughs> I am. I think we've gotten to that point in the stream, you guys. Once it gets to be about nine hours, people are like, Eh! Mori, are you okay? I'm good, don't worry. I've gone for longer. gone for longer. Plus, the end of the drawing portion is in sight, and I'd like to do just some super reading. Indeed. A lot of you deadbeats have been there for that, too. So I know you know. <laughs> Is my head. How did that happen? Yo, 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 we took a bite of gum gum. Yeah, yo, yeah, yo. Dreaming. Sorry, that just happens a lot. If you're new here, <laughs> please subscribe to the channel <laughs> for more pirate raps. Gonna be king. Good morning to those waking up. I wonder how many people went to sleep and then came back and I was- I'm, I'm still here. <laughs> they start filing in at a certain point. While you were sleeping, I was drawing. I did. <laughs> Welcome. Ooh, voice sounds kind of crackly. Like I said, I'm, I feel like I'm getting a little wintry sick. I kind of was starting to feel it during the, the Mario stream. And it's okay. Mario Party collab was fun though. I was really happy to be invited. I love playing with JPs. I get to practice my, my Japanese, and if it's like kind of an easier game, um, like Mario Party, and also it changes the language to your language, which is very helpful. And it's like a great opportunity for me to practice, you know? So I always really appreciate that. I 
I always want to. But I feel like a lot of times if I want to collab um, with JPs, I kind of have to be the one to invite them. Because everyone's like busy and you know has their own stuff they gotta do and wanna do. And I gotta be proactive. Happened during my Elden Ring stream? Oh, of course I played that for a gazillion hours. I can play that game also for 24 hours. Or rather, mm, how would I phrase it? I can play that game for every waking moment that I'm awake. How about that? I think that's just healthier for me at this point. Um, for the next 24 hour stream, I have a lot of awesome pre-recorded content planned uh, for exactly eight hours. <laughs> it's like eight hours, 30 minutes. Um, so I can exactly get sleep and then just stream for every moment that I'm awake, basically. So I'm working on that at present. Yeah, eight, yeah, eight hours of pre-recorded content for the 24 hour stream so I can Take a rest. But it'll be like collab karaoke's and stuff like that. And I think there might be like a drawing one as well. And then one that's kind of like um, a game show, but I want it to be like edited, kind of. Um, there will be other game shows that we do live, but sometimes like some of the stuff you see on the official Hololive channel, game show-esque things. So. Yeah, cause gotta get my sleep. As long as I get my sleep, I can stream for as long as I have to, but. Yeah, I have to get, I have to get the sleep in and then I can be my best self. Mm. The first 24 hour stream walked so that I can run. Exactly. I'm gonna say this one's from Danny. <laughs> wow, no way. Nice request. Thank you very much. And I'll go ahead and sign. Yeah. Well, sometimes, sometimes you gotta do, um, sometimes you gotta make some mistakes here and there uh, so that you can improve it for the next time, you know? Yay. Thank you, Danny the Gunsmith. And I think that's it for today. So here, here are the ones that we just did. Very nice. And I'll consolidate these as well with the others. Nice progress today, thank you. And we'll finish them all on the 11th and open them up also for like a quick moment. Um, so if you, if you really want one, be prepared. And if you aren't able to snag one, the good news is um, I can at least draw like a deadbeat Sona for you um, in a future stream and kind of like customize it how you want. Yeah. Nice work, Mori, thank you. Can people on the backlog send more on the 11th? Um, the one for today, the one uh, that everybody sent um, sent in, I would prefer no, just so that people that don't have a chance um, can get a chance to request something, you know? So, but you know, um, let's see. Yeah, if, if you don't mind. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me that you guys want to help out with funding the music video. And my hope is that it'll be great. Yeah, let's look at what we did today. So these are the first ones. Let's, let's review. Couple girl ones in there. Then we have the dogs. A little OC art. Gura in the salmon costume. 
Calvin Assault, Headphone Deadbeats, Make SDB. Cool. Save check, yeah. The grasshopper and the octopus, a really important one, maybe my magnum opus. Some cool stuff here. I like the, the Choco Sensei blood test. The crony one, which I took way too long on. Bay, Bale's Heikos. Empiric Otaku. Neo. Dino. Afro beat fist bump. Big light stick. Yeah, Sheriff. Lost twin sister. Ayla Idol. And then, just now, Monopoly Mori, Moriopoly, Kiara pop up grave pose, nothing, blowing a kiss in the Oyasumori outfit, something for V Dragon, I remember. And me and Mume. The melting one's pretty cool. Um, I did my <laughs> best. Nothing looked the best, agree. It leaves a lot up to the imagination. Anyway, uh, that's all for today. Look for the Giga file that's gonna be uploaded um, sometime after the stream. I won't keep you guys waiting too long. I'm gonna go grab the noodles. And then we take a break and then I read some old super chats. So let's see, yeah, mostly from like the, the karaoke stuff. There's only a few. There's not really too much going on there. And the Stardew Valley farming, etc. Um, maybe some quick ones for the fire and ice. And then unarchived karaoke, I bet we could get. Yeah, we can knock out a bunch of them real quick. So yeah, um, I'll be right back, you guys. BRB. But thank you everybody who requested something today. And for those that didn't get a chance, I'm very sorry that the demand was very high. Um, but there will be a small chance on the 11th when I finish up these um, to send some more, because that'll be a long stream. That'll be like 12 hours, I think, a again. I don't think this one will be 12, more like 11. But anyway, I'll, I'll see you soon. See ya, no breaks on the 2024 Mori train, it's true. Like I said, see you the Shinigami. And I'm, I'm gonna do my best. You guys know me. Live English, hardworking Shinigami. BRB.
Jesus! What the heck? Thanks so much, Biv. Hey! What? Thank you so much. Let's go! Did I already eat? Uh, kind of. A couple bites, but... Man, it's really spicy. <laughs> There's also too much. I can't eat all of this. Um... So I'll probably take a bite every once in a while, but... Ah, <sighs> cats. You know, some people tell you that... Cats don't have, like, a ton of intelligence compared to other animals, and... Oh, they don't... Hold on. They don't have a ton of intelligence and whatever, and like... Ah, sorry, it's really hot. <laughs> they don't have a ton of, you know, they just, they don't really... How do I say? <laughs> I think cats are smart, too. I also think cats are smart. Um, But like, they, they say that. But what's so funny to me is that when... <laughs> and dogs are the same with this, too. They just know, or rather, I don't know, it's hard to explain. They can tell when they're guilty or when they've done something wrong. <laughs> when they are being naughty, little pieces of work, they know. When they're doing that, because they will run. I see them looking at my food and I take one step towards them and they run away. <laughs> Kind of cute to be honest. Thank you so much. What the heck? What? Oh my god. Horizon, thank you for the 50 gifties. Jesus. Seriously, thank you so much. Wow, that's really nice. And the chads are out, they're roaming. Thank you for the necromancy spell. Big ups to you, and congrats to the brand new Deadbeats. Hope that someday you can also get a golden skull, which is a new thing that showed up today. <laughs> Maybe crystal, I don't know. Um, but yeah, they, they scattered immediately. It's cute. It's cute though, it's cute, I don't know. I love cats. Thank you so much for the, the membership gifts, you guys. Really, thank you. Even though we aren't really reading supers this stream, it, it was very nice of you to, to give some memberships. Like I said, we have so, so many members, I was shocked. And like, relatively low cancellations too, which is not normal, in my opinion. Like they... <laughs> Usually people don't keep them, but so many people are keeping them, I just, I really appreciate it. Thank you to Von Cobra Knight for the 50 gifties. Jesus, another one. Oh my god. Because it's great here, aw. Thank you. Thank you for enjoying it. It's almost as if they like it here. I hope they'll continue to like it. I I updated the perks and I'm waiting they're pending approval, but um Yeah, you'll you'll be able to see them soon. I haven't added the ASMR thing yet. It's just the three streams. Oh yeah, I have to put out that schedule. That's another thing I have to remember to do tonight. It's work, work, work morning tonight, but at least it's fun. I'm very lucky to have a fun job, you know? Yeah, there'll be a, a member schedule so that people can plan for the membership streams if they want. Yeah, but a regular schedule, I don't, I don't think we'll do. Yeah. So, it's it's on the way. It's on the way. Um, but for the most part, I think if I start doing more like evening streams, which might happen, I, I don't know if I gotta watch my sleep schedule. But if I do, um, then I'll probably go back to schedules. But for now, uh, maybe I will. We'll see. We'll see. You know, it's nice to give people things to look forward to. But I've been thinking about it, and maybe we'll bring it back. Um, anyway, let's read some Super Chats, shall we? Shall I read some spas? Let's see, how about, um, Let's Kill Christmas singing time? Super Chats. Oh, I haven't done this one yet, but I'm still gonna read these. Um, 
Thank you, Unnit Fawn 3, and Berserking the Astartes Chapelain. Merry Christmas to you, your family, and all the deadbeats. Hope you have a happy one with yummy foods and lots of love. Thank you. Truly, thank you so much. I'm sorry that the stream didn't happen, <laughs> but it was it was bad. Between family stuff and my own personal, it was just not great. Thank you so much for the raid. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, very kind. Ah. Let's see, we've got the encore. <laughs> the Christmas encore. This is where I played, I replayed some of the, um, some of the unarchived. Hold on a sec. Uh, the vertical ones here. Jacket. I love this art, so good. Thank you very much to baby back fat Santa. Here we go again. JPR SNSR says round two. Unknit Fawn 3, thank you. Lorna, thank you very much to you. It's Mori, but vertical. Wild. You guys get horizontal every day. <laughs> but the vertical Mori, verticali might pop up every once in a while, but it'll be supplemental to what I already do. And it'll usually be unarchived. I don't like... I don't like leaving vertical archives. It feels weird. I don't like it. <laughs> it's not. It's not for me. But but unarchived streams, karaoke, they'll still happen horizontally. But if I ever feel like, ah, eh, why not? And like, let's just hang out in a nice unarchived rando stream, um, then I may do them. But it will be rare. Uh, big ups to Kaze Gami. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas from Norway. A uh, big ups to. Garubadiyamokobong. I hope I said that okay. Dodatta. Thank you very much to Tong. Tong san, arigato gozaimasu. I got the ticket. I'm spending a happy holidays with Kali and the Deadbeats. Ureshii desu. Asakara Kali to Deadbeats no okage de tanoshi holiday da. Ureshii. Tanoshikatta. Kite kurete arigato. Thank you to Samura Pak. I've heard of Kali's superior. I don't know, Samura Pak. I think you might be memeing. In the event that you aren't, though. In the event that you aren't. What do you want about Deadbeat? <laughs> you're being silly, Sombra Pop. But hey, if that's the if that's the type of stream that you like, maybe you're a mobile viewer. Maybe it makes you happy. I just think you're being silly. <laughs> but thank you regardless, Sombra Pop, for, for liking and supporting what I do, regardless of what form I put it out in. A big ups to Zekinator77, thank you very much. Tascaru, Kelly is the best. A big ups to Bruta Salad, thank you very much. Mori literally turning into Elfelt speedrun with that out outfit request. Yeah. True. I think I know which moment you were you were referencing here. Big ups to Prinny's Rock for the breadstick. And thank you to Jay Lee. Here's one for your jar. What does that mean? What kind of jar? Tip jar? Oh, piano jar. Sorry, we were singing piano, man. Sorry. A big ups to Wrench McCool. Thank you, Maury. What are you doing here? Thank you to Justin Tolentino. Maury, what are you doing here? Thank you to Insufficiently Anonymous Jar Funds. Thank you very much to Mighty Bry Guy for the jar. Nick SDV says tip jar. Brutus Salad says, what are you doing here? Uh, Tomoe Kiyoti. First super chat. Thank you for the bread. Oh, there's bread! I get it. It's in my jar now. Thank you to Road Forks U, Maury. What are you doing here? Thank you very much to Bailing Baker. The jar! Thank you very much, Shadow Pencil. What are you doing here? Stay forever, please. Bread jars for cash tips and nothing else except for bread. But some people may get the wrong idea, so you gotta go easy on them. A big ups too. Castiel93, jar fund it is. Thank you to Zekinator77 for the Reaper. Keep the tip. Thank you to Morally Immoral. Money for the bread jar. pk 5 ir says for the bread jar. Thank you. A big ups to Sombra Pock. Just a little tip for the jar. Big ups to you, Sombra Pock. Thank you very much to Kala Wayne. Here's some bread for Super Chat. Thank you. Thank you to Otori P. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. And a big ups to Solo Rafa. Feliz Navidad. And thank you to Donger Bread for the coin. Thank you to Miyaku as well for the bread jar before Callie tries to stop us. I was thinking about it. <laughs> big ups to 
So TB, Merry Christmas. Thank you to Randall Sands, Merry Christmas, Maury. Hope you have a wonderful holiday and get plenty of rest. Right back at you, Merry Christmas, Randall Sands. Thank you to Tony Bones, Maury Christmas, Maury Christmas to you, Tony Bones. Thank you to Yuika. A big ups to By Shadow, thank you. And a big ups to Crunchy PBJ. I always say mucho to my Spanish speaking friends. It means a lot to them. Instead of much, I guess it is nice if you just try to make like a little bit of effort, even if it doesn't change the conversation much. I think sometimes, I don't know, speaking in people's language, like native language to them, means a lot to them. So I try to do that in Japanese sometimes as well with my friends, even though it doesn't really change the combo that much, whether I use English or Japanese. A big ups to Soapi-chan, thank you. A big ups to Bernizzo. Thank you very much for Super Chat, and thank you to Insufficiently Anonymous, the ghost of Mori yet to come. How about that sock puppet thing, though? <laughs> a big ups to Cheeseburger Mac Pack, and thank you to Saku for the Gifted Mori membership. Thank you to He Who Eats Faces for five Gifted Mori memberships, and Makart, thank you for five Gifted Mori memberships. Thank you to Rabite, as well as Untitled One. Thank you to JPRSNSR, and a big ups to Dainas. Arigato. Thank you to Lumsky, and thank you Jacob Langlet, as well as Show Me Your Kitties. Big ups to you, give your kitties some extra love from me, even if they've been a little naughty. They're trying to get into the spicy noodles. Okay, will do. A big ups to Dong An. Hi, Kobo's dad, Merry Christmas. Is that all I am to you, Dong An? Kobo's dad? Eh, fine with me. Thank you. <laughs> a big ups to Juck. Top-notch Louis Armstrong voice. It's like you even had a trumpet. <laughs> Thank you. A big ups to PK5 Iyer for the rice, glimpse of rice. Thank you to Jeremy for the rice. And a big ups to Insufficiently Anonymous. And that's midnight here. Merry Christmas, Maury. Merry Christmas to one and all. And to all a good night. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you very much, The Mocking Jay, for dropping by. Uh, let's see. So we've got, we've got that, the Christmas singing encore, done. Next up, we've got, oh boy, the Christmas singing Mary Scuffmas pre-recorded Scuffy Stream. <laughs> Jesus, Maury, the gain. How could you not know? Oh, Maury, oh, Maury. We've been through some ups and downs, but it was a very scuffy way to end the year. You know what? Merry Mori Miss to one and to one and all a good Mori Miss. This is really long because I talked a lot. <laughs> the the page, the web page is really long because I was talking so much in chat. A big ups to Asasa Sas. Thank you for the many fours. May your holidays this year be merry and bright. Thank you to Unknit Fawn 3 and a big ups to Labbit. Can't think of a better way to get into the holiday spirit than some nice karaoke with the ghost of Christmas future. Merry Christmas, Callie. Thank you very much to Oyasa, arigato. Thank you very much to uh -huh. And a big up to Draconic Insight. Merry Christmas from down under. Hope you and the family are having a lovely time together. Happy holidays to you, Draconic Insight, and Merry Christmas. I hope that your Christmas was not too hot down there. A big ups to Brutus Salad for the gifted membership. And thank you very much to L5 Guardian. For the red super chat, thank you very much, L5 Guardian. This Aka shout out goes to Olsen for always being a welcoming soul and kind deadbeat, usually hanging around in pre-chat and being fun to talk to. Happy to have you as a part of this community, my friend. Nice gift, snipe, Brutus, Merry Scuffmas. Merry Scuffmas to all of you. Wow, thank you so much. Thank you so much, L5 Guardian, always leaving some, some big ups to, for your friends. That's very sweet. Thank you so much. Oh, you're right, I can filter it. Nice, filtered out many, many Mori mentions. <laughs> wow, what a lovely Christmas gift though to a friend. Big up, Cell 5 Guardian. Thank you, very wholesome. Thank you very much to Draconic Insight times two. Draconic Insight says, this is from Marms. Okay, so this is a message from Marms. Mar Mar Mori, Merry Crimbo's Reaps. This year was a bizarre journey, a lot of things happened. In four days, I'll finally get my veil. In my opinion, it's a great gift to be here. Thanks you and Deadbeats for all this time, for huge support. Thank you and happy holidays. Happy holidays to you as well. Thank you very much, Mar Mar Mori, for the well wishes. And big ups to Draconic Insight for sending those well wishes. Thank you, thank you. A big ups to Active Rug. Thanks a lot, excited for all the songs that you're going to perform for us. Hope that you can perform Getcha live. Oh, a true girl show? That would be really sick. I want to. That's pretty, that would be pretty neat. 
I gotta put it on the list of many songs that I wanna do. The list just keeps growing. Well, big ups to JPRS NSR. Happy holidays to you and the Deadbeats. Here's my ticket to this Xmas karaoke. Thanks for this. It's very much needed. Merry Christmas, Callie. Thank you very much to Lornut, and thank you to Sombra Pac. Wee! Thank you, Zekinator77. Happy holidays, wishing y'all the best, and to the next many, many ones to come. Thank you very much to Dongerbread, Merry Mori Miss Eve. Thank you to Castiel93, Merry Christmas Dad, and the Deadbeats. So many nice beats here, I know, right? Ah, uh, so festive and full of cheer. Uh, Mori's heart is gonna grow three, three sizes this day. Thank you. Thank you, Dongerbread, Castiel93, and Vampiric Otaku KF Beats Vampire. Thank you to Zekinator77, or Happy Scuffmas. <laughs> Thank you to Darth Bane, and a big up to Mr. V, as well as Ronan. Thank you for the five gifted Mori memberships. Thank you very much, Lord Revan. Going to be spending time with the family. All good. All good. If you're able to during the holidays, you should be able to. Yeah, during the holidays, I guess. And if not, come enjoy the holidays. They're happening at the same time, after all. A big ups to Prinnies Rock. How goes it, Prinnies? Thank you very much for the red super chat during this stream. It's greatly appreciated. Merry Christmas, Mori, the Mori family, and to the Deadbeats. Catch you in 2024. And here we are. Here we are. Yeah, man. Have you been here this whole time? Some of you Deadbeats have been here from, like, the beginning of the stream. Oh, my God. How many of you have been here since the start? I'm curious. Yup. Yeah. I have still here. Steam Deck comes in handy? Really? You're using the Steam Deck? That's pretty wild. Yes, I have me. Me, yup, I'm raising my hand. Yup, me. Yup, I missed some parts, gotcha. Thankfully not. It's been it's been very long. A very, very long stream. Hanging on. Oh my god. Ooh, you guys are crazy. Thank you, crazy deadbeats. I bet there are a bunch lurking as well. Thank you so much. Maybe some deadbeats that fell asleep. <gasps> Wake up. <laughs> Thought I was gonna scream. Nope. Not me. I'm calm, Mori, right now. I'm chilling. Thanks a lot, Prinnies. A big ups to it. Phil Legacy. Thanks for the karaoke present. You're certainly welcome. Thank you. A big ups to Prenny's Rock again. This time with the 50 gifties. A lovely Christmas present. A lovely, lovely Christmas present to all of the brand new bones. Thank you for your necromancy spell. Very much appreciated. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Prenny's. 50 gifties. Let's go. That's, that's why there are so many members. You guys drop so many of these. From the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate it. A big ups to Demon Mind. Thank you for the five gifted Mori memberships. Thank you very much to Titan, KFP Legal Eagle. Mori Miss comes once again with its gift of music and scuff. Darn it! This year's Christmas, there's gonna be no scuff. There's gonna be minimal scuff for streams. I should have made that the New Year's resolution because I feel like that's something that I'm, I'm close to being able to rubbing out. Um like 90%, but it still happens sometimes, which is not great. So I'm gonna try and keep focusing, but over the years I've gotten better and better at focusing on, you know, doing things beforehand and getting things ready early on. So this year we really, we hit the nail on the head. You'll see. I know you guys are gonna be like, sure, sure. Well, you'll see, I'll prove you wrong. I'll prove you wrong. <laughs> we have got a big ups too. Jesus. Lord Revan, for the 50 gifties. Thank you so much for the lovely 50 gifts, Lord Revan, and for your necromancy spell to bring many wonderful skeletons into the Deadbeat Plus. Just in time for three membership streams for members only. Secret member shorts. Members, you guys get to see secret shorts. They're secret and only for members. They never get deleted or anything, but, but they're there and there's a new one every month. So look forward to that. Um, and then exclusive wallpapers. Um, the, the November one's getting ready to go away. <laughs> the Onsen one. It's getting ready to go away because I, I received the, uh, the January one pretty early, so I'm gonna post it up pretty soon. Make sure you grab it. It's gonna be on the 7th, um, as which is, I guess, the usual date. So, so go, go grab it. Okay? Go grab that thing. The new one's really good, too. You like it. 
promise. Promise you will. Um, but yeah, uh, they stick around for about two months. Each wallpaper, I mean, so. If you join membership, wow, that's basically like two wallpapers that you have access to right away. It's pretty nice. Um, but yeah. <laughs> So get excited. Hmm. Yep, yep, yep. And then eventually I want to do um, an ASMR upload, but I, I feel like I want to make sure that I can deliver the current content that I've like resubmitted to the perks first. And then if I can do it for a couple months, um, then we'll be bringing that. I just feel like with so many members in membership now, I want to I want to put more into it. You know. So yeah. <laughs> Wallpaper always nicely done. I, tr I try to pick my faves. <laughs> um, a big ups to... Ah, flaming Pants. Morikuri Kariope. Thank you. Right back at ya. Thank you Insufficiently Anonymous. Thank you very much to Mozilla Fennekin. <laughs> and a big ups to Salaryman. Thank you. Happy Holidays. Glad I get to watch this right before I go to work. A big ups to Nick S. TV for the 20 gifted Mori memberships. Thank you. Let's go. Many new Mori members joining the fray. Thanks to you, Nick S. TV. Thank you so much. A big ups to Prince John, Jailbeat, Chromie. Thank you very much. A big ups to Euro Canard for 10 gifted Mori memberships. Thank you so much. Thank you very much to Unknit Fawn 3 as well for five gifted Mori memberships. Thank you very much to. Uh, let's see. JT Mations. Merry holidays to the Mori family. We're sure you miss your cats too. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm with the babies now, so it's all okay. A big ups to Mud Arcade. Thank you to Crit Spirier and Brutus Salad. Thank you, thank you. When I said I wanted to see more of you unfiltered, this is not what I meant. Surely this year. Surely. Surely. <laughs> Surely. I don't know. Might pop out every once in a while. I gotta keep some filters on, but... We'll see. Hope it's not an empty Mori promise. Those things aren't worth too much in the first place. Um... Ah. <laughs> Stick the ASMR mic by the cats and make them work for their food. <laughs> yeah! That's actually really good. <laughs> I, I did that before, but maybe we get cat ASMR part two. I don't know. Maybe I'll maybe I'll save that for when um I'm away. I gotta go away. Um, just you know medical things. <laughs> but I'm gonna prepare content to share anyway. So probably we'll queue up some some ASMR things and whatnot. Um, or some other content that I hope you guys will enjoy. We got a big ups to Hung Fung and a big ups to PK5 Iyer starting off the Mori Christmas perfectly. Hope your holidays have been going well. Thank you very much to Yaika. Merry Mori, Miss Callie. Thank you to Inu Hoshi. Appreciate it. So I write in my native language just for fun. Hope that you have the best time and rest with the family. Um, that's cool. I can't read or understand it, but I'll try and just read it the way that it is. And I'm sorry if it's terrible. Bulldog Karak Sonyit. Kevanok naked. Callie. How was that? Was that good? I bet I pronounced it great. Yeah, I liked the, the naked part. Sounds like a demon summoning. Okay. Good attempt. Yeah. You're very sweet. <laughs> Thank you very much, Inuhoshi. A big ups to Alparable. Thank you, thank you, Mori Mary Miss, everyone. Mary Mori Miss. <laughs> Mori Mary Miss. <laughs> That's not what you wrote. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. A big ups to uh, Prinny's Rock. Dang, you got Moriah Carey. It's all right. She's frozen now. She can't hurt you anymore. A big ups to Asas Asas. And thank you very much to Gillamax. The space beat. Thank you, Gillamax, for the red super chat. A very Merry Christmas to you, Mori, and all the deadbeats out there. 
big ups to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Gil and Max. Hope that you had a nice one, a lovely winter's holidays. And then we got a raid. Thank you so much for the raid. A big ups to baby back fat. Very scuff miss everybody. Every beat. Oh, I like that. Every beat. A big ups to Castiel93 for the gift and berserking the Astartes Chapelain. Thank you very much to Baby Shark. Thank you, thank you. Hey, Richard G. Thanks for showing up. Nice to see ya. A big ups to Lou HQ. <laughs> You'd enjoy the night Santa went crazy by Weird Al. <laughs> Looking it up now. Later. <laughs> Off stream. But that sounds like a trip just from the name. How did he go crazy? I want to know. A big ups to Shane Armstrong. Thank you very much. Frosty's got a quick hand. He'll look around the room. He won't tell you his plan. He's got a corn cob pipe hanging on his mouth. He's a Christmas kid. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> that song is a trip. Trust me. I have bars for days. Bars. Incredible. Thank you for <laughs> thank you for sharing the, the rap miss with us. Stretch. <sighs> I should really try rapping Run DMC's Christmas song on a future unarchived Christmas karaoke. We gotta do that. We gotta try. Not enough time to prepare! Dang it! Dang it! But Papa Mori plays it every Christmas! Dang it! <laughs> I love the dang it. I'm all in on the dang it. You know, it feels like you can say it so freely, as opposed to, you know, the other, the other way. Which is kind of like... I cringe a little bit when I say it because I'm like, oh, maybe I'm hurting people whose ears don't like curse words. But when I say, dang it, you can see why Bibu likes it. You can get like a bit of the, the, the frustration out without cursing. No childs though. <laughs> we got a big ups too. Mayuzumi the cute crony, thank you. Not gonna read that message because it's that's a lot. But Merry Christmas to you. A big ups to MinQXX. Merry Christmas. May you stick out your gah for the Marizzler. <clears throat> a big ups to Waluigi Cubed. Thank you very much for the 10 gifted Mori memberships. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much to Michael C. Just in case you skipped over it, go back and read Mayazumi's super chat. You will not escape this fate. <laughs> no, I did. How did you know I skipped it? It's a time traveler right there. I'm not gonna read that. I'm not gonna let anyone clip clip that. I heard ooh, ooh, ooh. you bring ooh magic to your Christmas times. Raru XD Wow Meow Awanya Neko Chan Tihi Whoa 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 Kawaii Merry Christmas There There I did it Enough <laughs> We got a big ups to Nova Thank you very much A big ups to Night Slash Prime for the super chat Thank you to our Nofo Mendez and Michael C for the 10 gifted morning memberships Thank you very much to Arnolfo Mendez for the five gifted Mori memberships. And thank you to Fram Beraju for the cute, cute dancing deadbeat emoji lights, pen lights, pen sticks. Oh my god! Thank you very much to Naraku Tenma. Merry Christmas to you, your family, the deadbeats. Thank you so much. We've also got a big ups to the one, the only, Beelzebubba! For the red super chat. No message? What a chat. I mean, <coughs> sorry. <coughs> What a chat. Very cool of you, Beelzebubba. Thank you so much, as always, for dropping some support my way. It does help me a lot. Thank you. A big ups to Insufficiently Anonymous. Thank you, thank you. A big ups to Brutus Salad. Thank you very much. I got arrested for breaking and caroling. Let's go. Need someone to bail you out? 
Well, clearly not. You sent a super chat. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Brutus Salad. A big ups to Zach. Thank you. Thank you to Servant Cannon. A big ups to Okabe Rintaro. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. And a big ups to Jacob Langlet. How goes it, Jacob? Thank you so much for dropping by. Got the lot there. There we go. Now my eyes aren't huge. Um, and big ups to Insufficiently Anonymous. <laughs> You better watch out. 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 <laughs> Thank you very much. A big ups. <laughs> uh, nostalgia. <laughs> A big ups to Zekinator77. The scuff mic makes it sound like old, old timey, like the old days. It's charming. It's very kind of you to say, Zekinator77. I'm glad that, that you could rewire your brain into hearing it that way. Thank you. A big ups to Insufficiently Anonymous. Thank you very much. A big ups to Mike S. Hangout. Thank you very much. Happy New Year. Thanks for all you do. Let's go. A big ups to JPRSNSR. Thanks for sharing your gorgeous voice. Listening to your lovely karaoke's makes this Christmas all the better. That's so sweet, JPRS and SR. I like to think that after you sent this super chat, there immediately was a peak that absolutely destroyed the mic and everyone's ears and people's ears bleated as that super chat flew across the screen. That's, that's what I want to believe. That's my hope, my prayer, my Christmas prayer. Yep, right on time. <laughs> but it was so worth it. Don't remind us. Uh, incredible. Thank you very much, JPRS and SR. And a big ups to Euroknard for the red super chat. Thank you very much for the lovely red brick, Euro Canard. Biggest of ups to you. These Christmas karaoke's are always so sentimental. Thanks for taking the time to record and stream this. Hope you enjoy your time with the family and a very Maury Christmas. Thank you, thank you, Euro Canard. For the lovely holiday red brick for me and the fam. I hope that yours was nice as well. Thank you very much to Yenwei. Biggest of ups. A big ups to Untitled One for the Rose. Thank you, L5 Guardian. Thank you for the karaoke, Kelly. Padoru, padoru. Completely unnecessary growl. <laughs> Completely forced in there. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> a big ups to Inuhoshi. Thank you very much. Thank you to Markowski as well. Merry Christmas, Callie and the Deadbeats. Thank you very much, Zekinator77. Thank you for such a joyous day of Callie karaoke. Happy holidays to all and to all a great time. Thank you very much, Prinny's Rock, Cursed ASMR, my beloved. A big ups to Morally Immoral. Thank you. I may have lost my hearing, but this was worth it. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Oh, what a blessed stream. Incredible. Incredible. You know, somehow, I'm still glad it happened. <laughs> I'm still glad it happened. Thank you very much. Now let's see what we got here. I had some Stardew Supas. Let's do the Stardew Super Chat for the Stardew stream that didn't come to be because it was a stream and the stream didn't work. Um, here we go. Here we go, which is so silly because all I had to do was go upstairs. All I had to do was go into the main house. It was that easy, but there were people there. And I'm like, well, there's not a mic, but you know, there are people there. Jesus, Maury. Anyway, a big ups to Unnifon3. Thank you very much for the five Gifted Maury memberships. Thank you very much to Morally Immoral for the Gifted Maury membership. A big ups to Lemonator32. Thank you, Lemonator. Wow, it was your birthday? Well, happy, happy late birthday to you, Lemonator. Sorry that this VOD disappeared, but I hope that you're still around um, to, to see this, this message here. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for dropping by. Lemonator32 says, it's my birthday today. Just wanna say that I hope you enjoy the time spent with your family during this holiday season, Callie. Get well rested, and I look forward to seeing what 2024 has in store for you, Mary Morimus. Thank you very much, Lemonator32. Yeah, we're starting off pretty strong with some very long streams. 
after the Christmas vacation. It's like I came back with a vengeance, but happy to be here. And I did enjoy the time with my family, especially after things got in the way of streaming. But they didn't get too much in the way to the point where I couldn't play Lethal Company with Crony and hang out with my favorite dog. So everything turned out okay. Hmm. Thanks a lot, Lemonator. I hope that you also have a lovely 2024 and that your birthday was nice. A big ups to Morley Immoral. Thank you very much. Just found out the limit to gifting. It's 200 weekly, 100 daily. Don't ask how I found out. I think I know how you found out. <laughs> Thank you so much for the trillion, quintillion, trillion gifts. Morally Immoral. 200 weekly. Oh my god. Jesus. Jesus. 100 daily. Sounds like they sounds like a credit card limit. <laughs> but on super chats and memberships. You too. But I guess they just want to make sure that there's no like fraudulent stuff going on. I don't know. That's a lot of presents though, honestly. That is so many memberships. So <laughs> thank you so much Morley Immoral for all of the huge support last year and and into the new year. Um I really appreciate you so much. Thank you very much. No limits for folks with multiple accounts. <laughs> Seems likely makes a good point, but don't push yourself. <laughs> and I still thread the needle every time. Sorry to hear that, Silver. Dang it. Dang it. I wish everyone could have a membership at some point, but I just, I don't know how they hand them out. Why'd I shrug? I can't see that with my cloak. <laughs> but anyway, that's a secret. That's a secret. Um... Anyway, we've got a big ups to Marcus Manessis. Hope you're having a great time with the fam. Thanks for putting up with the net trouble to put out some content for us. Chill out with the fam as much as you can. You deserve it. Thank you very much, Marcus Manessis. Have definitely um, enjoyed my time with them. It was a good time. Um, it had ups and downs, but overall, it ended up merry. So I'm glad for that. Thank you, Marcus. That was by accident. How'd you do that by accident, morally immoral? <laughs> Did you mean to put in, like, Oh, I guess I'll gift I'll gift Mori ten memberships, and then you did an extra zero by accident. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Oh, well, we've got a big ups to Vampiric Otaku. Thank you very much. Wish you and your family a merry Xmas. Have fun. Thank you so much, Vampiric Otaku. We've also got a big ups to Berserking the Astartes Chapelain. Thank you very much. This has been our pre-recorded Super Chat, though. Thank you to Phil Legacy. Hope you have a great Christmas with your family and enjoy the new year. Thank you so much. A big ups to Insufficiently Anonymous, Mori Christmas, Ghost of Mori Past. A big ups to Eternal Lee, thank you very much. Wrapping presents during a Cali Stardew Valley is better than watching pre-recorded Mori lying streams. <laughs> That's right. That's right. No more Mori lies. A Mori lie is worth more than a Mori promise right now. We have to skew it the other way. <laughs> A big ups to Marcus Manessis. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, bet. <laughs> Marcus Manessis, 0p Mori, my beloved. <laughs> Thank you very much. Mori Promise holds good value right now. I mean, we did make it go up a little bit. Hmm. Yeah. But there are still a couple things that I have to do. For example, finishing a bunch of the games that we didn't finish in 2023. And I'd like to do that this month, if at all possible. Yeah. Can I hold the line on the Mori Promise? <laughs> But I worked hard to get it that way in the past two years. Um, I really tried to step up my game in doing that. So I think it's, it's getting better. All of the, most of the, most of the, mostly the shorter ones. <laughs> Hypnospace, bro. <laughs> Maybe a little Hypnospace, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. There is a giant vault of doodles right now, and once I finish all of them, the Mori Promise uh, value will go up a lot. <laughs> Excited for that. <laughs> but Katana Zero, yeah, we definitely have to finish. And Bloodborne, why am I sleeping on Bloodborne? I need to get back to Bloodborne, Jesus. Um, I love that game. I love it with my whole heart and soul, Jesus. <laughs> the Lethal League rematch. Yeah, the server situation's kinda... But the new one, I think for the new one, it's easier to match up with your friends. We're very close to finishing Katana Zero, though. Um, all right, we got a big ups to L5 Guardian. Thank you very much. Very much appreciated. Red Brick, thank you, thank you, L5 Guardian. Merry scuff, Mr. Friends, and to all. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tis the seasons for a beating. You hear that, Brutus? Huh? Take that, skillish, you chump. I mean, haha. <laughs> hey, friend. <laughs> no! Get this beef out of my super chats! But at the same time, carry on. We thrive on a bit of violence here. We have to. We're skeletons and support the Reaper. So I guess a little bit is fine. Don't push it. Okay. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And we got a big ups too. Uh, Eternal Lee. Thanks a lot. And I think that's uh, it for this one. I think that's it. Yeah. Thought Bibu couldn't stream Bloodborne anymore? Really? No way. Huh? I'll have to look into it. Maybe I just need to, to ask for permissions again. We do have to renew them. Uh... Yeah, it's, it's one that we have to ask for, like, every month. So... There, there may have been something behind the scenes for that. But please no spam. If you spam, I gotta, I gotta ban you. Even if you're saying nice things, thank you very much for the nice words, but please no spam. Thank you very much though. It's very kind, very kind comment. Hmm, more likely than you think, eh? Yeah, harm situation. Oh no, they gotta go. You gotta go, you gotta go. Oh, oh, it's gone. Oh, there's a... I didn't know there was a mod here. Wow. Hidden mod. Thank you, hidden mod. <laughs> anyway. Just a gentle bonk. Yeah. Thems are just the breaks. No spam, please. Even if it's nice things. I can't believe it. There's a hidden mod here. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's see. Uh, ba -da -ba 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 -ba. What else do we have here? We finished that, and then we had the holiday farming stream premiere. It was in two parts. Thank you very much. Oh, it's the same image, same image. But I really should put a one in the corner. Oh, I did. <laughs> I did put a one in the corner. There it goes. It's not J-Chad with a shotgun? Don't think so. I think so. Alrighty. Why do you have to get perms? I'm new I'm new to a streamer needing to get perms before having to play a game. Japanese companies operate a bit differently than overseas companies, and they want to be extra careful. Plus Hola is just really big. We don't want we don't want to get in any trouble and wanna make sure that we do things uh, by the book as much as we can. Right? We got a big ups too. Marcus Manessas. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Red super chat. Thank you. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, Mori. Hope you had a great time with the Reaper fam. You deserve the vacay after this year filled with huge achievements. 2024 is going to be bigger and better for us and our Mori. Say hi to 2024 Marcus for me. 2023 Marcus. Hello, 2024 Marcus. I'm pretty sure you're here right now. Anyway, that was a message from you. But thank you very much. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you, Marcus Manessas, for the lovely red brick. I hope that your year was also fantastic. Look forward to this new year. It's gonna be good. Yo, past me. Sometimes you gotta say hello to the past you. It's like a one-way, it's a one-way communication. A big ups to Dongabred, thank you. She's a Let's Player now, woo! It's pretty cool, Fauna's been doing Let's Plays as well for the Outer Wilds playthrough. That's pretty neat. Outer Wilds also seems like a fun game, but I'm gonna pump the brakes on, on, oh, maybe I should play it because the list is already long. But I hear there's like a big twist or something and I don't know what it is. Um, it works really well for that series. Yeah, because I guess people spoil things and whatnot. Um, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Bringing Let's Plays back in style. Oh, that's cool. Grim Reaper is a Let's Player. Oh, huh. yeah. Yeah, these days, uh, streams are the big thing. I remember, though, back in my day, I was watching lots of Let's Plays. A big ups to Eljohn91. Thank you very much, last scuff, miss. <laughs> Gave you my sight, but the very next day, Callie ripped it away. This year, 
Save me from... Ah! I'm giving it to some more else. It's a beautiful song, El John 91. You write it yourself. Thank you very much for the five gifted Mori memberships. The big ups to Salary Man, thank you. Woke up at 3 a.m., which is bad. But then this 4 a.m. stream appeared. Quote unquote stream, am I right? Hope you enjoyed it, Salary Man. Thank you, JPR Sinisar. Pre recorded, let's go! Thank you very much to Demon Beef for five gifted Mori memberships. Thank you to Unknit Fawn 3 for the gifted membership. And Demon Beef again for five gifted Mori memberships. A big ups to Alana Coral. Thank you very much to Ghost of Mouse Count. Thank you very much. Oh, binging your Stardew streams helped me relax and really carried me through it. I hope that you're feeling better now, Ghost. Thanks a lot for letting me know. A big ups to Maverick Hunter. Thank you very much. My thoughts on the Rune Factory series? You know, I re-downloaded Rune Factory 4 and I need to try playing it again. Rune Factory 5. Yeah. Nope. Oh, need to give it a, a, another try. Hmm. Yeah, because I, try, I tried to get into it, but then it kind of lost me, so I'll try to get back into it. Um, a big ups to Eljohn91, thank you, and Fran Bedager, thank you very much. A big ups to Trice a lot, thank you, thank you. Crocodile tastes like chicken. You know, I actually, I've tried crocodile before now that I think about it. It was when I was in Oklahoma. It's pretty good, but it did taste like chicken, yeah. A lot of meat tastes the same. A big ups to Sariel, thank you very much. You have a very calm atmosphere. Yeah, for Stardew. <laughs> but for other games like Red Dead's gonna be a different bag. I'm not gonna not gonna lie, Deadbeat. That's gonna be a different side of Mori. But it's cause I wanna roleplay into it. Just a little bit. Just a little. <laughs> we won't we won't do too much. Too much maybe a little bit. Are you gonna play it on PC? I think so, yeah. I think. Whatever's easier. It might be easier to do it on PC. My PC can handle it, that's for sure. My PC can handle anything legendary PC. Um, a big ups to Arekusu for five gifted Mori memberships. Thank you very much. A big ups to Crit Spirier. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Yeah, this PC is beast. <laughs> it's awesome. It has not had trouble doing anything recently. Except sometimes playing back videos um, in After Effects, but when it comes to games, it's no problem. Yeah. A big ups to JPRSNSR, best cliffhanger of 2023. Thank you. Fritz Spirier, also thank you very much, in case I missed you. Bad, bad short-term memory. Jesus, Maury. Um, and then let's see what we got here. Uh, the final Let's Play video was The Holiday Farming Part 2. Holiday Farming Part 2. Yep. Looks like we can handle this one, and then we'll do the Fire and Ice Super Chats. I can do those as well. Getting a good chunk knocked out. Yeah. It's a shame you're not able to play the original Metal Gear 1 and 2, even though you were able to do solid 1, 2, and 3. I know, right? I really wanted to, but I'm probably just going to have to do them off stream. Yeah. But they seem amazing. Yeah. I think I played a little bit of them recently. Kind of dipped my, my toes in there. But most of what I know from Metal Gear 1 and 2 um, has kind of come from, like, people going over the series, you know, in videos and whatnot. I'm making a Let's Play. Can't do that either, sadly. We got a big ups to Unknit Fawn 3. Thank you very much to Flora Jean. Hey, Flora Jean, how have you been? Hey, Moe. Here's an early Christmas holiday gift for being such a sweetheart. And no worries about the scuff. You can take your time to fix it. We will still have fun regardless of the situation. Thank you as always, Callie. We love you. Thank you so much for always being so positive, Flora Jean. I really, really appreciate it. Makes my day bright. Thank you, thank you. A big ups to Dark Shadow Hawk 720. Thank you very much. I knew you'd be back. Some of us did. PC be cursed. More like internet be cursed. Oh well. Thank you, JPR SNSR. Past Callie, you're back. It's an Xmas miracle. Thank you very much to Flora Jean. Best movie premiere ever. A big ups to King. Fuck, thank you very much. Have you played God of War? Sure have. I enjoyed it, but I want to play the newer ones when I have time. There's no time. There's never any time. We got a big ups to Spawn Freak. Thank you very much. Been watching the Super Mario RPG VODs. We'll need more games again where you can shout, Weed em boys. That was one of the more hype moments for real. I felt like I could really let myself loose and be extremely unhinged, you know, in just that moment. Because it's a hype moment, you know? We pray for those moments. 
A big ups to Kretzperie, thank you to Donger Bread, Unknit Fawn 3, and Prinny's Rock, thank you to Inu Hoshi, and thank you to Scenarius, as well as JPRSNSR, thank you very much for all the kitty cats. A big ups to Labbit, thank you, Merry Christmas, Mori, hope you have a great time with family and friends. A big ups to Sombra Pock, thank you, slept like an actual corpse today, nice having something so calm to wake up with, thank you, you're welcome, Sombra Pock. Glad to hear that it helped you wake up and was nice and calming, as Stardew streams do be. It's like a nice balance. We can do some crazy stuff where I yell and scream and whatnot. And then having Stardew as well is really nice. A big ups to Prenny's Rock. See you later, pre-recorded Mori. A big ups to JPR Sinisar. Thank you, Past Callie. This is fun. And thank you to Nick SDB. Thank yous for the pre-recorded stream. A big ups to Wrench McCool. Thank you very much. If you were to restream these in a private stream, then unprivate them, you'd be able to delete these from the video tab. I know you care about that. Thanks a lot, Wrench McCool. Yeah, I kind of just wanted to keep them all in the same place for people that are going through my streams and see the Stardew stream and then they watch it and then they expect the next part to be in the, the stream area, right? Ah, it is what it is. It's no problem. I'm not going to sweat it too much. Um, for now, I should really just make a playlist for them. Um, that would probably be the best way. A big ups to the Rocker Reaper, thank you. This is a pre-recorded super chat. Thanks a lot, the Rocker Reaper. And a big ups to Untitled One. Thank you very much for the lovely red rose. Biggest of ups to you. Thank you. Okay, what else do we got? Fire and ice, fire and ice, fire and ice. Let's go. And we'll get the unarchived uh, karaoke next time. Whoa. Oh yeah. Here we go. Proink. Oh, that's really big. That's a really big one. Wow. Fire it up, fire it up now. Isn't this a cool album art? You listen to it every day. I'm so glad you like it. Thank you for enjoying it. A big ups to Unknit Fawn 3 and Umirix KFP's Deadbeat Lizard. Definitely lose sleep out of excitement waiting for this. Aw. I mean, name checks out, right, Umirix? KFP's Deadbeat Lizard. Thanks a lot, you Mirix. And a big ups to Jim Tracy. Thank you so much for the lovely red brick for me and Kiara's hard work on our original song together. Thank you, thank you. Jim Tracy says the Takamori original is real. So awesome to see the OG EN duo finally releasing your long awaited song. Super excited for this. I know it's going to absolutely rock. Glory to Takamori. Took us long enough, right? Well, glad that we finally got it out. Thanks a lot for enjoying it. Really appreciate that, Jim Tracy. A big ups to Asas Asas. Thank you so much for supporting me and Kiara. A big ups to Draconic Insight. Glory to Takamori. Thank you, JPR SNSR. Let's freaking go! Thank you very much to Hyun Siang. Hype! And a big ups to Aster. Thank you very much, Takamori forever. And we got a big ups to Prinny's Rock. Thank you, thank you. The prophesized Takamori original is finally upon us, glory be. Thank you to Hien Acid and Squookers. Thank you very much. Takamori is how I got into VTubing so hype. Thank you very much for enjoying and thank you for sticking with us. We got a big ups to Flora Jean. Thank you very much. And a big ups to Fafa. Thank you very much to Sven, and a big ups to Gilamax the Space Beat, as well as Hien Acid. Let's do this! Thank you to Donger Bread, still can't believe it's real. Thank you, Mozilla Fennekin, a Takamori song. This economy, but of course! A big ups to Umirix KFP's Deadbeat Lizard. Glory to Takamori. Yeah, KFP stonks are on the rise. Mori promises are starting to get more worth, more value. Let's go! The value of the Mori lie is starting to drop. Kinda nice. Maybe things could turn around in this economy. <laughs> a big ups to Dominant K, KFP. Thank you. And a big ups to Prinny's Rock. Thank you, thank you. This song radiates bad energy. And I love it. Thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoy. It is pretty, pretty intense, I guess. But I feel like this is the kind of song that Kiara and I could sing together that we'd really excel at. And I think we did a good job. So thank you for enjoying. A big ups to Mr. Vig for the clap, clap, clap. And a big ups to Marcus Manessas. Thank you, Marcus, for the red super chat. It's finally real and amazing and hot and cool. It's been a wait 
But the wait has been worth it, Callie. Finally getting the Takamori original we've needed. So glad you and Wawa were able to give us this. It's amazing, and we KF Beats finally have our national anthem. Thank you so much. Yeah, the KF Beats, stand united and strong. Must have been a really amazing moment um, for, for you guys when we announced it and stuff like that, because I know that a lot of you guys are friends and hang out and stuff like that, and I just think that's really amazing that our communities can have so many people that are friends and whatnot, so. It makes me really glad. Thank you, truly. Thank you for supporting the both of us, because we both, we both work really hard. You know? We really do. We're really trying our best here. So, it means the world to us. Thank you. And a big ups to Jay Swag. Thank you very much. Positively epic. A big ups to Maxwell the First. Thank you. Absolutely a certified banger. You both did so well, Gloria Takamori. Thank you. Big ups to Berserking, the Astartes Chapelain, and a big ups to JPRSNSR. Thank yous, Callie and Kiara, for the best birthday gift I could ever ask for. Glory to Takamori, thank you. A big ups to Nick SDB, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. That was good. Takamori, too powerful. And also, happy, happy late birthday to you, JPRSNSR. Hope it was a good one for you. Thank you. You both are workaholics, but we understand you're doing what you love, creating music. Thanks, yeah. I don't know, we just we just really love what we do. It's fun. I do get some burnout a lot of times, which is why I play a lot of games. <laughs> but, I don't know. We'll, we'll get back into more creative stuff someday. Someday soon. Yeah, once I'm feeling creative again, you know? A big ups to TV Table Tray. Thank you for the gifted membership. And a big ups to Engine Crafter 77 who says, Amazing, thank you. A big ups to Flora Jean, this song is on fire. And a big ups to Shadow Pencil. Thank you very much for the many claps and the hearts. You've got that music series coming, that's true. That is true. We're gonna test out one of the, the regular programs I wanna do there uh, during the 24 hour stream, so look forward to that. Yeah, but right now, I'm, I'm really kind of in the planning stages of both the, the charity stream and the 24 hour stream, so it's, Whew, I'm hard at work getting everything together, but look forward to it. Look forward to it. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I guess that's it. That is it for the Super Chats today, which means that's it for this stream. Yay. Um, what did I want to say? Let me think. Had to sit up in my chair. Um, so we did a lot of stuff today. That was an over 10 hour stream. Um... And tomorrow will also be a long stream. Look forward to that. Hopefully some cowboy action. If not, we will find something else to play or do. Um, and we're also going to be racing. Yeah. Ooh. Submissions to help with quiz stuff. You've been prepping a lot. I'm glad to hear that. Awesome. I really appreciate it. I'm definitely going to be um, more more selective with, uh, with quiz stuff as well if I do ask for suggestions and stuff like that. Um... Yeah, we'll probably be, probably like ask um, the staff as well, hey, what do you think about this question and stuff, so. But yeah, 10 hours, hope you can get enough sleep for tomorrow. No worries, no worries. It'll be lots of training for Mario Kart um, and also gaming on my end. Uh, that'll be, I believe, 1 p.m. JST because I'm racing with, with Bay from 11 a.m. JST. Um, so that's two hours of racing with Bay. I don't think I will stream it. But you can catch me on her channel. Yeah, you can catch me on Bay's channel and I'll be streaming, yeah, immediately after. Um, at 1 p.m. JST, which will be games. Um, need to beat Bay's ghost, exactly. So two hours later than my usual stream time is when I'll be streaming on my channel. So get excited for that. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Uh, it's been fun. Maybe I can direct you to the Bay stream. I don't think anyone's streaming right now, actually. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't think anybody, is anyone streaming? Um, I'm gonna keep those super chats off at the end of the stream. Um, but I will turn them back on before the next one, so. Um, if I'm allowed to, I don't, I don't know if we can monetize, or that we might not be able to. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Otsukali, everybody take care. I think Nerissa's doing a live rebroadcast as well. You guys should go check that out if you don't. Check out the Bay Mario stream. I will be there. 
um, that's happening soon. But right now, if you have you know time to spare, Nerissa's doing uh, a rebroadcast of her singing, so go check it out if you haven't. And with that being said, I'm your Mori. Hope you'll remember me, and thanks for spending tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of time with me today. Um, I will finish these up on the 11th, and then we'll open up for some more. And yeah, thank you guys so much for helping to fund the music video that I'm getting made, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Uh, when you see Bay's stream, make sure that you hit that notification bell if you feel like you need a notification. Bye, everybody! Peace! Later! Take care.